Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. This game just unlocked. It is release night and uh, just unlocked on my PS4 Pro. Gonna jump right in. Alright, here we go. Assassin's Creed Odyssey. It's supposed to be set in the uh, Roman Empire, right? You dummy! <laughs> Derek wants to know how Forza Horizon 4 was. It was great. A lot of people are saying play the female. All right. <clears throat> Small? No, I want regular then. Oh, God, I get, just got loud with the music. What the fuck? The music got, like, mad loud. Ah! Ah, my ears, dude! Ah! <laughs> Why the music getting so loud? Holy shit. It's not working. I wonder if the club is down. I guess the club is down. All right, let's just play the game. Wait, I can't play the game! Huh? Look! I can't play the game. I can't even play it. What the fuck is going on? I can't click on anything. The whole menu's crashed. <laughs> I can't. Oh wait, huh? Not wait. Enough. Of, enough waiting for Ubisoft Club. <laughs> Completely crashed. All right, here we go. Nice. Oh, shit. Potion. My poor Halloween cat potion fell. Got a nice pap. Sorry about that. Prep them back up there. Um, looks like we got... I wonder if this will have a modern a modern mechanic like the last one did. King Leonidas of Sparta. Right well, then. Tell me, Vinakis. Have you ever gone fishing with your son? Oh, no. My son's oh, into yeah. video games. He likes Fortnite. <laughs> I have to learn how to do those weird hip hop dances with him after he plays. It's very bizarre. She is choosing this is Sparta! Light attack! I light attack you! Oh! Oh shit! Oh my god! Oh my god! Holy shit! Oh my god! The brut oh the brutality! Look at this! Oh! Area of effect! A buff! Oh my god! He did the Sparta kick! He missed! 
How, I don't know how to dodge. I can't. I can't what's going on? I can't attack. Holy Jesus. What is that? What the fuck is that? I couldn't attack. I still can't attack. Look, X doesn't do anything. Look. X doesn't do anything. Square dodges. Oh, uh, X, I can't attack. My attacks are glitched out. I can do a buff, and I can do a Sparta kick, and I can do the dashing stab. That's all I can do. I can't do a light attack. It's glitched. Oh, there we go. It's L1. Never mind. I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> okay, L1. There you go. Fuck him up. <laughs> Take that! Ah! Take this! Take this, you fuckhead! I'll see you in hell, boy! Extra stuff for you! And a stab for you! Yes! Ha uh -huh. I'm stabbing my own troops! It doesn't matter! On the field of battle, friend and foe meld together like peanut butter and jelly! You just keep thrusting! Yes! Ha uh ha! -huh. I was having too much fun with Leonidas stabbing people in the ass! I just stabbed my own guy in the ass! Look at that! Stabbing! Fuss and thrust and thrust and thrust! Yes, thrust and thrust! Fuck you. Can I kick him off the edge? Dude, I wanna kick him off the edge. It's his Sparta style. My son is more of a warrior than you. Once I'm done with you, King, all of Sparta's sons will be Nah, they're not gonna let me. Alright, right here, right here. I gotta get him to go right here, kick him off. Oh, they won't let me do the kick now. Will they let me do it? Come on, I wanna do the kick. I don't think they're gonna let me do it. Come on, man. Secret achievement, kick his ass off the edge. Nah, they're not letting me do it. God damn it. Well, I just gonna have to do little mini stabs to kill him. It's lame. Lame. I wanted to kick him off. No match for a Spartan. That was lame. I wanted to boot him as far off the cliff as I could. <laughs> you need adrenaline to use the attacks as Cactus got. Oh, I don't know anything about that. Why can't we be friends too? So press X to Jason. What the hell? Wrong game. Crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. Okay, normal difficulty for the game, Let's yes. Let's take this one step <clears throat> at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. Ah, so there's two modes I heard about this. So guide mode is normal. Exploration mode, basically there's nothing in the world to tell you where to go. You just have to wander everywhere to figure shit out. You don't even know where your missions are and shit. Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> a more traditional experience, markers are displayed at all times, and quest objectives are given to you automatically. Why would I want to do exploration mode where there's no fucking icons anywhere? That's stupid. Yeah, fuck that. Give me as much <laughs> as fuck that. There's no way I'm going in there without some... All right. Hey, there's actually something funny. Snake Pliskin in the stream chat just said, you know, if I was still 12 years old and I had unlimited time to play video games, I'd probably do exploration mode. But yeah, you know, I've got so many games to play this year during this busy gaming season. If I had just this game to sit down and experience, maybe I would do exploration mode, but nope. So a lot of people have actually been asking me to play Cassandra. Now, there has not been a, a female protagonist for Assassin's Creed since, what was it? Wasn't it Liberation? It was one of those, like... DLC expansion ones, like like for a port, it was a portable game, and then they made they ported it to be a main Assassin's Creed game on consoles later on. If you remember, Assassin's Creed Syndicate had both male and female protagonists you could switch between. I think I'm gonna go for Cassandra. Everyone seems to be playing to do Cassandra, so I think we're gonna do it. So some bad so bad news, Layla. This uh, as seen t on TV Animus is pretty low quality, just like everything you buy that's as seen on TV. Probably gonna break down in a couple hours, so you better hurry up. <laughs> Ben Boxer just did a 50 pictures to play as a man. Too late. Too late. Oh! I'm sorry. A I, lion! I, I, no, it's oh. okay. Assassin, la 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 la. The wings of the eagle. On the wings of the eagle, baby, yeah. The eagle, baby, yeah. I just see it here playing with my spear. It's a normal day for me. Ha ha ha. Shit face. Ah. Get down here. That was nice to call a woman a shit face. What a nice guy. And I win. Harry. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. Why would I Perry's attacking the wrong direction? What the fuck? He was attacking the wrong direction. It still hit me. Tell him to come here himself. Oh fuck, there's a little shark right there. Shit. 
Oh my god, there's a level 5 shark! Oh, fucking shit! Oh god, oh boy. Level 5 goddamn shark. Why is there always gotta be a shark near good loot? Oh, no shit! There's a level 3 shark attacking my ass! Fuck! I'm bleeding! This is not good. Oh boy! How the fuck do I swim faster? There's also jellyfish here. Dude, why are there so many sharks? There's a hundred sharks. I just want the fucking treasure. Come on, man. I gotta try to swim around all the sharks. A hundred sharks. A whole family. The three shark stooges. I would say the shark triplets, but they're not because one of them is level five, the other two is level three. Dude, they're staying right on top of the chest. Are you serious? Dude, I swim around and the sharks followed me to block the chest. They're seriously blocking the fucking chest. Look. Get out of the way. You're annoying goddamn fucking sharks are gonna move out of my way and I can let me get this fucking move right now. Fuck you. Alright, I'm going for it. Fuck this. Go. Hurry. Hurry the fuck up. Hurry up. Get this loot. Get it, hurry, hurry, hurry. Okay, I got a quest item, some kind of necklace, and a mercenary's belt. Okay, now I gotta get the fuck out of here. Will these sharks eat my ass? Well, I can't see anything dark in here, huh? Alright. She's wearing some nice bloomers, some granny panties. <laughs> Uh, where's the chest? Is that it right there? It must be. Oh shit. Did I get it? Yeah, I got a br Athenian breastplate. Nice. I gotta get the fuck out of here before I drown. Oh, what the hell? I wasn't looking. Where am I? I'm gonna drown. I was, I was looking at stream chat. I looked back and the game pushed me in the wrong direction. Where am I? What the fuck? The game pushed me up against the wall while I wasn't looking. I come back. Oh god, I'm gonna drown. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, I made it. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, up here. Bolo bolo, holo molo. Hakuna Matata. I, I keep telling you, you, you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together, we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Mm -hmm. Cassandra, thank the gods. Phoebe you found you in time. About grapes? I can still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's beside the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Sorry, I just got a random purchase on PlayStation Network, and it doesn't say what the fuck it is. <laughs> It says $49.48. What the fuck is that? Something got charged to me on PlayStation Network, and I don't know what it is. I'm assuming it might be PS View, but it doesn't say that. So I'm like, what is this random fucking charge that you just charged me at 9, 10 p.m. on PlayStation Network? I didn't buy anything. I have no idea. What I'm really hoping is that this is, like I said, this is uh, PlayStation View that they're charging me here randomly for out of nowhere. <laughs> Uh, okay. I'm gonna have to keep my eyes peeled. See what the fuck Sony's charging me $50 for randomly. Okay, then. Um, anyway, you don't know how to make wine, or you're going to fail. You don't know how to make wine. You don't know how to grow grapes or make wine. No. You know Zuris, he's very nice. 
You know what I'm thinking? I hate to say this. Did I get fucked? Remember when I booted the game, nothing was loading? Did it did it actually buy something from a fucking menu? I almost think it might have now. Like, I'm serious. I think it might have actually bought something in that menu that didn't load. Because what else did I buy at 9, 10 p.m. tonight? You know what I mean? For $49.48? That's the randomest fucking amount I've ever seen in my life for a purchase. $49.48. <laughs> I think I might have gotten completely fucked. It might have bought something for, for that I didn't authorize for a menu that didn't load. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to check right now. Hold on a second. What the fuck? What in the holy hell? Seriously, that, that better not have happened. I'm going to be ripping pissed if this is the, just what happened here. This is pissing me off. Fucking money out of my account. $50 for something I didn't authorize from Sony as I'm playing a game on my PS4. What the fuck is this shit? Hey, Tachi said, say, Judy said, shut down everything. Uh, you're too kind to Duris. I'm trying to figure this out. Oh my god, it's like not working at all. I'm on my phone trying to use PayPal. It's not even working. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh my god! You'd better have my money, Marcos. Oh! Have to sell it, Marcos. Doesn't even work. This is fucking stupid shit. <clears throat> I get to choose a horse, huh? Just fucking give me anyone. I don't Which care. Which one will it be? Give me the horse on the left. The one on the left. Uh, a, a fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. That's probably the best horse. That's why he doesn't want me to have it. I like that one. Fuck you. This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because I'm sure. The... Everybody... Well, I got my horse. Okay. I seriously am trying to figure this out. I'm trying to figure out what was this purchase. I leveled up. Level 2. I can use the new spear. I don't know how to do this on a fucking phone. I hate mobile versions of sites that are so different from the regular versions. Because I'm on my PlayStation.com right now trying to look at my transaction history. And I can't. I don't know how to do it on the fucking phone. <clears throat> Maybe PS Store? No. I have no idea how to do this. Oh, oh. Oh, look who's back. Oh my god. I'm, I'm fucking pissed. I am. I'm angry and I'm gonna figure this out. I'm derailing my playthrough. I'm freaking pissed off. That better not charge me fucking $50 for something I didn't do it when I was trying to boot the fucking game here. Seriously. I'm like ripping pissed right now. I'm gonna find out, goddammit. Oh, oh, oh. Gonna find out right now! What the fuck is this? What is this woman in the camera? What is she doing? Or is it a guy? I can't even tell if it's a woman or a guy. <laughs> what is going on here? What is happening? No, the Sony email doesn't tell me anything. It's just like PlayStation, blah, blah, blah. $49.48. It doesn't explain a damn thing about what it, what it is. Let's see. All right, here it is. Transaction history. Yeah, it claims I did a $49.48 product purchase, but what is the product? Ac access 1. What the fuck is Access 1? Uh. Uh.
Wow, it, it actually will not show me. It won't show me what it is. It refuses. What the fuck is going on on the screen? The horse is running in circles? What the fuck? I look at the screen, the horse is running in circles, and people are going nuts. Alright, it looks like this is the recurring charge for my PS view. Alright. I seriously was like like going nuts. I thought that I had accidentally charged like $50 to my account for a screen that didn't load. Alright, so it looks like it's the PS view. Alright. Playthrough can now get back on track here. Oh my god. I gotta climb this cliff side. Where should we go now? Looks like she can climb absolutely anything. Look at this. Yeah, she actually doesn't need... There's no need for handhelds handholds anymore in this game, huh? There's not. Just... Yeah, there's absolutely no need for handholds or anything. You can just jump around easily. Look at this. Just like a bunch of sexist misogynists, you want a woman to go hang off this, this male's dick, huh? I see how this is. I'm not playing your game anymore, alright? 2018. This is a different, a different ball game. Who do you think you are? I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay, we're totally gay. Hello, Fighter NY. Good evening. And then he also did a stupid detractor meme that's not, it's not my detractor meme or anything like that. It's somebody else. But still, people come in here to do stupid detractor memes. Want to waste your life away? Focus on those negative memes. You go right ahead. Genius level. Have you got We're your family, right? Fred Flintstone cheers and shout out to Hurricane Chris Yo Bay Bay. I have no idea what he's saying, but thank you for the cheer. What is this? Wait a minute. Did we desync or something? Did we, or are we going back to the real world? What's happening? What is this? What's going on, man? What's going on, man? Extended loading screen. By the way, this is on PS4 Pro, so it seems like the loading speeds are any better. <laughs> now strike my testicles as hard as you can. Really, I'm a, I'm a man's man. Go ahead. Oh, yes. You are my greatest pride. To glory. You'll be like the Kardashians of Rome. It'll be oh. great, yes. <laughs> I cannot wait. When will you marry Kanye? Bring us much honor. <laughs> you will be famous for absolutely nothing. We will all be related to you. It will be amazing, yes. <laughs> Take that spear you're training with, throw it to the trash. And make crappy line of cosmetics immediately. This is the way to success. <laughs> yes. Just what I need to do. There's a bounty hunter tracking me, huh? I'm going to, have to take care of that. You are hunted. Bounty hunters like Talos are hostile mercenaries who will hunt you down as long as you have a bounty. Bounties can usually be paid off, but the Cyclops won't accept payoffs. Oh no. Give it a try. Well, finally we get a bow. Now, now it's really Assassin's Creed. Look. Oh! <laughs> I didn't think they were going to let me do that. She said, oh! Oh, my head. Oh, shit. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need the thrashing. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> what the fuck? Who's that? Why the fuck did that guy come after me? Wow, I can do like no damage to him. Why is this guy after me? Who the fuck is this? 
A random ass guy. A worker is after me with a slow ass punch. I can't. What the fuck? Why am I on fire? I'm on fire now. What the fucking shit? I couldn't do it. I could. I, all I could do was stealth assassinate him. That was it. I can't target him. He's standing below me and I can't target him. Look, he's right there and they won't let me do it. Everyone's coming after me. Everyone. They all want a piece of me. This is gonna take forever. He's got entirely too much health. You're just shitting for dodge. You can't do anything. The blood disappeared from his face. Who the hell washed the blood off his face? Amazing. You got knocked the fuck out. Well, it looks like Cactus got you. So when you're being hunted, civilians and soldiers will all eat in the battle. Well, that's stupid. Stupid. Oh my god, the guy showed up. Are you fucking serious? The fucking guy who's after me showed up out of nowhere. Why the hell did he just show up? He has nothing to do with this mission. He just showed up to fucking be a dick. Oh my god, man. What an asshole. And he's coming over here! Get the fuck out of here, man. Ugh. This dude won't leave me alone. Look, he's coming over here. You are hunted. Bounty hunters like Talos are hostile mercenaries who will hunt you down as long as you have a bounty. Bounties can usually be paid off, but the Cyclops won't accept payoffs. Oh no. Yeah, I'll just fast travel here. Nice. You better take a sip. You fucking sleazy asshole. Statue of Zeus. Do I need to move my face cam again? What do I need? Someone's saying I need to move my face cam again. Where can I move it? Where will it be better? I will do whatever with the face cam. Whatever you guys feel is the best. You guys gotta let me know what you think. Hello, Chris is cool CD. Make it a little smaller. People complain when I make it too small that they can't see anything. That's why I made it bigger. That's why I've been having it be a little bit bigger recently. People seem to like it. Now people are saying it needs to be smaller again. Really? All right, lost 100% life. Did you see that? Did you see that bug? She scaled nothing. Thin air. What the? I couldn't assassinate him even though he was standing right next to me. Okay. Oh yes, I can. Ready to die. I can literally just run. <laughs> they can't do anything about this. I gotta lose them. I gotta lose them with the statue of Zeus. I did. I already lost them because look, I'm regenerating my health. They're all the way down there. They lost me. Wow, what a bunch of idiots. I can go back and kill them all now if I want to. I can just stealth kill them all. Because they're complete idiots. The thing is, I don't know which one was the bandit leader. I don't know if any of these guys are the bandit leader, honestly. I can sneak up behind them and pick them off one by one. What? How the fuck? That just makes no sense. They just magically fucking saw me. Yeah, okay. Whatever you say. Whatever you fucking say, stupid game. They psychically saw me. Well, I'm sorry, that's really dumb. 
So I want to circle back and take them out. I can't because they're going to psychically see me. Huh? Explain. Why is it not hitting? Dude, this is fucking you stupid. Is it not hitting for no reason? Stupid. Hey, Corbin, hurry. It's not. Dude, fuck this. The ability's not working. It's supposed to be hitting him. It's even lined up and saying it's supposed to take his whole health. I shoot it and it doesn't hit him. Go. Yeah, it fucking sucks. Whatever. Seems like that. I hate to say it. Seems like that ability kind of sucks. It doesn't really work. It didn't work properly earlier when I tried to use it either against the fucking the level five uh, hunter. It was doing the damage, but it wasn't letting me like like maneuver the arrow the way the game says you can. So I'm not too pleased with that ability. I feel like I wasted a point. I dodged. Five thirty two critical damage. Dude, my stupid super armor double sticks. Another guy with super armor. There we go. Fucking annoying guys with super armor. What uh, did I say? Uh, <laughs> Weird. I have no idea why they were alerted. Huh? There's no way they could have seen me. I'm behind a wall. They saw me through the wall. Oh my god, this is this fucking stupid. They saw me through a wall. It's not even possible. That means the wall was transparent. <clears throat> How fucking dumb. Instant replay, please. Because <laughs> I'm stupid. I'm a retard. They use Batman's vision? Ah, that makes sense. That would actually make sense. They had the bat vision. They saw me. How? How would they possibly know I'm up here? Dude, this fucking sucks. I'm sorry. This is stupid as hell. How would they know I was up here? I somehow just lost a ton of health. Well, I have enough to tell you almost half. Now they're all after me, I'm sorry. Now I can't move! I'm stuck! <sighs> Unbelievable. Oh good! Lose all my health to a stupid fall. So how fucked up? Something happened with a baby. Someone said the baby had to die. They killed the baby. She killed the guy who killed the baby, and then the fa her own father understand. tried to kill her. Of all the places under Ilios, why <laughs> risk our necks to go there? The wolf of Sparta is my father. She's not gonna try to figure out why someone wants him dead. I guess she doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> Alright. 
So that was a pretty good intro segment. You know, it teaches you the basics. You know, you get some pretty good abilities, and now you're off to actually do the main gameplay. Nothing like a sea breeze. Does the deck always feel like it's moving? <laughs> I've got the perfect opportunity for you to get your sea legs. Oh? What would that be? Well, when the Cyclops was giving me a drumming, his pirates took my taco. Oh. I know their ship. They took and his taco? They know where they're heading. They took my what taco. Say we get it back. Sure. All the sour cream fell oh, out the side. There's an opportunity to see how your sails are held up. Increase speed. Yes, increase speed. Oh. Whoa. 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 <laughs> Whoa. Shit. Oh, uh, hold on. I leveled up. <clears throat> oh. 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 Okay, back to the sea. Whoa. I've never piloted a ship before. You really shouldn't have given me command. I'm just saying. Oh. oh my god. So yeah, this game is basically open world roaming and and, and questing and exploration via Assassin's Creed Origins last year combined with freaking Black Flag. So it's two different pieces of the Assassin's Creed gameplay combined into one. Um, although, quite honestly, the old school, oh, roaming through a European city, parkouring, actually sneaking up and assassinating your enemies, and doing those kind of missions, really it seems like it's gone by the wayside and it's not gonna be a part of the game anymore. They've definitely changed the formula of what Assassin's Creed is. I don't know if this is a permanent change or not. I'm certainly not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it's very different. For Sparta, yes. I've heard the speeches. But until that glorious day comes, we should find out what happened here. Do you have any ideas? Not yet. But I will. All right, investigation time. get a closer look to figure out what happened here. Libjan is asking, is this game worth the money so far? What I would say is, I don't know yet. So far, it's all right. But let's continue on and see if the game is interesting or not. Right now, it's it's good. Like, it's it's the stuff that you saw from Origins combined with some extra stuff, like the ship combat. What the fuck are these guys? To a man. I don't think bandits could have done this. Three more fucking Athenians. Far away. Get back here. Sparta kick. Oh, who the fuck is this? A guy is a guy is after me out of nowhere. Look. I took insane damage from that fucking fire. Are you serious? Axe. Alright, I'm not gonna go after him. By the way, is it just me? Or is this exactly like the orcs in fucking Shadow of War? Dude, it's, seriously. From, it's Middle Earth. So it copied the orc hunter structure from Middle Earth. And it copied... It has the, uh, the, the sailing of Black Flag. It has the, the open world mission structure of The Witcher. Like, this game is, is trying to emulate a ton of shit. Definitely, dude. Alright, well... Let's uh, do a different quest. Let's take a look at our map here. I can't believe it's the fucking orc, the orc structure from fucking Middle Earth. <laughs> it's exactly the same. <laughs> the pacifist naval recommended level eight. What is that? What on earth is? That? I guess we're gonna see what that is. Some kind of a different mission or something. I get it. The missing map. So what's funny is, oh, is he somewhere south of the fort? 
What's funny is if I had played the exploration mode, which they claimed was the mode that they wanted you to play, I would have to spend time talking to people to getting these clues, see? The spy is still in Megaris. He must be in the center of Mount Garanea, and he is somewhere south of the fort. I would have had to find him manually, which would have taken tons of extra time and, quite frankly, would have been fucking boring in my opinion. That's the thief. So the, the mode that they, they wanted you to play as the intended mode would have been boring as fucking dirt. <laughs> so I'm glad I didn't do it. Who the hell wants to just walk around talking to random people to find where your targets are? I just want to fucking go do the target. You know, kill the target. Master Story asked, do I like the game? So far, I like it. Like I said, it's a much more casualized version of Assassin's Creed. Very different from what, what you'd be used to from a typical Assassin's Creed game. But it doesn't mean it's bad, you know? Odysseus You're in a city. You're safe. If I hope to be remembered. Look who it is. I can't stay in one place like Cassandra. I haven't <laughs> seen you since you took me to the ruins of Odysseus. Odessa. You better take a sip. Remember? How could I you forget? You fucking sleazy asshole. You told me to live my own life and care less about someone else's greatness. That's Looks right. Like you're taking my advice. I've been forced to take care of my sick father. So no, I've had no chance to live the life I desire. Uh, here we go. No wonder you're upset. You want to be out exploring, but you're stuck here instead. I'm glad somebody gets it. If you don't like it, do something about it. Not until my father is better. I need to get a couple of things for him. Maybe you could help me. She can't climb? Wow, surprisingly enough, there's an area she can't climb. <sighs> Temple of Apollo. Synchronize! Oh, I'm a asshole! I'm funny! Wow, what, what beautiful singing from me today. <laughs> Not even close. So you go, wow, and you wave your hands above your head like Kermit the Frog. There we go. Uh, excuse me. So what have I unlocked? <laughs> I had to go up to my falsetto. Okay, so that quest is complete, but it continues. I guess it's going to be a quest line to keep going. Good, because like I said, I want to try to hit level 10 before I take out the target. Are you ready to find the whole truth of what's going on? Dude, the guy's dead body's on top Always. of the guy lying down. I knew you would. <laughs> the guy's I dead on top of him. <laughs> to to Ugh. There's blood all over it. And then I can finally follow in the footsteps of Odysseus. Oh my god. Dude, that's great. My my father's sick. Here, put out this dead bleeding body on his face to heal him. <laughs> he will suck the intestines. He will help him. Oh my god. So long as go. It sounds human. Ah. Try it for life says the worst thing on Twitch was the introduction of text to speech. Now everyone has it and it's toxic and distracting. Streaming is too much about money now. That's sad. I mean, yeah, money's a part of it. Obviously, I gotta make a living. But I'd rather share that my game experience with you guys than worry about four million fucking distracting sounds and shit during the stream, you know? Goodbye. Another pill. You're a liar. Goodbye. I'm good at lying. <laughs> yes! She couldn't do it. She couldn't do it. I loved you. And your brother. Oh! Never mind. She can do it. So much for being allied with the Spartans. You were never truly mine. <clears throat> what do you mean? Uh, uh, there's something in it. To ask, mother. Now the Spartans are gonna hate my ass. Cassandra. <laughs> Damn, I wonder if you would have killed him. Maybe there was a way not to kill him. 
Because it said you could ask him questions. I wonder if you had to kill him no matter what anyway. Huh. I wonder if I can Spartan kick him off the edge. Hold on. I might be able to Spartan kick him off the ledge. Do it! He did it! Oh my god! Oh! I need to get out of here. Oh my god! Okay. He fell off the cliff. I didn't have to kill him. <laughs> that was great. He slipped and fell. Oh my god. That was amazing. That was fucking amazing. Alrighty then. Oh! Alrighty then. Oh! Bye, Dad. <laughs> oh shit. We'll keep that in mind. Let's go. So, as a consequence of your sparing those sick people, now everyone he died. What the hell? To do. Helix credits. Two hundred Helix credits will be credited to your account. You can spend them by pressing right in the menu to reach a store. Oh boy. Thanks for those Helix credits, assholes. What an awful, terrible. Horrible thing to say. Departing the harbor. Rogue Pixies is killing your father, get you the bad ending. Oh well. Green of arrows. I somehow have no health! What the hell? How'd I lose all my health? I'm gonna die because I have no health. This sucks. What could possibly go wrong? Now it's just me and the big boy. I mean, I was gonna get some more fucking health. I'm just saying. He almost fell off the ship. I wonder if I can knock him off the ship. That would be cool. What? You saw how far away I was? What the fuck? Dude. I was so far away from him and he swung and hit me from a mile away. That's horseshit. I got completely robbed. 100% cheating. I got 100% completely fucking robbed right there. There was no reason for him to hit me. He was not even near me. It's 100% cheating. Complete bullshit. 100% cheating. Complete fucking bullshit. 100% cheating. Well, now what sucks is, look, he's gone. So I can't even do it. Yeah. I can't even do the mission. He completely disappeared. Great. What a waste of time. What a waste of my fucking time. On your guard out here. Speed. That was fucking stupid. Water stupid. <laughs> All that work for nothing. For the stupid fucking glitchy ass combat where the guy fucking hits me from a million miles away. Okay, whatever you say, Ubisoft. <laughs> well, the entrepreneur says Ubisoft because they can't get erections. <laughs> They're always soft. They're Ubisoft. Fun. Hard. I say I was just cheered and said, get the hell to upgrade when you level up, that saved my ass a few times. 
Well, I have the, I'm supposed to have the ability when you die, you get a second wind, and it didn't work. I have the ability that when you, you die, you come back with 25% health, and then I just fucking was supposed to do it, and it didn't do anything. So you tell me, because I'm supposed to have it. Sails up! Now! We're ready yeah. to go! What happened? What happened? It glitched? Yeah, isn't that nice that I bought the upgrade, the revive upgrade that didn't do anything there, and I died anyway? How nice. The game glitched! Authentic says, can someone tell Phil he has to equip the health perk? What are you talking about? It is equipped. Look. Oh, no, it's not? You have to assign it? You have to assign it. Without it being assigned, you can't... It doesn't work. What the hell? That's super lame. I didn't know that. That is insanely lame. I don't want to do that. I fucked up. It's L1 plus circle. Why the hell is it an active ability? That doesn't even make any fucking sense at all. Have you ever heard of an active revive ability in combat in a game like this? That doesn't make any fucking sense whatsoever. Yeah, because if I'm going to go into combat, I'll assign the right things, you know? I'll assign the, you know, all the things I need for, for combat. That is incredibly stupid. Well, stop fucking whining. How about that? Grow up. Change your diaper. You didn't assign the revive perk. What? Why is revive an act? Oh, shit. Big Tone, I know I didn't assign it. I'm not going to assign it until I need it. Stupid. Rogue Pixie says, clear your bounty unless you want to fight a merc. I'll fight a merc. I don't care. <laughs> I've, I killed every merc I come up against. Besides the one who, who I, I fought with zero health on a ship for no fucking reason. Zero health. Gilded Scythe. Nicely gilded. How did someone see me? I'm above everyone, yet somehow they all saw me. Now they don't. Dude, you see, you see how it's fucking just fucked up right in the middle. They, oh, we all saw her. No, wait, no, we didn't. And then it reset. What the fuck? What a stupid system. Oh, great. He sucks. He's, a, he's fucking slow as dirt. What? That's that's definitely what I wanted. How did they know? Killed him with an arrow. Alright, so the wolf's helm is incredibly good. There you go. You're wearing your father's helmet. I just don't understand. It. Seriously, does anyone understand why all of a sudden you immediately turn and he's trying to kill you? It's not really explained at all. It's just like, oh well, now he wants you dead, huh? What? That totally didn't make any sense to me. I don't know. It feels to me like they rushed through the story there. Consulting a ghost or snake in the grass. Let's continue with snake in the grass. He's still in focus. Django Pop says basically he wants her whole family dead and he only used her to get the father dead and now he's going to try to kill her and the mother too. It's just so odd. Like, it happens so fast. No build up or anything. Just, oh, by the way, I betrayed you. I want you dead. Huh? It's not, it's not, it's, very, it's basically ham handed plot movement. Like, oh, here it is. You know? No elegance. No fucking build up. No nuance. Just, oh, fuck it. Here you go. <laughs> Devin Erasmus says, so far the plot is exactly the same as if you didn't kill your father. Seriously? So what was the point? Besides, I got the helmet now. Unless they give you the helmet too. That's kind of lame. You think, oh, this is a big critical choice and the plot's exactly the same anyway. Still want you dead. That's you know, stupid. 
Do it. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> fuck. What's your problem? You I don't fuck. Have fucking problem. What? You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> Well, so much for that. Insane. Just insanely good. I'm insanely good at combat now. Oh, really? I'm getting dangerously good at combat at this point. Flames these grounds. You what? have been warned. I hope you have a coin for the ferryman. Oh shit, it's one of the legendary creatures. It's a legendary creature fight. Let's do it. Nice. Kill the legendary animal. A Caledonian bear. Oh no, Caledonian boar. Excuse me. Come back. Stop running in circles. Come back here. What? It summoned boar minions? What? It summoned boar minions to fight me. What the fuck is this? You gotta be joking. I'm gonna die, dude. I kicked the boar with a Sparta kick! What? I was nowhere near it and it hit me. Yeah, the hit detection is stupid. Just like that guy that killed me on the bull. Like, why am I getting hit? Oh, c look at this. Dude, this sucks. I'm getting dangerously good at combat at this point. And then basically Sushi Shoot again said that boar played Dark Souls and learned a few tricks. It's stupid. Like, yeah, I'm really gonna do this legendary fight against the boar. It's gonna take like an hour to kill because it keeps summoning minions. That's annoying, man. It wasn't even like it was tough. It wasn't. Like, the enemy was not e was not tough. It was just he keeps summoning fucking minions. It's mad annoying. I couldn't even see that attack. Fuck this, I'm just gonna keep attacking it. I don't care about the fucking minions. What? The min- Look what just happened. The minions just- just did a combo on me. It's not fair. The minions all would run up and combo for three hits. I couldn't even do anything. Yeah, this sucks. Why in, on- on this planet do we have to always play the blame game? I this, honestly, this sucks. It's not it's not well designed at all. It'd be one thing if it's, oh, it's a tough enemy and there's waves of attack or whatever. Not, oh, it summons boring, repetitive waves of fucking minions like you're playing an NES game from the 1980s. Poorly designed and poorly executed. Sorry, Ubisoft Montreal, if it is you guys or whoever worked on this. These, this legendary boss fight sucks ass. It's terrible. When something goes wrong, there's always got to be a finger to point and someone who has to be responsible afterwards. The whole point of a video game is that you're supposed to be able to find different ways and unique ways to get past challenges. Huh? Oh, huh? it didn't even attack me. It was attacking the wrong direction. It still hit me. I'm dodging. I'm pressing it and they hit you anyway. Yeah, it's fucked up. The minions are worse than the fucking boss. The boss is a pushover, but the minions are stupidly tough. I dodged! I was pressing square.
Oh yeah, he's off the screen. He runs up and hits me. Loon! Another wave? Three fucking waves of minions? Fuck this. This fucking sucks. It's not my fault. The game is a piece of fucking shit. They are morons. Three fucking waves of minions. Three waves of minions. <laughs> Nothing I can do about it at all. Alright, I'm gonna equip the, the revive ability, even though it's not gonna be very useful. It only revives at 25% health. I'm gonna equip it now. Because, like, I'm not gonna use the, uh, the shield removal or anything, right? So let me equip it. Oh, really? Yeah, shield, I don't need this. I need revive. Instead of shield removal, I don't need that. Okay. <laughs> What? It got its health back! What? Look at that glitch! It glitched! The game glitched! It got its fucking health back! What a piece of shit! Gee, why didn't I get all my fucking health back? What a piece of shit! I saw it like Lords of the Fallen. In Lords of the Fallen, when you leave the area of the enemy, he'll run away, and the fucking enemy will, will immediately just get healed full, full health. Oh, of course, I didn't even tag him. The game decides to just attack me anyway. Oh my god! What the fuck? And I can't revive. Even though I have the, re the revive thing equipped, it won't let me. Holy Jesus. What is that? What the fuck is that? What a piece of shit this is. What the fuck? I told you this boss fight's terrible. This boss fight's absolutely terrible. It's like, oh, let's make a, uh, let's make a boss fight like Dark Souls. Oops, we suck. We have nowhere near the skill level of the developers of From Software. We made a terrible fucking boss fight. Oops. What were they fucking thinking? Duh, uh, this'll be fun. Duh, I went for From Software. The guy, att it attacks this way. I dodge, it attacks the wrong direction. It hits me and kills me. Fucking terrible. Absolutely fucking terrible. And I had the I had the revive ability equipped and it didn't work. Oh, it's not revive, it's just healing. I thought it was a revive, it's just healing. I gotta use it during the fight, I guess. So I am a retard. I was at mid-dodge, still get hit. Dude, what the fuck? They suck. Healed again. No, it didn't work. It didn't equip it. I didn't equip the healing ability. I'm using the wrong one. Alright, hold on. I got the wrong ability equipped. You know, <clears throat> the bottom line is, again, I can be good at games if I want to. If I actually want to take a minute to try to be serious with it, I can do it. Okay, now I can build it up and use it. It's Dark Souls without the talent. <laughs> The Dark Souls unfair bullshit. There we go. Oh yeah, from off screen. What the fuck? This sucks. This sucks. It's a, it's literally a Dark Souls boss fight without the elements of Dark Souls that work. So it sucks. <laughs> Complete stupidity of the game devs. Yay! 2018 game development. Yay! I love when you trash talk. It's just talk, and the trash comes with you. Oh, when did it hit me? It hit in the wall. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's animations of attack don't even look right. They don't look like proper animations. But they didn't finish this. I'm dodging. Look at that! I'm nowhere near his head! I'm just gonna chill out until I can heal full. I'm not gonna attack until I can heal full. And I'm leaving the fight area like it's my fault. He ran out there, not me. What? He summoned a wave of minions be before he even took any damage. This fucking sucks ass, dude. It's terrible. I'm dodging now and I'm getting comboed. Fuck this game. What a terrible fucking idiotic boss fight. Yeah, we already heard that, dumbass. Wasn't funny the first time, you piece of shit. What hit me? <laughs> Fuck this. Fuck this. I'm not doing it. It's a waste of my time. Instant replay, please. A complete waste of time. Why would I ever want to fight this fucking thing? It's it's completely poorly designed, unfair. Attack. You're not. They're not even in attack animation. You get dealt damage. He he endlessly summons waves of repetitive fucking boring minions like from the 1980s. Fuck this game. Yeah, fuck that. I'm not doing it. Fuck this game. Complete stupidity from a bunch of fucking hacks. Good job, morons. Well, I'm not doing your fucking fight. Go Best fuck yourselves. Go ahead and run. Run home and cry to mama. All right, thank you to the Guardian who reset for the 14th month in a row. He says, loving your content as always. Yeah, you like how I'm honest about the game and I don't kiss his fucking ass like most people who would play it and say that that's a great boss fight? It's not. It's terrible. It's completely poorly designed. Oh, it's Dark Souls. No, it's not. It's like, if you had the talent of From Software, that fight would have been fun, but instead you just made it completely boring and repetitive and broken. Because you fucking suck. Oh, you left the area, the, en the enemy immediately gets full health back. What the fuck? It's like Lords of the Fallen. That's exactly what happened in Lords of the Fallen. That was garbage. <laughs> We're gonna try to make this game like Dark Souls. Here's a Dark Souls boss fight. Oh, wait. The combat's nowhere as good as Dark Souls. We have fucking insta-healing enemies if they step an inch out of the, uh, the combat area. Maybe we shouldn't have tried to do that because we don't have talent. But I suck. I'm a terrible gamer. I'm horrible. Beasley Sushi says, This brings up a good point, or a good topic. If you like a story of a game, atmosphere, etc., but they does it completely ruin it for you if the mechanics do or don't work or if they're wonky? Absolutely. Absolutely. You're going to have a game with amazing, amazing graphics and amazing story, but if the ga core gameplay is shit... You're probably not gonna like the game, you know? Then if you make a game that's to totally based on story like Telltale Games, you know, you could probably end up really loving it, so. Haha! <laughs> Bowl of branches, what you should do is go buy a couple levels from the Ubisoft store. Wow. Okay, I'm the what one. Let's see what like this that? is. How could I not accept? There's a boar not too far from here. Kill it, then bring me its belt. Oh my god, you come on! This is no ordinary boy. She's giving me a mission Let's for this see fucking if you thing. Are worthy of my challenge. Kill it and bring me the pelt. I'll be waiting with your reward. God damn it, you fucking gives me the stupid boar quest. How annoying. I guess I gotta go fucking do it again, even though it sucks monkey ass. It's a terrible fucking mission, poorly designed by hacks <laughs> who think that they're Dark Souls game developers, but they're not. And now I gotta go. I guess I gotta go back and do it. Ugh. This might be the rest of the stream today. Just me fighting this fucking boar. Better stay hidden. That's a big pig. I got hit. I was mid dodge. It still said I got hit. This game stinks. I was dodging, I still got hit. I dude, I can't even do anything. Once one hits you, the others get free hits on you.
I got hit even though I was dodging. I oh my god, I, dude, I can't even get a chance to move. He's still hitting me. I pressed dodge. I pressed it. I can't do anything now. They're walling me in a, in a pack and I can't get out of the way. He's almost dead. I can't see. I can't fucking see. Now he's just leaving fight area. Leaving fight area. He ran out of it, not me. He ran out of the fucking fight area. I can't do anything about this. I got mauled. I just healed and did nothing. Fuck you. Oh no, I won! What a pain in my fucking ass. I should get this pelt back to Daphne. Ugh. Beasley Susie says, I missed the first stream. What's the reason for going back in time? There is none. You you start in the present with the same girl uh, as the first as the last game, and she gets into a portable animus talking to the blonde girl who uh, the blonde girl who in the last game was helping her <laughs> do the animus stuff. Yeah. And there's no explanation. She's like, oh, we gotta go back again. And it doesn't explain why. It's just like, oh, we gotta go back again. Oh, okay. Yeah, there's like no plot at all. This doesn't really explain shit. I've been playing for almost 10 hours now and I still don't know anything. <laughs> the story of Cassandra is alright, but it really isn't even really tying in with the other games anymore. Yeah, again, I'm not complaining. Like, I'm not saying the game's bad. The, the one bad thing about the game so far was that, that fucking legendary uh, animal fight. That I didn't like. Outside of that, everything else I've liked. I really have. It's just uh, disappointing that... A lot of people are kind of writing the game off or turning turn, turned it off to the game because it doesn't play like the old games anymore. Real talk, no exaggeration says maybe she's the son of Kratos. The son of Kratos! The God of War! What's with the camera? Dude, the camera was weird. Right? I don't know what's happening anymore. Son of Kratos! Kill the bandits. I just leveled up. Why? What happened? What happened? Hmm. So for those who don't know, the Cult of Cosmos was the old name for the modern day group called Scientology. So we're gonna have some problems here. <laughs> yes. The Cult of Cos, some say Cosm or Cosmos. Grant us cheers. Grant us cheers. Grant us cheers. Grant us cheers. Well, it's holding a ghost complete. Now we're gonna be fighting Scientologists. Delightful. <laughs> yeah, I'm serious. The Cult of Cosmos. It's not Cos, some say Cosm. Some say Cosmos. And they became Scientologists. I'm not, I'm not kidding. I'm serious about this. <laughs> and you got old, Photios, the dog's bread. Last time I saw you, I think... What is going on in the background over on. there? What the fuck is that? <laughs> my ship and my beard. These days, thankfully, I've semi-retired. What is he doing? You, you're, it's pure <laughs> Phil. You're getting the real deal. You're not getting the fake Ooh, acting you Phil. You're not getting a Muppet. Like I like to call some other streamers who oh, oh, oh. they overact for the camera and they have the dyed hair and they have to be this stupid certain stereotype to make money from kids. I'm not like that. You guys know that. For ten years I've prided myself on being the real me, not some bullshit character to make money. Dude, they're photo bombing the fucking side mission here. Alright. Yeah, they're right over here. Alright, I'll do this quest quick to end today's stream. This will be the final thing I do on today's session of 
Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Let's put it this way. Out of the two of us, I'm not the good cook. <laughs> and I know that. Kat is an amazing cook. She's made so many crazy good things. Kill the Polomar, kill the captain, burn the war supplies, find the Ogamaga Lakataka. Oh, nice. I didn't want to do that. Something's out there. No, there's not. There's nothing here. Kathunk. <laughs> yes, Shooting Star Gaming. I like the game a lot. The more I'm playing it, the more this is growing on me. I actually like it a lot better than... I think I like it better than Origins, honestly. I think the, the combat, because I get all these all crazy good abilities, the combat ends up being a lot more fun, in my opinion. All right, everybody. Hello, hello. And yes, it is not, uh... Your eyes are not deceiving you. Tonight's sponsored stream is Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now, as you guys know, I've already been playing this game. So that means that tonight, as I play this game, I'm just going to be continuing along with my normal playthrough of the game that I've been playing. I'm about 10 hours into the game right now. And I believe we're at Mount Parnassus, uh, is the name of the area that I'm actually in the game uh, in right now. And when I finished playing this on Saturday, I unlocked a ton of content. So, like, I'm right on the edge of doing a bunch of fun missions that are right in my face. So, it's a win-win. I'm continuing on a playthrough that I was already doing. I was already going to play this game tonight anyway. So, why on earth wouldn't I accept a sponsorship opportunity? Okay, so, full disclosure, guys. Yes, this is a sponsored stream. Ubisoft has sponsored it. Um, this is a way for me to basically show off their game. I personally have really enjoyed Assassin's Creed Odyssey up to now with a few criticisms I've given them, like that first legendary animal fight I didn't really particularly like very much. But outside of that, I think the game's combat is good. Uh, the open world RPG exploration aspect is great. Like, there's a lot of great things about the game that I've been enjoying, and that's why I decided to do this tonight, okay? <clears throat> so I would like to say thanks to all of you who are here. I hope you'll stick around for the stream. Um, obviously, the whole point here is for people to watch and get free uh, advertisement on the game. So people can kind of see what it's all about. Maybe a lot of you have not watched me play Assassin's Creed Odyssey as of yet. If that's the case, welcome. I hope you enjoyed tonight's two hours or so of gameplay. Okay? All right. I'm going to actually adjust my stuff here. Make sure that all my volume levels are good. I think the volume I need to up a little bit here. And I think we're ready to go. All right. Here we go, guys. <clears throat> all right. So, ladies and gentlemen, all right, welcome, so ladies back and gentlemen my... welcome back to my Assassin's Creed Odyssey playthrough. Um, we are in, I believe it's Mount Parnassus, is the area that we're actually in. Let me take a look here, if I actually just open up the map. Um. We're in focus, but I think we're, I think they were saying Mount Parnassus. I could be wrong. Uh, but anyway, I just unlocked a bunch of side content in this area. Like, a bunch, okay? And what I want to do is kind of explore some of the side content that's available to me in this in this realm here um i know there's a bunch of story-based missions that i can do but there's also a bunch of side stuff so let's actually open up let's zoom in a little bit oh i was right it is mount parnassus i knew it i just needed to zoom in <laughs> um let's take a look at our quest log because we got a bunch of quests here okay so the main quest all right i can just follow along with that oracle quest line but I literally unlocked four side quests. Four. So I think what we're going to do is try to do these four first. And, uh, and go from there, okay? Let's check this one out. Left for Dead. Okay, it's very close. Huh. Right over here. We gotta go up this mountainside. <clears throat> Alright, so welcome everyone. Good evening. I hope everyone's having a good, a good uh, evening already. I'd like to say shout out to a few people. Honest Troll Cheer said, you sly bastard. Yeah, I didn't tell anyone what game I was playing. I think a lot of people are surprised I'm actually playing a mainstream AAA game. And you may say, why does Phil manually update his leaderboards? Why doesn't he have a, a bot automatically do it? Very simple, because as you know, we have some nasty people who like to do so. So imagine someone coming in here during a sponsored stream and with a, a, a name or something that's not allowed on Twitch, right? And coming in trying to get like top cheer or top tip or something. That would not work out very well. So I do it manually. It's a lot more work, but you know what? It's worth it to make sure that my stream is under my control and we don't have that kind of nonsense. So, Poopster says he appreciates my honest reactions to the game. I will give you my honest reactions to the game. You guys know me. 
That's a lot why a lot of people watch my stuff because you know I'm always going to be honest with you about what I'm doing. Oh my god, stop fucking lying. Thanos Swaggin says that when I played Assassin's Creed Origins, I missed an, a, on a very great DLC that was called Curse of the Pharaohs. After having this, missed that while well, I looked into more DLCs for this game, I'm not sure. I'm the kind of guy I usually play the base game first, and then if the DL, if I really felt that the game was good enough, I'll consider playing the DLC. I don't really. Oh crap! It's weird because I keep thinking, oh, I'll, I'll eat the herb and it'll help me detect the, the animals. I'm like, wait a minute! Oh crap! What is that? Holy crap! A ginormous bear! Holy shit! I was not expecting this. Okay. Oh, nice hit. Oh no! You've got me! Oh no! Oh boy! I'm not This is bad, very bad! Oh crap! <laughs> a white bear and a brown bear! A deadly duo! Oh! A third bear! Come on, I almost got this thing! I got it! I got it! Oh boy! Slit the bear on fire, man! This is messed up! Oh! This is pretty messed up. Jade, hit him with a headshot. Oh, I got stuck in the corner. Oh my god, a fourth bear. At least I got my health back. I took out half his health with one hit. Oh shit, that's the deer I need. I got it. Are you kidding? I did it. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. I slaughtered four bears and then the deer ran up that I needed. I killed it and I got the, the thing I needed for the quest. What in the hell? <laughs> I'm not like that. And you guys know that. For 10 years, I prided myself on being the real me, not some bullshit character. Vlanehi? Who cheers says, we just wanted gold dust, bro. Probably more arrow abilities. I, I still have two more slots for them. Increase hunter damage by 20%. No longer consider standard arrows when using hunter abilities. Oh, there you go. That's great. That's absolutely great. I mean, I can use unlimited charge uh, shot. Was it predator shot? Yeah, I can do unlimited predator shot and not have to run out of arrows. Good stuff. Okay. My, my ass. Come here. Got him. Okay. Shit. Fire out. Oh shit. Must not burn through. Shit. This man is squirrel, so this is. Gabriel KO just reset for the 23rd month in a row and said, Congrats on the sponsored dream stream. Thank you, Gabriel, for almost two years of support. Next month, you'll get that new chat crown badge. It'll be pretty cool, right? But yeah, thank you on the, for that sentiment as well. You know, how awesome is it playing a game I already enjoy? I have been loving playing 10 hours of already, and now I get to play it on a, on a fun special stream like this. It's pretty sweet. I'm good at lying. <laughs> Bandage bracers. I have something in my eyes burning. I can't see my eyes just started burning. My eyes, look, I can't see. My eyes just started burning like crazy. I couldn't fucking see. God damn it, I hate when that happens. Alright, where's the uh, quest? Around the corner here? There's a quest around the corner. What the f- I'm in the, I went through the same area again. I only can see with one eye because my eye burns. I can't see shit! Here we go, this way. No, you didn't offend me, Dabside. Don't worry about it. You worry too much. Dabside, you seriously worry way too much. The truth of the matter is, I'm actually pretty hard to offend. It's just that people are such assholes to me that, you know, they get to me over time, but... <laughs> Stop fucking lying! You better take a sip, you fucking sleazy asshole.
Look at how dumb this guy is. Oh my god, what a complete idiot. See anything? Get back in. She won't get away this time. Nothing I can do because she stupidly won't jump over. She grabs every ledge. That's completely stupid. What should happen is she just leaps over. Instead, I jump over and I gently caress and grab the ledge instead of going over in a natural motion. It's so dumb. You can't run from anything in this game because the fucking parkour is so, is so clingy. She has to cling onto everything like a fucking spider. Don't play the Blaine game. It's the worst thing you could possibly do. So I thought this guy, the Midnight Animal, was actually being nice and having a good question, but then he just said something that's apparently a detractor meme or something. Just to be an asshole. So I'm just going to ignore him. Those bears didn't even care. Look, those bears didn't give a shit. Wow, that's weird. The bears did not care. <laughs> wow. Okay. Oh, uh, where are we going? Down here. So we got a fast travel. Yep. Okay. K Jones just did a 500 bit cheer. Thank you, K Jones, you're the cheerleader tonight. And he said, "Strong support, Phil. I know I've only been on Twitch for a few short months, but I've been a 10 year watcher since your tripod days." Yeah, man. I mean, that's what I mean. Like. Even though people are like, oh, I don't understand how can Phil still be around when his YouTube channel doesn't get millions of views anymore and his streams, uh, you know, are, don't get insane views every day. Isn't that what it's all about? Can't you only, can't you only make a living being an, a content creator on the internet if you have like millions and millions of views? And the answer is no. It's about being unique, being an individual, being someone who's, uh, you know, sticks to their guns and puts out all kind of content that people like and having dedicated supporters. That's really what it's about. I know I hate it. I'm tired of talking about the fucking money. I'm tired of it. Right, K. Jones, don't be mediocre. Strive to do something different. Strive to be an individual. You know, I'm a big variety streamer who prides himself on being able to say it like it is and tell you guys what I honestly think about games. I'm not a shill. I'm not someone who fucking, you know takes a paycheck like that. I earn everything I earn is from you guys. You know what I mean? You've returned. Oh, really? All right, everybody. Hello, hello. And yes, it is not uh your eyes are not deceiving you. Tonight's sponsored stream is Assassin's Creed. I'm not a shill. I'm not someone who fucking, you know, takes a paycheck like that. I earn everything I earn is from you guys. You know what I mean? You've returned. You dummy! <laughs> It is a glitch. It's a total glitch. None of they shouldn't have been up here and they shouldn't have been fighting at all. This guy also has something green, like a blue green arrow stuck in his arm. What the fuck? This game is all glitched out right now. What is happening? The game is all glitched out. What the fuck? What was that? <laughs> okay then. Know that, and you'll know everything you need to rule this world. Then fly, little Robin. I knew that was gonna happen. I fucking knew that was gonna happen. The dagger is mine. The Greek world is mine. No one will take that from me. Not my brother and not you, Mythos. I knew that shit was gonna happen. What the fuck? What? The game spawned four random enemies behind me who just hit me for 90% damage. How the hell is this fair? How is this fair? Yes, 
How the fuck is this fair? This is complete bullshit. What the fuck? What a mess this was, this fucking bitch. She was all glitched out and shit. Okay. So how about this? Let's kill this guy that's out in the water, and then I'll head towards the story. See where he is. Right here? I'm gonna, I, wanna, I wanna kill this asshole. We gotta go board a ship, I guess. How do I get to the water? Where am I? Where do I get back to my ship? Okay, right here. I guess we gotta invade this guy's ship and kill his ass. And then after that, we'll go to, uh... We'll go do the next story mission. I'm gonna kill these guys with my giant scythe. Knock them all off the boat with my scythe. What could possibly go wrong? There you go. Someone just rammed me. Oh, come on. Nah, I can't do this. Too many assholes. Look at it, way too many ships. Look at this. Oh my god. Seriously? Well, we're gonna die. I wanna kill the guys only level 15, yeah, he's surrounded by three fucking ships. So there's no way I could ever build like, beat him. I need to have like, my ship like massively upgraded in order to kill this asshole. So forget that, I guess we can't kill this guy. A, a fucking three boats following him and shit. Stupid. Stupid. Whoa. What is this flashback? Okay. A cute flashback. But what pertinence does that have to anything? <laughs> Uh, Chairman Caleb says, you mean back when the story was interesting and it had a goal? Yeah, it sucks that, like I said, this series shouldn't be Assassin's Creed anymore, right? It should be its own thing, and then it should have a separate Assassin's Creed series that's more in line with the plot line of the, the previous games and has more Assassin's Creed classic-style gameplay. That's what I feel. <clears throat> it's definitely what I feel, but... Oh, no, you look. We actually went back... Are you kidding me? I'm at least... The forge. I'm at least 15 I know hours I in. You stand the animus too <laughs> long. Your vitals are cracked. Now what? this is important. What? That's really important. What? A rabbit. What? 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 Okay. I'm glad I saw the rabbit. It was very important to see that. Yes. Yes. I'm ready to go back to Cassandra. All right. I'll be watching your back. Yes, I'm done trying to read your supplementary materials trying to tie this game to the present day plot line of the Animus with uh, Abstergo because it's poorly done and I don't care. I'm going back in. <laughs> Boo this man! <laughs> Alright, Kate Jones is shooting. If I wanted filler from a game like this, I would have gotten a Boston Cream Donut. Yummy. Yeah. Basically what that was, was a, a very lame attempt to get you to read a bunch of fucking text dialogue to give it a link to the other Assassin's Creed games with the present day plotline, and it's very lame because honestly this game has no link, if you could tell. It was just a game they developed, and they're like, oh shit, we gotta make, we gotta get it to connect somehow, how are we gonna do it? So, no, I'm not reading that shit. What? 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 Ugh. My spear was upgraded. Ah! Upgrade the Spirit of Leonidas here at the Forge of Hephaestus using Artifact Fragments. Upgrading can increase your adrenaline and unlocks more powerful abilities. Collect Artifact Fragments for defeating members of the cult, which I did. Review the quest menu to track your progress. So... Spear level 2. You, you gain health back when you spend adrenaline now. 
All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Not Assassin's, Assassin from now on. Assassin's Creed. Well, Tutankhamun is actually here. What's going on, Tutankhamun? I haven't seen you in a long time, man. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome. Uh, I got the fuck out of there, dude. I got the fuck out. All right, let me run, run, run. Shout out to Dick. Who cheered? He says the chat turns into TMZ when Tut arrives. It does, but you know, Tut hasn't been around for a while. So hopefully people have calmed down. I hope they do. I seriously hope they do. Uh Tut, Tut you know, has been a very supportive guy and very appreciative of the support that he's put in. So thank you again to Tut for all the support over the summer. It was really appreciated. Oh, Toon Toon Common just tipped me fifty dollars. Wow, thank you very much, Tut. Thank you, man. Baby Man Gaming just cheered, he says. Phil, I subscribed to your channel last time, and you didn't give me a shout-out. It was because Thanos Swag is timing out for a question I asked you. Even though you answered the question, I don't know why you timed me out to begin with. A shout-out would be appreciated. Shout-out to Baby Man Gaming! I was like, you're, it's your people. <laughs> it's your people, dude. Your own people who you trained and you put in charge and everything. You're complaining that they suck. It's your fault, then, dumbass. You tend to have so much energy. No. Very maybe once or twice a week tops I'll drink coffee, but very rarely. I have, I have my one energy drink a day. That's how I get my energy. Oh, snakes! God damn! Dude, those snakes fucked me up. Yeah, toxic. Holy shit, those snakes fucked me. I got triple fucked. <laughs> All right, I appreciate it. People in the chat don't ask questions like this guy just says, Oh, it's Tut back. Can I get a sub, please? That's not right. You know, Tut has the right to come and hang out and just enjoy the stream like everybody else. He's contributed quite enough in the past, and people should not harass him for stuff, okay? So please leave him alone. If he does decide to contribute of his own accord, that's great, but please don't constantly ask and harass him for stuff. Thanks, guys. Okay, let's continue. Uh, Baby Man Gaming says, Would I ever constantly interact with potential clients to lure them into contracts? No, basically what I did, I did two things. I had two completely different jobs there. I started out as a customer support rep. Shut up. No one cares about you, boy. Noisy idiot. That's all he's a noisy idiot. Shut the fuck up. That's what I would do, but then later on... They train me to do continuous improvement, which is completely different. Continuous improvement is when you look at a process at, a, at any company, and you look at it from start to finish, and you find out what takes the longest, what's the most expensive part of this process, what's the bottleneck that holds up this process, and you find a way to brainstorm and improve the process and make it more efficient. And I did that for about a year until they laid me off. Nothing I can do about it at all. All right, let's continue on, everyone. Uh, we're inside of a volcano. <laughs> Which I know it sounds pretty weird, but we are inside of a friggin' volcano. Oh! Righty then! Oh, he's level 21, great. Oh god, someone's doing firebombs. They're all level 21, this sucks. I'm stuck, I can't move. I didn't want to do this. Why does this hole- why does it even exist? This freaking hole. They're all level 21. God damn it. What the fuck is this? A dead end! 
Why is there a dead end? Oh my god. Not good. Uh. Oh, what? I'm stuck. Can't move. Wouldn't climb up. Instead got stuck in the corner. <clears throat> Team Ariuchi, just subscribe to the channel. Thank you, Team Ariuchi. <clears throat> well, that sucks. <clears throat> I hate that. I hate that when you're fighting a group of enemies, you'll get, like, trapped in a corner. And then you can't fucking move. <clears throat> Very annoying. Hobbs says that I've heard the, felt the urge to spend any real money in this game yet. No. <laughs> no. Then again, I haven't really hit any... The Bronze Club of Periphetes. I haven't really hit any... Uh... Roadblocks yet, so to speak, in the game. Maybe I will. You know what's really weird? So this game, if you play it on the exploration mode instead of this normal mode... You have to look for information to find anything. Can you imagine how fucking boring and grindy and annoying this game would be? If you have to talk to 5,000 people to get information about where all the, uh, the fucking missions are, with the map as big as it is, like, that's just lame. I can't believe they even put that mode into the game, where, oh, no waypoints, just figure it out for yourself. It's like, do you really think I have 200 fucking hours to get it to your stupid game? You know, like, I, that's just, like, complete lack of thought. And this is coming from someone who likes games with a lot of content, I mean, that's just meaningless. Meaningless waste of time. Don't give me any waypoints for any missions, please. Oh. Okay. I'm behind cover. I'm completely behind cover. Of course, behind the column. Oh my fucking god. What? I hit a fucking townsperson. Well, let's forget this. I'm out of here. I hit a townsperson. You need to be anonymous. I am stupid. Look. How am I not anonymous? Oh my god, this is so fucking stupid. How am I not anonymous? I'll pass time. How am I not anonymous? Thank you, stupid game. <laughs> I'm still not anonymous, sure. I hid for like eight hours in the fucking weeds. You're not anonymous yet. Philip is a given name derived from the Greek Philippos. There it is, it's Philippos. Okay. Philippos. Yeah, I think it's either, it either means, like, lover of animals or lover of horses. It's a weird thing. If you look at, the, like, the roots of my name, it means a few different things, depending on your, the translation. So, what lover has of animals. this man's condition? An yep, it's a fetch quest inside a fetch quest, Lav. You're absolutely right. Thanks for the cheer. He says, and then see fool to me a bug. He says, you can respect for under a thousand gold and ability page with L3 at any time. Okay. Under a thousand gold. This guy's gonna light the torch for reinforcements. How long does it take to become anonymous? What? How did someone see me? That didn't make any sense. There's no way they could have seen me. He saw me through the wall. Fucking game sucks. Yeah, stealth combat, except the stealth doesn't fucking work because they see you through walls. What a great game. I right, fuck this. Stupidity. 
pretty annoying that uh, sometimes they see you through the wall. Like there, I was completely hidden in that little area outside the door, just waiting. Oh, I see you through the wall. Fuck you. Assassin's Creed always had that problem too. They like never fixed it. They seriously never did. I hate to say the stealth gameplay sucks. That's what I mean. Like, the stealth gameplay of the original Assassin's Creed games was much better. They fucked them up for this. Because really what they want you to do is grind endlessly to be the same level as the enemies instead of using stealth, which is stupid. It's not what Assassin's Creed's about. But that's what they've changed it into, right? Right. Child. So Chrysis was right. Uh oh. You knew the rules, Timoxenos. You will suffer her wrath. Please, Tos. Please! Get behind me, priest. I'll deal with these two. Give all the shields. Okay, hold on. Wait a minute, she had two! Why are there now four? Okay. Now what? What happened? The mission didn't end. It's like still playing the music, even though they're all dead. The bow of Dumontos. So what happened to the mission? Huh? What happened to the fucking mission? It disappeared. What happened? Uh. What happened? What happened? Did it disappear? I think it did. I think the mission disappeared. Yeah, it fucked up. The, the guy disappeared. It didn't give me the information I needed. What the fuck? He's gone. She said, stand back while I fight these guys. And then he disappeared completely. Okay. Great mission. Ah, oh, I fucking missed. What the fuck? Did you see how much damage she just dealt? How can you even have any blood left? Complete nonsense. I had full health. She hits me twice and my whole energy bar is fucking gone? That's fucking broken, dude. Come on. Why is there a level 21 enemy outside of a level 19 mission to begin with? That was stupid. That was fucking stupid right there. That was completely stupid. Stupid. <laughs> I killed the one fucking guy super easy. Her? Oh, I take insane, you know. I deal insane damage. Fuck you. And she's a tank. Even though she's fast, she's also a tank. A fast tank. Delightful. Well, what I'm gonna have to do... I'm gonna have to kill her first. Hit her with headshots. Unless there's a way to sneak in without fucking alerting them. Maybe there is. Maybe I can sneak by them without alerting them. Go behind the temple and drop down. Yeah, maybe. Go around them. Nope, it's scripted. It's fucking scripted. How stupid is that? Stupid. Scripted bullshit.
I hate scripted bullshit. You have all these plans and abilities. Oh, by the way, you can't use any of them effectively now because we scripted something here that fucks you. Great. So, can't head up fight them. Just gotta fucking snipe their asses. CM Fool to me $2 says, DSP, how many Spartan and Athenian people have you killed and still not considered to be a terrorist and you can still take contract for both sides? I know, it doesn't really make much sense, does it? And the Paradox cheer said, kick their ass, Phil. Alright, help the crying baby. Help the baby. I told you the bow is OP. The bow is crazy OP in this game. If you get good shit, it's really OP. 4% 100 damage or 2% bow charge shot. Nah, let's do 100 damage. Dude, my fucking arrows are gonna be insane. They're gonna be absolutely insane damage. Now. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Another 20% damage boost to Predator shot? And it's gonna stack, isn't it? Oh my god, I got 40% damage boost to Predator shot. Are you serious? Oh my god, I could do it again? I hope this stacks. Dude, are you crazy? I have 60% damage boost to Predator shot. Oh my god. Alright, let's sell some stuff. Time to save. I didn't save all day today. Holy shit, I just realized. I didn't save it all today. Here we go. So, we're about 17 and a half hours in right now. Pretty good. Got him. Piccany says, is this how ancient Greece actually looked? I don't know. I didn't live there. <laughs> I didn't live at that time. I wouldn't know. Yeah, they have no idea. Huh? How did that make sense? Whoa, it glitched! Did you see that? It glitched. Great glitchy shit. That wasn't my fault. That was the game fucking up. You can't blame me for that. He teleported through. I'm stuck. I can't get past this ba baskets. I can't get past the tables or baskets. What the hell? What? The women punched me. <laughs> okay, then. Got him. Where does body go? There it is. All right, I'm out of here. Clear the leader house pretty easily. Why don't you use the predator shot's the best thing for sure, man. A level 19 chicken. Yes, level 19 chicken. <clears throat> what is going on? What's people talking about? What happened? NPC is a right wing meme? If someone calls you an NPC, it's an insult. What? To be called a non player character is a right wing meme? What fucking planet do we live on? What? On top of the Acrocorins. That's what I'm looking for. That sounds pretty stupid to me. I don't know. Anyway. Hello, Kate. Good to see you. It's a 4chan meme. Oh, boy. I want nothing to do with 4chan, so... <laughs> Keep me out of that shit. <clears throat> Better to not know what's going on with that, then. I completely dominated 4chan and butt-fucked 4chan. I completely dominated 4chan and... Fuck, fuck, 4chan. By its size, Hello, Murdoch. Good to see you. A small thing may very well make a huge impact. Listen to all these innuendos that he's saying. <laughs> all right. Who am I giving the package to? <clears throat> There's a man named Vardas. <sighs> that guy, like I said, everything about that guy is freaking stupid innuendo. Written for like a five-year-old. <laughs> all right, maybe like a 13-year-old. <clears throat> Look at the gorgeous view. It's a gorgeous view.
Talk to Phoebe. What the hell is she doing here? Oh my god, Phoebe is here. And excessive loading for a cutscene. <laughs> Those PS4 Pro loading times. Shh. What are you doing here? I heard the Mali's talking about her crazy client earlier, and I wanted to help. Okay. You may be right. I could use you. See? That was my plan all along. I'm going to talk to Damalis' client and see what he has to say. I've been here, spying, and I heard him mumbling to himself. He's weird. <laughs> Maybe if I tell you what he said, it could help? Did I ever watch Gravity Falls? No, I've not seen Gravity Falls at all. Time to act. Listen closely. You sneak inside and see what you can find in his house while I distract him. Quiet like a mouse. Good. But if you get caught, run. Right out the door. We'll meet afterwards. Promise? I'm ready. Let's go. What could possibly go wrong? They have a secret letter to give you. And that's where you're wrong. You have nothing on me. Nothing? But... Wait! <gasps> thief! Thieves! Get out! Guards! Get them! Kill the client and the guards. Oh my god. Oh no. I got stuck on a statue, a giant, a giant leg. Nothing on me except the giant fucking mace. Oh. Okay, that was easy. Holy, the arrows are too good. This fucking predator shot is gonna be the rest of the game for me. Just insta killing everyone with predator shot. I should find out. What's happening in the mysterious house? So, uh, Ratchet fan actually asked me, "What do I think about the game? Is it good?" Because he hasn't been watching the playthrough. Let me put it this way. It doesn't feel like any more like Assassin's Creed at all. It doesn't. It's like an open world action-based RPG. And it's fun, but it's definitely different. Um, I need to stay hidden. So that being said, I like it. But I'm actually hearing that printing up, coming up pretty soon, I'm going to have to grind a ton. Which is not good. Obviously, I don't want to have to grind a ton. But I'm kind of being told I'm going to have to. So I guess we'll have to see what happens. What? It says I missed twice and he was right in front of me. Who's the cleaner? Dimitrios the cleaner. Immediately attacks, even though he's supposed to be in a stagger animation, of course. For the cleaner. I want that Level 20? Oh my god, they just keep showing up. I can't climb here, great. I can't get away, you gotta be fucking... Of course. Why the fuck is there a lion down there? There's a fucking lion there for no reason at all. Amazing. Confirm kill? What the hell was this a cultist? This was a cultist? It was a cultist. <laughs> yes, WJR. Um, uh, pre I am aware that Red Dead Redemption 2 preloading starts Fridays, but. I can't afford, right now I have to buy Soul Calibur 6, then I have to buy 
the DLC for Spider-Man, so I can't even get it yet. I, I seriously can't. I need to get. I need to make more money on tips and stuff in order to afford it this next coming week. So I won't be preloading it that early. So now I expect that people will say, "Oh, Phil's in trouble. Let me throw him money." I need a dollar, a dollar. Thanks for the money, dummy. One of our girls didn't meet me for prayer this morning. She wasn't at home either. I'd go investigate, but I'm not sure what I could do on my own. She might have been taken. I asked around. One of our clients said he saw Cleo brought aboard the ship. Oh, boy. The were armed, so there was nothing he could do. I'd pay a lot of Someone kidnapped her ass. <clears throat> Take me to the ship. Potion, no! We'll get Cleo back. No! Who do you think took her? Potion's been falling a lot today. <clears throat> okay, um, this way. There, that's the boat our client described. Oh yeah. Please, get her back safely. Hmm. Well, I need a boat. I see one over here. See, it says, Claire will die if the ship is destroyed, so I need to storm the ship. Oh, my God. I need to storm the ship via a little boat instead of a, a giant ship. So I got to use this to catch up to it. Here we go. All right. What the fuck? I went the wrong way. All right, here we go. Ah, Redox says, what if Potion's an Abstergo spy? Potion's an Abstergo spy and Bone Meal the whole time was working for the assassins. He was trying to protect me. Who knew? <clears throat> what the hell? <clears throat> I fucked up doing it this way. Oh, really? Nah. I'm pretty fucked. I was supposed to summon my boat, I guess, but I didn't realize that. So... Oh! My boat just broke, and now I'm fucking drowning. What the fuck? My boat broke. Oh, shit. I can fast travel to the Forgotten Isle. And then maybe I can go catch the boat. The... Jay Bowler, the costume for Halloween... It was the pole tied between classic Hollywood movie monster or celebrity, so I'm going to get the costume this weekend, depending on what I can find. <clears throat> One. <laughs> yes. Hello, my children, and welcome <laughs> to my Halloween stream for 2018. How are all of you? I hope you're ready for a day full of spooks and goblins. Many happy little mistakes that will touch up today during the course of today's stream. Yes, everyone, a little happy little cloud over here and a little smiley face over here, yes. Duh. And with me today, I have the lovely cat on stream. <laughs> say hello, honey. No, you're not going to say hello? No! Okay, fine. No! Hello, no! everyone, and welcome, yes. Yes, many of you today no! have shown up already. There he goes. How the fuck do I summon my ship? I don't know how to summon my ship. I have no idea. How do you do this? How do you summon your ship? I don't know. Someone said you could, but I don't know how to do it. You have to be at a port? Oh my god. I don't think there is a port on this island. There's a tiny rowboat there. That's it. There's no port. Ugh. Maybe I can head it off here. I'm gonna fast travel here, and then I'm gonna see if I can head it off. Pretty ballsy just cheers that I should be the Frankenstein monster. I was thinking about like what would be a, 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 an outfit that I could do, but I could still gain. Cause there's the thing like yeah, I could dress up like Frankenstein. But then how the fuck do I play games? You know what I mean? Like, I'm gonna have, like, makeup on, and I'm gonna have a fucking headphones on. 
Like, how would I do it? You know what I mean? So I gotta think. I gotta see what they got, and see like what's viable for playing games while I'm wearing it. Okay. All right, any day. Where do I jump down? There's nowhere to jump down from here. I have to get to the water. What the fuck? She can't climb this wall? What is going on? So there it goes. Can't climb up here for some reason. What the fuck? It's gonna get away. <clears throat> Here we go, I'm gonna go straight toward it. I do it. I cleared the shit. Now how the fuck do I get inside? <clears throat> Crazy Dream did a 500 bit cheer. Says Adam family. I could be Gomez. I can't could be Morticia. Duh. I don't know how to get inside the ship. Glitch out? <clears throat> I think it glitched. I can't get inside the ship. Pour the pirate ship to rescue Cleo. I did. Murdoch, you're not supposed to sing it. It blatantly says if the ship's destroyed, you can't complete the mission. Uh. fucking weird. Who's this? It is glitched. It's glitched out. It's completely glitched out. The game glitched! <sighs> this sucks. Voltage Max says you were supposed to board it with your ship and crew. Well, that's stupid. I fucking did it myself. And the game doesn't count that? That's bullshit. That's fucking bullshit. That's 100% bullshit. I kill all of them and it doesn't count. That should have counted. I guess I need to get my ship and board it. I'm a retard. Rover stamina. The hull. I could put a new lieutenant on the ship if I use this. The problem is it uses so many fucking resources. Look how many resources it takes, man. <clears throat> oh, 
All right, we gotta get this ship out there so we can take over the ship that I fucking marooned right there by killing the whole crew. All right. Fire breezers. Build up firepower with regular attacks and use it to unleash fire attacks with fire arrows. The cult, Herodotus. They're worse than we thought. What do you mean? Not we need Eros's blessings to be picked. Oh you my hope god. To marry into it's so much osadistic, so sexist. Those feelings are for Etios, not his wealth. Yeah, right. Even if your feelings for him are real, they get stronger with Rahmin. Nah. <laughs> I really am in love with him. You better start praying like the rest. Twitch staff is here, says Rockstar, okay? Well, welcome to Twitch staff. I don't know why people always freak out when Twitch staff show up on a stream. Twitch staff has been on my streams many times. <clears throat> many times. Alright. Very nice. So I will update the leaderboard shortly with Tut there at the top tipper. Okay. What happened? Where is Cleo? She's safe. Your friend is safe. Tut says the bunny's been charged back. Well, I have no no idea. I'm playing a stream. I haven't gotten any notifications yet. <clears throat> Trying to get my emails to update here. <clears throat> Why would the money have been charged back? Your bank declined it or something, Tut? Because apparently it went through. I'm not seeing anything yet, but I don't think my emails have, uh, synced, so. Anything in here? If you're wondering why I took down Tut's tip, because he said that it got charged back, I checked, and it's not even showing as being valid in my PayPal account ever. Like, it doesn't even show up. Therefore, I don't know what happened, but obviously I reverted it, because I'm not going to have him up there if the, the tip didn't count, and apparently it didn't, so. That's all that happened. Easy come, easy go, I guess, right? Okay, so, what's next? Yeah, Tut, he says, why are you getting that money? The bank called us to me and said they're charging back. Right, Tut. So it didn't work. It didn't count at all. I, w I looked at my PayPal account. It shows nothing at all like you had never even sent anything. So there you go. Apparently it did. It went, it's, you know, it's being reverted for whatever reason. I don't know. Honestly, don't really care. <laughs> Just gonna keep playing. The Nemean Lion. There's one of the legendary animals is there. The Nemean Lion. Why the fuck don't I see it? Am I blind? Uh, so what the fuck did that do? You gave me some experience. That's about it, huh? <clears throat> Spear upgraded. Amazing. What did that do? It didn't even tell me what it did. Oh, man. They want me to get seven fragments. Good lord. Seven fucking fragments. Well, I'm gonna see if I can kill this one right here. I'm level 21, it's only level 19, so this might be an easy one. <clears throat> cat is fine. Do ask people ask her house cat? Cat is fine. She's at work right now, actually. We are trying to see if Cat can make it for the Halloween special. If she can make it and hang out with us, you know, all day on stream would be really awesome. It's not clear yet if she can, but we're waiting to find out. I think it's just funny because people are like, oh, Phil, what, what's up with Cat? We haven't heard from her in a while. Yeah, on purpose. Like, we purposely don't want to mix my personal life with what I do on stream because people will be gross about it. You know what I mean? What the hell happened here? The animal chasing me. I'm running. But yeah, you know, I don't want people saying nasty stuff about my about Cat. And we just want to have our own life. Is that bad to have your own life separate from fucking streaming? You know what I mean? Like, what, what's the... What's the issue here? I'm a little confused. Just because I didn't used to do that, I didn't used to separate my work life from my personal life doesn't mean that I can't do it. <laughs> Higgany says, I think you should tell us your private life but instead do more vlogs. There's no reason to do vlogging. What am I vlogging? There's something going on to vlog. <laughs> you know what I do every day. I'm here playing games with you guys every day. There's nothing to vlog. There's nothing interesting to vlog at all. 
Okay, this was someone else. Thank you very much to the anonymous tipper. This is legit. $50 tip. Thank you very much. I don't seem happy about a $50 tip. I'm very happy. Thank you very much to the anonymous tipper. I appreciate it. It's helping me a lot. That's going to help me. Well, already, uh, I should be able to afford Soul Calibur 6 because of the tipper last night. This is going to help me with the Spider-Man DLC next week and help pay for Red Dead. So thank you very, very much. Gee, thanks for the money, dummy. More adventures. Oh my god, this is just like fucking... Dude, this is exactly, seriously, exactly like Shadow of the Tomb Raider. There was a blind guy in a town. He wanted you to go explore tombs and tell him about the tombs. It's the same I'm not much quest. of a storyteller. Goodbye. Easiest kill ever. Some of these cultists are super easy to kill. That's the end. Stabbed him in his nuts. So apparently this legendary thing sucks. Alright, where do I want to go next? There's apparently a level 22 Merc right on my ass here. Right here there's one on this island. Level 21. The Isle of Salami. <laughs> the Isle of Salami. It's actually called that. What the hell? Okay, the Isle of Salami. This is where I'm going. I guess maybe I should fast travel here. Yeah, to the ancient forge and just sail south. Okay. I gotta kill this guy first. The Isle of fucking Salami. Who the hell wants some Salon? Isle of Salami. I have no health. What happened to my health? My health all vanished. Yeah. It was bullshit. Oh, I went from full health to zero. I don't even care if that was a fucking leopard or whatever. That's bullshit. My whole health bar just vanishes instantly. Fuck you. Lazy game design. Yeah. Uh-huh. Not shooting arrows, nothing. Just insane lo health loss instantly. Okay. <clears throat> well, it doesn't even matter now. Let's hope no one notices me here. Wait, what? What? The cult... What? The cult member's back alive. No shit. What the fuck? The cult member is alive again. What the fuck is that? Why? I have to do the whole thing over for no fucking reason? This doesn't make any sense at all. Why do I have to kill the cult member again? That was fucking stupid as shit. Fine, I'm just getting the fuck out of here. I'm not dealing with it. I'm not dealing with the game fucking up and telling me I have to do it again. I'm swimming out of here. Oops. Dumb. Okay. Fast travel, then I'll jump on my boat, and I'll go down to this next island for the next quest. That was really stupid. STUPID! Enough of this nonsense. On with the story. Alrighty.
Oh, alrighty. That douche kid just shooting says, is there any chance you ever allow YouTube comments again? No. There's no point. YouTube is a toxic environment full of immature people who just want to fucking be nasty in the comments. The people who like to watch my stuff watch it now and enjoy it and they don't need comments. Yep, I'm toxic. Why am I toxic? What? It's been a, a year, over a year since I turned off comments and there's been nothing but positivity regarding that change. So there's no way I'm going back. I'm not an idiot. Hey, that douche kid, you should stop ne mentioning negative shit, dude. It's against the rules to be bringing up the stuff you're bringing up, so stop. Like, overly sensitive. I did have her until she fell, you saw that, right? This is bullshit, I can't move, look at this bullshit! Dude, I'm gonna die because of, look at this nonsense! I can't, I can't fucking use my arrows! What?! Where the fuck did all they come from?! Get the fuck out of here, you stupid fucking game. Get the fuck out of here, dude. Get the fuck out of here. A hundred guys show up out of nowhere. Fuck your mother. <laughs> well, Bradford did 104 bit cheer and he said, How's it going? Oh, uh, let's see. I have been avoiding exposure to this game, but I really don't think it was worth it last year. Fucking sucks. Basically, that that creature, that what is it? A fucking whatever it is, a leopard is broken as hell. It's completely broken. It you can't hit it, yet it hits you for insane damage. It's fucking completely broken garbage. Uh, yeah, no, the game is good. It's just sadly, as open world games do, they have flaws. This game has, a, has certain flaws that annoy me. But in general, I haven't enjoyed playing the game. What, look, the anniversary comes in running full fucking speed. What is this? Look at this stupid shit. I'm here to collect that bounty. I'm dodging. I'm dodging. I'm prison square. It even showed the dodge come out, but it came out late. Not my fucking revenge. Oh, this is a cultist? Confirm the kill? Or is it just a high level mercenary? No, it's a high level mercenary. Alright. Why am I poisoned? Why am I poisoned? Someone- There's another mercenary appeared out of thin fucking air. Literally just appeared out of thin air. What the fuck? The person did not exist and then appeared magically. Are you kidding me? Oh, there's a fucking a wolf after me. What is this stupid shit? I have no health, even though nothing poisoned me. Oh, 
What the fuck is going on? Well, I'm gonna heal. Yeah, I was nowhere near the poison cloud he was casting, but I was getting poisoned anyway. Why the fuck don't I see it? Am I blind? What? I didn't even do that. Once again, I have no health. What the fuck is this? Oh my god! He just keeps doing his spams poison. You can't do anything about it. Look, another animal? Dude, so during that fight, a cheetah, a boar, a wolf, and then a lion spawned during that fight. What the fuck is going on? Why is the game so fucked up? What happened? The game is completely fucked up. It's not supposed to be spawning mercenaries and animals on my body as I'm fighting. This is fucking dumb as shit. <laughs> so dumb. What the fuck? This is the problem with open world games. They get glitchy as fuck. This is not supposed to be happening. <laughs> Stupidity. Look, now the mercenary ain't even here. I knew it. I told you it wasn't supposed to happen, it was just random garbage. That shit wasn't supposed to happen. For some reason, it spawned a mercenary on top of my body. That wasn't supposed to happen. He was supposed to spawn somewhere else and come find me. Not spawn on me and be attacking me already. Dumbass game. Bradford's- yeah, I know he had poison tipped at arrows, Bradford. The point is, he shouldn't have been there to begin with, and I shouldn't have had four other fucking animals attacking me at the same time. It was broken as hell. I don't see any soldiers here. Daniel Swag is true, he said Assassin's Creed Primal. <laughs> what the? I am anonymous. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> nice side roll I can't hit him he's dodging perfectly this is fucking stupid how is he causing pools of poison when I'm attacking him I missed, even though he was right in front of me, yes. Instant replay, please. He shouldn't be able to cast fucking clouds of poison under his fucking legs as I'm stabbing him. This is stupid. How can I help you? Still short. Here, fuck these stupid shoes. I need 500 Come left. Back anytime. 500. No, I have enough now. Holy shit, if I can I do can it. Help you again, let me know. I'm done. I can go right back to the. I don't have to do any of the side missions at all. There's a ton of side missions here to raise money, but I could just skip them all. Nice! Fuck all that shit! It's actually good I had mercenaries coming after me. I was able to kill them all back to back to back. <laughs> Drake? Alright, so we gotta go to Athens. Back to Athens. Why do I never see the quest mark? I marked the quest, but I don't see the quest marker anywhere. Seriously, what the fuck? I never see it. Where is the 
fucking quest marker. Why can't I see it? I can never see it on this fucking map ever. I never see the quest marker. Return to Athens. Where is it? It's not here. Look. Fuck it. I'm gonna kill the centaur just because I can. Since I can't find Athens. Daniel Swaggin Street said, I got three crunchy tacos for Taco Bell, one came broken. Dude, half the time when I get crunchy tacos for Taco Bell, they're fucking broken. Did anyone see it? I didn't see any fucking marker on my map. I can't, I can't see, see shit. shit. Why the fuck don't I see it? Am I blind? I'm not sure where the fuck this is gonna be. This might be a cave again. I think this is gonna be a cave. Yeah, there's definitely a cave around here somewhere. Now it tells me I'm going further away, but I don't know how to get to this fucking target. I don't see a cave anywhere. Yeah, I know. How the fuck do I get to that? I don't see an entrance or a cave anywhere. What the fuck? This is annoying. This really stinks. They should tell you how to get into it and fucking get them. Because this is a dead end. Look. Yeah, this isn't it. Oh my god. This is going to be so annoying. The bird doesn't see shit. Yeah, the bird sees fucking nothing. This is dumb as fuck, man. Oh! Come on, man. I just wanted to do this quickly and then go to Athens. No. It's gotta be a major pain in my fucking ass. Play those video games, bitch. <laughs> nothing can be done fucking quickly. Nothing. No cave here. Oh my fucking god. I'm getting pissed now. This is stupidity. It's not my fault. The game is a piece of fucking shit. They are morons. What's the point about getting the clue about the cultist if you can't kill the cultist? It's a complete waste of your fucking time. There's no cave. Oh my god. The whole point of the fucking bird is to find this shit and it's not finding anything. It's fucking worthless. I'll try this. Maybe it's on the other side, maybe. Way the fuck over there, maybe. Ugh. Amazing. Cody Carl says the bird's a dumb gimmick. I mean, it's kind of weird the bird is literally identical to the last game. They didn't even try. There's nothing new about this fucking bird. This must be it. The abandoned mine. Say good night. Well, this will be fun. Oh yeah, it'll be fun, all right. Fun for me. Don't worry. Why are you here? So much for that cultist. Alright, I finally fucking got to where I needed to go. I finally saw the fucking waypoint. Thank God. 
<sighs> so much junk mail today. A lot of fucking bullshit copyright stuff on YouTube. Good Vibe City just chased and enjoying the stream. The Greeks had a lot of gods. What would DSP be the god of? The god of rage. I don't know. I don't know. The god of flatulence. The god of doilies. I would be the god of doilies. There you go. What the hell? What happened? Look! What happened? What happened? What happened? It loaded, it faded like it was starting, then it went back to a loading screen. What the fuck is this? What? It's saying I missed. Sure I did. What the f why is this dog so tough? What the fuck? Where did a bear come from? Where the fuck did a wild bear come from? What is this? And it's only coming after me. A bear is in the city. It doesn't make any fucking sense. None of this makes any sense. Shut up. No one cares about you, boy. Fuck this. The bear can't climb up here. I can't see. Fuck this. No! Why'd she fire? Oh, it worked anyway. She fired up. I didn't want to do that, but it fucking worked to kill one of them. Great. Now the townspeople are attacking me for no fucking reason. Oh my fucking god! Look, they're all attacking for no fucking reason. Fuck off! The bear is alive? The bear is alive, but it's glitched. The bear is alive, but it's glitched sitting up. Look. The game glitched! What? I don't know what happened. I didn't fire yet, but the arrow released. Well, couldn't aim at all. Whoa, there he goes. He died from the fall. He died from the fucking fall. Okay, then. Pretty funny. All right, next story base mission is over here, so we'll head over there and probably sit, uh, save the game. The bear is still stuck, dude. The bear from before is still stuck in a sitting position. Look, he's still fucking stuck on his ass. Look. Oh, now he's unstuck. Okay then. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Assassin's Creed uh, Odyssey. Actually, what I'm going to do, if I remember correctly, sometimes the mission objectives are right there, so I'm going to have to move my webcam. Um, yeah, been a little bit since I played it. I'm hoping for a couple hours of advancement tonight. Looks like we got a fucking guy after me here who's like insanely high level. Level 44! Oh, that's really fair to have a level 44 guy after me, huh? Monkey Spy asks, am I going to get story DLC for this game? Hell no. <laughs> Hell no. The game's too long in itself. I'm not going to buy any fucking DLC for it. This was...
<laughs> going for flying. You gotta be kidding me, is it a level 44? I hope not. No, he's level 21. Yeah, I dodged. What the fuck? Is there a tiger on my body? What the hell was that? I was pressing dodge. Oh my fucking god! It's on me again! Look! What the fuck? Fucking thing. I'm stuck on whatever that is. <laughs> oh, I did heal. Wow, what great aim. Number one, Myrtle? Just ask, how do I like the story so far? I mean, it's been interesting. The problem, in my opinion, is it's so drawn out. Like, so little happens over time, and there's a lot of, like, filler missions. Or filler arcs. Like, the whole arc going to talk to Hippocrat Hippocrates. Hippocrates, how the fuck you say his name. The arc to go talk to the pirate woman. They were filler. They really had nothing to do with anything. And because of that, this, the story just seems a lot more slow moving than it should have been, in my opinion. But. Well, Cat is way ahead of me in this game. I'm almost positive Cat's like all the way up to like level 35 or higher. She's like way ahead of me. She played it way more than me. <clears throat> Alright, what the Schmeck said. Shout out to Fred Flintstone. You have a dab a do. I have to do homework. Uh, do you have any books you like? Uh, not now. I haven't read a book in a long time. But I have enjoyed the works of... To the Island of Noxos. They pronounce Phoenix, Phoenicos. I would ask, please, guys, no wrestling spoilers at all in the stream chat. Only because many of us watch the shows later on. And uh, I cannot watch it right now. I'm obviously streaming. So please, no spoilers. The person who made this part of the game is a worthless human. And should be actually disposed of. Put into an fucking incinerator and burnt to a crisp. I hate worthless humans. If you worked on this part of the game, you're a worthless human. Go kill yourself. Go fucking kill yourself. Jump off a fucking bridge or something. And do it in the dead of night so no one tries to save you. Because you don't deserve it. Worthless humans. Worthless humans. There are too many people in the world. It's pretty obvious the world's overpopulated if someone got paid to fucking program this part of the game. Worthless humans. I want to know. Send me the name of the person who worked on this portion of the game so that I can tell them how worthless they fucking are. And if they have kids, that's actually horrible because they don't deserve to have kids because they're worthless. Only people who are productive members of society should be able to have children. Worthless fucking humans. Worthless. I think I might have some arsenic or cyanide or something for these assholes. Just come on over. I'll give you it for free. Go. See how full to me another dollar says at red three the mercenary spawned out of thin air. That happened at red two for me. I was finding one mercenary, another one was right here stabbing me. Like, dude, you weren't even there. Fucking off camera just appears and starts attacking. Fucking annoying. The red colored helmets at the bottom right are the mercenary level. The more you get in trouble by fighting guards or fighting civilians, your mercenary level goes up, and then those mercenaries will come after you more aggressively. Depending on your level. Right now I'm only at level 1, so it's pretty low. But at level 2, you usually have two mercs coming after you. At level 3, they pretty much are seeking you out all the time and coming at, coming trying to find you. Shout out to Full Metal Crusader at 100 bit cheer. Is that how well does this look on PS4 Pro with a 4K TV? I don't know, because I've not played it in 4K. I can tell you it looks good right now, but this is 1080p. I need dollar, dollar. Thanks for the money, dummy. What? No! Attack camp! Oh my god! Where the fuck? 
What the fuck is going on down here? What the shit? What the fuck? There's a hundred random idiots. Crunky Kong, cheers. How's your evening going? Shout out to the to. Oh, I'm not saying that. Boy, you're stupid, man. More. Oh, here we go. Another idiot. Boy, you're stupid. With your stupid memes. Ugh. Why can't people just be fucking normal? What an awful, terrible, horrible thing to say. Whatever happened to people just being normal and not going on streams to annoy streamers and doing fucking annoying memes? Like, overly sensitive. And trying to insult other fucking streamers and shit, like... God damn, dude. In fact, you know what? Let's not have to deal with this anymore. Get that ass banned! There. Now he's fucking banned. I don't have to deal with it anymore. He's just like grown worthy. Oh my god. Okay. I'm so desensitized at this point to this shit. Alright, now Fred Flintstone, who's not funny, just got timed out for 10 minutes. Let's see how he likes that. <laughs> Let's see how he enjoys that. Gotta learn his fucking lesson. He's obviously not too smart. <clears throat> like, overly sensitive. Uh, move speed, I know you're just trying to troll. However, you should probably be, know that Kojima World Order is completely dead and never coming back due to some fun exposing that happened last year when they fell apart. I don't want to be caught here. Or was it this year? I don't even know. I don't even care. Well, I didn't mean to do that. Great, I don't even know what happened. I just lost all my health for no fucking reason. Great. Uh, DJ Runo Charity says, New AC games, or Hobo X says, New AC games are completely soulless. I couldn't agree better. Altair, Ezio, Edward, and even Connor will probably never be forgotten as characters, but I can't remember the name of the guy in Origins. Might as well could have named him Billy. That was his name. His name was Billy. His name was Billy the Egyptian. Billy the Egyptian. The two mercenaries wandering around on the outskirts. Dude, what the fuck? Where is the fucking chest? You stupid thing. I did everything here but one chest and I can't fucking find it. Look, it won't detect it at all. It's gotta be something completely stupid, like it's on the outside of the base for no reason. Remember that happened on one of the bases? The final chest wasn't even in the fucking base. So I guess I can't complete it. I did all this work. And I can't complete it because these fucking idiots hid the fucking treasure somewhere that I can't find it. Oh my god. There might be danger ahead, Commander. Enemy set to fire! Up I can't fire my javelins, I don't know why. This is great. at it. I'm usually R2 and javelins don't work. I'm doing it and I have javelins and they don't work. It does, it does nothing. 
because you see there's two meters there's arrow meter to the left and javelin meter to the right and I'm aiming and just holding R2 and nothing's happening at all so I don't know plus I bought fire arrows they don't seem to do anything either I'll do it again. All you do is get one of the ships down to zero health, board it, and you get all your health back. You can do it over. This is a lot of fucking loading. What the fuck? What great loading. Ready for sailing! Under. How you tell me what? You tell me they rammed me? Get the fuck out of here. Well, we're already dead. Are you kidding me? <laughs> already dead. Stupid. Stupidity. I almost had one already. But then, what the problem is, this is the problem because I saw Cat do this too. The ships are complete bullshit. They can wedge, wedge, like wedge between each other and they'll actually drive into each other because if you're on the same team and you drive into your own people's ships, they don't get damaged. So they'll purposely hit each other to get between and ram you. It's complete nonsense. It's really poorly made. This All the naval battles are real garbage in this game. They were way better in Black Flag, but they made it real shitty and cheesy and cheap in this game. This is one of the very few uh, required naval battles, actually. What the fuck? They started me facing the fucking... Are you kidding me? They... Yeah, Kat was very pissed when she did this part of the game. She told me about it. She was like, oh, man, where do you get to this part where you got to destroy the three ships? I was like, well, I'm expecting it. What could possibly go wrong? Ramming speed. They're running. Look at this. Those guys rams us. Fuck you. Out of nowhere. How the fuck did they do that? I can't catch them no matter what. Look! Somehow they ram us. What the fuck? Garbage. It's complete garbage. The gameplay sucks. You try to focus on one ship, the other two come after you. What you need to do is like lure one to go way away from the other two so you can take it out, and then it's easy. But it's completely, just very badly made. Really fucking badly made. Stupid. It's like they, they tried to copy Black Flag and they fucked it up bad. They're really stupid. Instant replay, please. Stupid. It's like they, they tried to copy Black Flag and Flag and they fucked it up bad. Stupid. It's like they, they tried to copy Black Flag and Flag and they tried to copy Black Flag. Tried to copy Black Flag. I'm gay. I'm gay. I'm gay. We're totally gay. Surprise, cock fag. <laughs> Every one of those boats is doubly as maneuverable and fast as yours. Even if you upgrade your boat to max, doesn't matter. They're still fucking way quicker and faster than you. It's just a really dumb mission. No, there are no cannons whatsoever on the boat. All you have are the sh shitty arrows. Shitty arrows and shitty javelins. Wow, I took monstrous damage for no reason. This is fucking stupid. So I'm about to die because my own ship pushed me out of the fucking way. Yeah, my own ship fucked me. My own ship fucked me. Yeah, they rammed it. 
Well, we're about to die. Nothing I can do. Yep. Lame. So I desync because the game is stupid as fuck and my own ship kept me away from being able to damage the other ship. Stupid fucking garbage. Swangin says he likes this game better than Origins because it has more substance doesn't mean it's meaningful. How cool is it to explore pyramids? I wouldn't, wouldn't you say Bayek is more interesting than Cassandra? Eh. I, didn't, I Necessarily, I didn't like Bayek. I thought he was boring. Well, someone took me a dollar called The Hate and asked when I'm going to play Black Ops multiplayer again. Never. It's terrible. The game sucks ass. Black Ops before multiplayer is a waste of everyone's fucking time. Hitachi Sensei choose to Shrek, it's all ogre now. No, see, the problem is, I would have been alright when I killed the second ship. I should have been able to board it, but instead it just wrecked. So I didn't get to, to get all my health back. So I got fucked. Basically, I need to ram it, but not kill it with a ramming. I didn't know if you hit it with a ram, you can't board it. I didn't know that. And, of course, the AI fucked me. My own ship's AI idiotically pushed me into the path of the other fucking ship, stupidly. Naval combat, hooray! It's so much fun in this game. <laughs> no, it's actually terrible. It was much better in Black Flag. In for the, you, just the ships themselves are so unrealistic in this game. They all handle like motorboats. Yes, they could all turn on a dime. The small ships are insanely fucking maneuverable and powerful. Sure they are. Like, just think about all the things in Black Flag that were awesome. Cannons, grappling hooks, actual realistic ship physics. There's so many reasons why it's so much better than the naval combat in this game. Oh, I played Black Flag Hitachi Sensei. It's one of my favorites. Black Flag is one of my favorite Assassin's Creed games. I loved it. I want to fucking board them. They're not letting me. Look. Initiate boarding. There we go. So I doubled my ammo now. Maybe I should be able to do this easier now. Wow, both arrows missed. Great. What the fuck was that? What? Where did my health go? Dude, I came in with full health. I have no health now. What happened? I can't see. What the fuck? Dude, I'm about to die. You tell me what's going on. Why I'm, I lost all my health. I have no idea. Well, I better fucking heal. Alright. Did on the second shot. Just needed to separate the boats and upgrade my ship stuff. So it ended up working out pretty well there. Not bad. So two back-to-back -back ship missions that you had to do, but got them done. <clears throat> There we go. Now it count. Oh my god. Here, let me switch my weapon. These are golden horns. I saw. It says I'm missing it. Okay. I just dodged. It didn't work. Yeah, this is stupid. It's not working. Just like the last fight, it's not working properly. Just like the boar fight, it's fucked up. You dodge, the dodge doesn't work. It's completely broken. I dodged, didn't work. Alrighty then. Deliver the pelts to Daphne. I leveled up for doing that. Wow. Nice. That was way better than the boar fight with fucking hordes of fucking minions and shit. <laughs> so stupid that was. Why does the lion have tiger stripes? I just pressed dodge and nothing happened. I pressed dodge and nothing happened again. I 
I pressed dodge and nothing happened again. That's the third. That's the fourth. Dude, I'm going to die because it's not dodging. I pressed it four fucking times. It didn't do anything. This is stupid as hell. Dodge, 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 dodge. You tell me, it's completely fucked up. It wouldn't it would not dodge properly. That's not my fault. That's not my fault at all. It's fucked up. Four times he's right in front of me attacking, I press square and I get hit anyway. Yeah, Dark Souls, uh-huh. It's Dark Souls. The Dark Souls unfair bullshit. Seems to be a common thing with all animal fights in the game that the dodging doesn't work properly. You gotta be kidding me, I gotta fucking walk all the way back over there. Fuck this, I'm gonna manually save next to it then. That's fucking stupid. Let me keep walking. <clears throat> Shut up. No one cares about you, boy. Lord Edmund Blackadder says, These missions are rigged by the devs. They're rigged, they're just bad. All these legendary animal hunts are obviously not well thought out. They don't even really fit into the combat engine of the game. Doesn't count. I hit him, it didn't do any damage. It doesn't count because I'm not in the fight area. You see that? They don't let you snipe. You have to fight them from down there. Interesting how they did that. I press dodge. Shut the fuck up, you stupid lioness. Now I get attacked from behind. How is this fucking fun or fair? Get attacked from behind by a bunch of minions. Look, there's another one. Annoying as fuck. What? Yeah, aim for the ground. Well, I killed another lioness. What? I missed despite me aimed straight for him. I'm pressing dodge! Oh my god. I press dodge again. Dude, it doesn't work. It fucks up, it doesn't work. Missed somehow, even though he's right in front of me. Missed again, he was right in front of me. Press dodge, doesn't work. God, these fights suck. I can't, dude, I can't aim at all. What the fuck? It aimed for another lion. The game auto-aimed for a different lion. I can't, dude, I can't aim. The camera is so fucking bad. Got it. What the fuck? What a terrible camera. <clears throat> Alright, kill the fucker. So where the fuck was the other treasure? I hate this. I hate having to roam around these fucking tunnels and can't find the treasure. <clears throat> it sucks you cannot use Icaros in these caves. Icaros, get your dumb ass down this cave and start looking around. Yes, I see a lot of people saying use, use Igros outside of the cave. That means I would have to leave the cave and fucking come back in. Do you not see how dumb that is? Uh, what's up, Kate? I'm good. I'm good today. I'm just annoyed that I just cleared this fucking cave and I can't finish it because the game is poorly made. <laughs> Which is the truth. But I'm trying to walk around here. I can't detect the fucking treasure that's obviously supposed to be obvious to gra grab in the cave. It's fucking stupid as shit. So I'm gonna leave the cave, call Icaros, find the treasure, come back in the cave to grab the treasure that should be easily available. But it's not. I gotta waste time. <clears throat> uh, where?
This fucking sucks. A waste of fucking time is what it is. A waste of fucking time. I don't know why I'm doing this. Oh, these fucking modern games. I swear to God. Modern video games. <laughs> terrible gameplay. Absolutely terrible. Oh, modern fucking video games. I'm gonna jump into this ledge face first and not grab the ledge, even though that's a mechanic that's in the game, is that I grab everything in front of me and climb it. But not now. Now I'll just go face first into lava. Well, stop fucking whining. How about that? Grow up. Change your diaper. Someone just left an abandoned boat. Look at those reflection lighting mechanics. Wow. Okitos the Great. Rock the Ice says, don't worry, there was only a Nintendo Switch in the cave, so it was completely pointless. There you go. There we go. Don't these boats, like, break over time? I think they do. Watch, like, I'm, doing, I'm going full sail, no problem. Watch it just, like, explode in the middle of the water for no reason. Yeah, watch, it's gonna break, I guarantee it. Oh, I think the boat's breaking. The boat is breaking. I'm only halfway to my destination. The boat's breaking down. You can't use these boats in open water. Then what the fuck's the point of a boat? You can't use a boat in open water. Look at this. You can't use a boat in open water, you fool. That's not what boats are for. Really? That's not what boats are for. There's a row boat in the harbor. Use it. It's not meant for open water, so be wise. <laughs> oh my god. How dare you use a boat on the water? Oh! <laughs> There's a robot in the harbor. Use it. It's not meant for open water, so be You didn't have a pair of jet skis! Oh my god, it's so stupid. <laughs> it really is. How'd the boat break? Your guess is as good as mine. It makes no logical sense at all. Sounds good. It makes no fucking logical sense why the boat would break like that. There was no heavy choppy waters or heavy winds. It should have just been fine. But no, this game says, that boat can't go on the water. Bro look, it's broken. It doesn't work. Why won't he come over here? He walks away. What? This is complete shit. I should have been able to fucking kill him, but the game is stupid as fuck and wouldn't allow me to fucking get him to the edge to assassinate him, which should have fucking allowed me to do. It's not gonna do this and waste time. Solid Metal Gear Rex says there's a way to check progression on the Ubisoft app in your f iPhone. Well, I'm not, I don't have the Ubisoft app and I don't plan on getting it.
There we go. What the fuck? Get out! What the hell? What the fucking shit? I'm dead. I can't move. The game glitched. I can't heal. It won't let me heal. The game's glitched. I can't heal. They will not let me heal. They won't let me attack. I can't attack. I can't heal or attack right now. The game's completely glitched out. Now it let me heal. Wow, I couldn't do it. They attack and it, what the fuck? I'm glitched. So I don't think this jaguar is supposed to. What the fuck? I don't think it was supposed to be able to follow you over here. What the fuck? It's on my body again. What? It's completely glitched out. It wouldn't allow me to attack. It wouldn't let me to do anything. And then it wouldn't let me fight it. I was trying to swing it. It wouldn't hit the fucking Jaguar. <laughs> wow. What the fuck? Completely messed up part of the game. Ugh. Hilarious. I didn't get it. I got robbed. I was robbed by the game. Yes, exactly. Ah, oh, Shadow Super Boss. Influencers. Did you were you guys aware of this? There's a new term now among the gaming industry called influencers. Basically, not streamers, not gamers, influencers. People who are directly paid to influence their audience to buy a game. That's actually what they're called now. Why do I get the feeling this is a some kind of bait? <laughs> Alright, third eye the third, you should really watch what you say, because I'm about to ban you again. I seriously am. Like overly sensitive. You're such an idiot for saying what you just said in the stream chat. I'm not even going to fucking repeat it. I'm seriously not going to repeat it. You think being a fucking paid shill equates to working hard? You're an asshole. Why am I toxic? You can tell me someone like me didn't work hard, but just because I'm an outspoken guy who's always honest over the years that I didn't work hard, but these fucking paid shills did, you're a fucking asshole. <laughs> you're talking to the wrong person and you're in the wrong fucking stream. Yep, I'm toxic. Oh my god, so Hordor Targ basically says, Do you think all the people who were mad at you that you voiced your harsh, honest opinion about early access were mad rightfully? And you regret your tweet, or were they just triggered that you dared to attack their cash cow marketing shill screen promoted by publishers? Both. Because what I said was wrong. What I said in that tweet in May was everyone playing uh, State of Decay early is a shill. That was not correct. What I meant to say was anyone who was streaming it early on Twitch and or putting out a playthrough early on YouTube and getting insane amounts of extra views and extra money from their viewing audience is a fucking paid shill because even if they weren't directly paid by the game dev, they're still making extra money to play a game early and it's an elitist practice that needs to stop because what it creates is artificial hype for games that, in that case, just think of the thing of State of Decay 2, how bad the game was, right? Um, <clears throat> however, I 100% fully agree based on the the amount of mainstream response I got from influencers against that tweet, yeah, they were all butthurt that someone actually called them out and made them look as fucking shill-like as they actually are. In particular, there was one or two people who resp responded, and I really, really wanted to respond to their, to their tweets directly, but I held back and I didn't, because... They have big, big fan bases, but the bottom line is all they are are paid shills. They literally only play games for money. And I, it was really bad to the point where I could have ripped them a new asshole. I was like, I'm just going to hold back, and I'm just going to keep doing what I'm doing, because we don't want to open the Pandora's box. <laughs> third Eye the Third, I am not an influencer whatsoever. I do not do what they do. At all. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, what? He has he had zero health to still survive. Alright, here we go. Do this fucking guy. First thing I do is get rid of his shield. Oh, uh, okay. No. 
I couldn't move dodge. I was out of his way. Still hit me. What the fuck? From that far away. Whatever you say. Dude, it will not target. It's fucking garbage because the camera in this game sucks. You're trying to do the fucking headshot and the camera goes crooked. I'm dodging. I'm pressing fucking square. Look. It doesn't fucking do it. Stupid game. Now I'm getting hit by bullshit. I can't dodge. Look at this. Look at this fucking garbage camera. <laughs> I can't dodge. Now I'm on my ass. Complete garbage. Almost dead. Couldn't dodge. I got him. I did it. Whoa, that was that was a cultist. Balos the Beast of Sparta was a cultist. Oh. I had no idea that was a cultist. Nice. Haseo X says any any methods or thoughts on how you're gonna grind moving forward? Doing what I'm doing. This is side content I'm doing right now. I had no idea that was a cultist. Huh. Considering this is a level 28 area, I don't really believe it. Alright, that guy's gonna co commit suicide. Good for him. Kill yourself, idiot! What? I can't move! I'm glitched! Look, I'm glitched! You fucking stupid game! The game glitched me. The game glitched! Now I have- look, now I'm losing health. Explain this. Why did that just happen? The game glitched me physically on a corner and now I'm losing all my health. What the fuck? I'm glitched! Fuck this game, man. Fucking stupid. Stupid game. Well, Ben Boxer just says they hate us because they ain't us. Case closed. Whatever that means. Wordless specimen cheese. Is it possible to bring other plush cats instead of potion next time, or potion and another cat, possibly? And Jack Sparty has tipped me a dollar. So I had a, a full health, and then I get glitched on a corner, floating in the, in the air, and then I lose a ton of health. Oh my god! Stupid physics. Whooping that ass. This is the axe the man from the roof wanted. It's pretty heavy. I wonder if he could even lift it. They're not the third ass. We didn't take a full picture of ourselves for Instagram. We wanted to see the full outfits. No, no, dude, I wanted to. That was my intention. Was we were gonna do the stream and during one of the breaks we were gonna take pictures and everything. But Cat got so upset that she just took the whole outfit off and had nothing to do with it anymore. So basically, the whole thing was fucking ruined. Cause I did. I took a quick picture of myself for Instagram earlier on in the stream, and that's the one I have up as my profile pic now on Twitter. But I knew people, more people would want to see it. And so I, that's, what we had, that's what we had talked about, what we were going to do. We were going to basically play some games, have fun, take breaks, take pictures. And by the time the second game had happened, it was already all ruined. So. Why are people hating on my bull mask? I love this. This is the best mask in the game. I'm going to wear this for the rest of the game if you guys didn't know. There, there's a sick motherfucker on the internet called Tevin who likes to illegally restream re my fucking streams and has an army of fucking trolls who are the only reason why he has any notoriety is because he copies my shit and he eggs his trolls on to do negative shit like this, to come to my stream and to basically make fun of my girlfriend and do nasty shit. It's his fault that this kind of stuff happens and anyone who supports that kind of fucking content is a mentally ill asshole who has no fucking conscience or morals. And look what happened because of fucking Tevin and his shithead fan base. And it's directly their fault 100% and nobody else's. You didn't die. You made no sense. Wow, dodging did nothing. Now I'm taking insane damage. Look how much damage I just took. Okay. Yeah, okay, game. 
Yes, within one, not even half a second, I lost 80% damage. Yeah, I can't use Predator Shot. I should be able to because it uses no arrows, but the game won't let me. Let me see something. If I craft one arrow, will it let me use Predator Shot? Wait, why do I have... Why does it say I have no arrows when I have them fucking... Uh, I have them. Look. What? It's I got the wrong arrows equipped for some reason when I never I never did that. And I don't know how to change arrow types. How the fuck you change arrow types? There we go. Down, I guess it was. What? A new quest? Thought and deed? What quest is that? I got a new quest. What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Alright, no more mercenaries after me. Ben Boxer Trees, the ring of suggestion. Once you refinance your home, stop paying the mortgage on the condo. Seven years is greater than 20 years. Uh, and that would essentially ruin my credit and screw everything up. Probably not a good idea. Just saying. I know I hate it. I'm tired of talking about the fucking money. I'm tired of it. I don't know, man. There's no easy answer to the shit that I'm that, I, that I'm in, the situation I'm in. There's just not. All right, so I am screwed because I'm stupid. Uh, 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 she can't move. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Confirm the kill. Confirm the kill. What, this was a fucking cultist. What? No, no, it was just an asshole. <laughs> I had to confirm the kill. Not a cultist, just an asshole. I saw that. Fuck you. Five, the five-year-old uh, comedy. MTC dude says, I'd like to get a group of people to sign a petition to YouTube to kick him off. Would you sign it? It's not, it's not like that. I'm telling you, it's not like that. Oh, people need to find a way to get YouTube to actually adhere to their own fucking terms of service. Because they won't because they're an automated website. That's the problem. You don't need to sign a petition or anything. It's just gotta be, a, you know, have an actual fucking human look at it and look at Oh my god, all this guy does every fucking day is restream someone illegally and make fun of them. He'll get booted. The problem is that they don't fucking do it. They're so slow to react or whatever. Someone actually needs to step up and contact YouTube and say, Get off your ass and do your fucking job and get rid of this fucking violating asshole. But they won't do it. They're too goddamn lazy. Poopy Poop Gaming, what the frick are you talking about? Like, you should do an IRL stream with Ice Poseidon. Throw his streams and allow to get more viewership and the like. I'm all ears, but become Ice Poseidon and go do IRL streaming everywhere you fucking go with your phone is not a valid suggestion, okay? What? Yeah, I should just randomly do an IRL stream with a guy I don't know who's way more popular than me and who's banned from Twitch. Sounds like a great idea. <laughs> really, it sounds like a great idea. Thanks. By the way, it would be nice if you guys could change your names to something so I could stop saying poopy poop and, and stupid shit. <laughs> I mean, no offense, but it gets a little tired. I'm 36 years old. I gotta keep saying poopy poop gaming and shit and poopster. Could you guys, like, change your names to stop having poop in them? It's grossing me out. <laughs> what is going on? What do you mean, wrong way? Solid Metal Gear Rex is wrong way. What do you mean? See, when you have a name like Poopy Poop Gaming USA, it changes the meaning of everything. For example, Shikoni Ke I can't even read this guy's name. Shikoni Ketu Shikoni Deg Joj just said, laughing my ass off, Poopy Poop getting roasted. Just think of it. Roasting of poop? It's disgusting. See, everything has a different meaning. <laughs> You gotta change your name, dude. You got to. You can't do this stuff. <clears throat> I won't deny an old man his final wish. What is it? I always promised my wife I'd take her to see the red flowers on the summit of the mountain in Zeus's playground. It's a beautiful place. Great view. But she met the ferryman before me, Mr. <clears throat> I never made good on my promise. Wow, you're a dishonest piece of crap, aren't you? Or another, you know? Children. 
war, what have you. If you tried harder, she might have gotten to see the view. Damn, shame his ass. Every day. Shame him. So, what do you want me to do? I need you to pick some of those. Hop it up, up it up, it up, it What the heck are you guys talking about in stream chat? Hey, now I should have a waypoint for the swordfish guy, too. <clears throat> why do you guys want to dab? Alright, honest question. Why do you guys want to see people dab on stream? What's the big deal? It's not even interesting or cool. Is it just like you feel like you have power over someone? Because you make them do something? I never understood that. Come on, man. You gotta dab on stream. Well, I've done it a bunch of times already, so it kind of lost the impact. Like, why do you guys want to see it again? I'm lost. Oh, yeah, so uh, update, guys. I don't know if you guys heard this or not. Apparently, uh, Tut Tutankhamen is gone from Twitch completely. His account was deleted. <laughs> and people don't know if he got banned or if he was so embarrassed at the fact that he got completely fucked over and lost all that money he tried to get back that he basically just so embarrassed he didn't want to be this bothered be anymore or talked about, so he deleted his account. That's pretty funny, though. <clears throat> The fuck? Stupid pig's after me. The pig desecrates the graveyard chasing me. <laughs> Shit's everywhere. Alright. Yeah! Fred Flintstone. She said, you mess with that pig, you get the horns, player. <laughs> get the horns, player. What the fuck? He didn't... He glitched. He was supposed to fight me, but he didn't. Look! He's posing like Fabio! Oh! Oh, you must die! Oh, my luscious locks, you must die! What the fuck? He didn't fight me! <laughs> what? He didn't fight me! That was a good glitch! You must die! Oh, wait, I'm just gonna stand here! That's what Nikio said! I'll feed you to the sharks! Harry. I missed. I thought he was working. I died, dude. The dodging and the camera isn't working. He's roiding up. He can turn invisible. What the fuck? Huh? What happened? Oh, he took over, he took 50% of my life bar with a single hit. How did that make any sense? Instant replay, please. He can turn invisible. What the fuck? He took over, he took 50% of my life bar with a single hit. How did that make any sense? That was really stupid. He does this insanity levels of damage for no reason. <laughs> Absolutely insane damage, even though he's my own fucking level. And I dodge, and again, the dodge is fucking shitty. They can still hit you when you dodge. There's some really random shit going on in stream tonight, which is why I'm not addressing a lot of this. <laughs> Thank you, TM52Twitch, for that cheer. He's trying to give me tips on how to do this, but I've, I've already beaten him, so it doesn't matter. Can I stream for one more hour now? Nah, I am. I'm starting to get tired tonight, too. I've already gone a half an hour later. I am. I'm starting to get tired. I want to relax a bit. I've basically been, been working nonstop since 10 this morning. <laughs> Streaming all day. You, making dinner. Was, showering and going right back to stream. I need time to rest. Said you. Whoa. I'll make sure that everything has engravings. I'll sell some shit. And then the next thing I can do is do all the side quests in that town to try to level up more. Not bad. What was I? Level 27? So I, I leveled at least twice tonight. Not bad. I seem to be on par a level an hour. Like, that seems to be how I'm doing a level an hour, right? So 20 more hours, I can beat the game. <laughs> yes. And Fred Flintstone cheered. So why are you so mean to NPCs? Because they're NPCs. They don't fucking matter. No one cares about them. They're put there for a purpose. If their purpose is done, you discard them. Like paper plates. Alright, so ladies and gentlemen, I don't know what happened. I've been playing for about 10-15 minutes here and nothing recorded. I don't know why. What I'm trying to do here is kill the, the leader of this region because that's the mission I'm in is to kill the leader of the region. Um, 
who's going to be a pain in the ass to kill because of where he's located. I already killed some random guy they wanted me to kill for this mission. Now they want me to kill the leader. So I'm heading over here to try to kill the leader again. I tried to do it, and the game glitched out. I was on a ledge, and the game just had me floating and wouldn't allow me to move. And then the leader, everyone killed me because the game was glitched out completely. So isn't that nice? I'm just having no luck tonight. Like, I'm having problems with the game. I'm having fucking problems with everything. <laughs> Glitches. Nice. Try to run, but I keep following him. Let me just get to the wrong guy. What? I can see him not getting. I killed the bear chest. He's a bear chest. He's a bear chest. He's a bear chest. He's a bear chest. I can't see him not getting. What the fuck? You're a human shield. What? Did you see that? What the fuck? That was a little glitch. Yo, this is really easier to keep himself fucking glitching. You're in a little fight. What did the elf come from? You're even there. I can't see now. I've all screwed up. I can't move! I'm stuck! Oh my god. What a fucking mess. Well, now I'm attacking the wrong guy. I didn't even I didn't target him, but the game just decided to do it randomly and target the wrong guy. I can't see out of my right eye right now because I got something in it. <laughs> this is great. Wow. Get your ass up. That was pretty intense. I couldn't see out of my right eye. I can't see my eyes just started burning. My eye, look, I can't see. My eye just started burning like crazy. I couldn't fucking see. The game was constantly glitching. <laughs> it was just like thing after thing. It's just nuts that it's always something. There's always something, you know? I know I could kill this guy. I haven't done a half health. If the game would just fucking work consistently, I'd be able to get him pretty quickly, but, you know. The targeting system is one of my major complaints about this game, that you can never really target who you want. What? You're not allowed here. You like a deer. I got him. What? He was in the middle of shooting an arrow. He fires it, then immediately does a melee attack. What the fuck? I can't even do that. Look at this! I'm in the middle of hitting him and he runs anyway. What the fuck? What the fuck? What? It's not possible to do what he's doing. And then she fires the I've wrong got direction. The beast in my I was aiming stage. down at the ground. She fires off into the distance instead. Yeah, sure, I mean the game. If the game was made better, and the combat actually could allow you to target the right person and use your abilities the way you want, this would actually be easy. But because they fucked up the combat in this game, it makes it really clunky and stupid. The guy's like right in front of me. I'm attacking the dude right the fuck in front of me. And he's dodging through it. Oh, I, I do. I shoot my arrow immediately. I'm hitting you with a melee attack. What? Whatever. But wait, there's more. All right, I'm gonna ignore all the really stupid questions coming in with cheers that are meant to troll me because there's no point in entertaining them. For dummy, you catch your own fast. But thank you for everyone for the cheers. Like third out of the third, Flunja, and welcome to the dab side. I appreciate it. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be distracted from what I'm trying to do here with a bunch of troll cheers. So. Yeah, DJ Bruno says, new AC formula is so good, dudes. No, it would be good if the combat was much better. The combat sucks, though. Like, you see, I can't even target the right guy. I'm trying to target the guy directly in front of me. And all of a sudden, the targeting switches to other people around me, and my attacks miss. I was targeting the guy right in front of me. I shoot the powered arrow, and it goes by everyone into the background. What the fuck? I didn't do that. What the f- what, When did I want to do this? Exactly. What the fuck? My god, this game is stupid. I'm not doing that. I'm trying to attack the guy in front of me, and look what happens. It targets everyone else. Ow. 
I have no health. I have no fucking health. Can't even see what's going on. What? <laughs> okay. Oh my god, this is so dumb. This is so fucking dumb. It's just really stupid. I should be able to wail on this guy, but the game will not let me target him. I can't hit him even though he's right fucking in front of me. The game will attack other people, and everyone hits me for 100%. Where did I even lose my health? I can't even tell because the camera's rotating around me, so I can't even see what's going on. I can't even attack the person in front of me who I want to hit. <laughs> Stupidity. MTC dude, that is a uh, that is a, a question. It depends on the situation. Yeah, would you rather have a day a day and two half days off or two full days? It doesn't matter. Obviously, two full days are nicer, but having half days sometimes is good too. It doesn't matter. It's, it's a silly question. Look at this. He keeps. How is I missing? I'm right in front of him, and I'm somehow fucking missing. He has to be for fifty percent health. What the fuck? None of what just happened made any sense. I can't move. I'm stuck in place. I was stuck against the fucking wall. Now I'm on fire, but no one hit me with flames. What the fuck is going on? No one hit me with any fire attack. <laughs> oh my god. This fucking game is terrible. Not one single person hit me with a fire attack. Look how stupid this is! Look at this, I can't- I, Look at that, I just took damage! I didn't get hit! I didn't get hit, but I took damage. This is a joke. This is a fucking joke of a combat engine. So he just keep walking backward and you can't hit him. He just keeps walking backward every attack you have whiffs. Fuck this. Alright, I'm just gonna fucking use arrows. I've had enough. When you drink on Christmas, don't worry, I will. Target Stalker says, why don't you play an area of your level? This is my level. These guys are level 30. I'm 29. It doesn't matter. If I'm 30, it's not going to be any different. Um, and Scatman Cheers said, the combat mechanics are bugged. No, they're not bugged. They're just bad. The combat mechanics are bad. If you're fighting like two or three guys, the combat mechanics are amazingly good. If you're in a group, they're completely uncontrollable. You always attack the wrong fucking person. Alright, now I have 50 fucking arrows. Yes, Poopster, you're correct. It is clunky. Holy Jesus. What is that? What the fuck is that? And unpolished when you're in a group. If you're fighting like two, three guys, you can parry, you can do everything you want. When you fight a group, you can't even target the right guy. And one guy can just walk aimlessly backward. It makes no fucking sense. Yeah, I can moonwalk endlessly, and you can't even hit me once. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I just tried to parry three times. I got staggered instead. Okay. What? He teleported through. Yeah. He, they're not actually falling. They're falling. They're clipping through. What? What the fuck? Did you see that? Where did this guy come from? What? He attacked through the fucking doorway. What the fuck is wrong with this guy? Dude, no, look at this. I have no health now. No one hit me, but I have no health. Nobody fucking hit me. <laughs> this fucking sucks ass. Oh my god. I couldn't go I couldn't climb. I was trying to climb up the fucking roof and she got stuck and we just ran in place. They're doing it again, he's clipping again. Oh 
Oh my god, look, I can't move! <laughs> what is going on? This is comical. This is fucking comical how bad this is. They thought this was a refined combat engine. What the fuck were they thinking with this game? Now I'm fighting a wall of fucking shields. Oh, now I gotta run again. Look at this! What the fuck? A hundred guys over here! <laughs> oh, yes, yes! They hit me with that! They hit me with that arrow. Fuck this game. Fuck this fucking game. How stupid. Complete stupidity. <laughs> Alright, thank you guys for your cheers, but again, a lot of these are trollish messages I'm not reading. They're just fucking stupid. How was I seen? How was I seen? It doesn't make any sense. They saw me through a wall. Okay. This fucking sucks. What? I didn't do that. I'm holding forward. She goes down. Well, they lost me. I'm only in a bad mood because the fucking game fails. I hate when that shit happens. I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm just trying to use all the things I've learned up to this point in the game to be victorious. Instead, the game just fucking glitches and fails. And oh, you got hit when there's no one even there. Okay, stupid fucking game. Oh, I couldn't. I couldn't do an assassination. Okay, magically dodge. Look at this! Do you see what's happening right now? Look at my look at my body. Four hundred arrows coming off the fucking screen and all hit me at once. I can't move. <laughs> what the fuck? This is fucking laughable. It's a fucking comedy of errors. This fucking game. What? I held right on the D-pad. It, it said I did up. Oh my god. Oh, where's the final word supply? I got all my health back. There's one word supply left I didn't get. Oh my god, it's in the middle of the wall. Oh, Whiskey Tango Chewed. He says, you'll get it, buddy. This seems really tough. No Louisiana Egg. I have not bought any movies on Blu-ray recently at all. Alright, now I'm getting it. Look at this. The brazier's been lit. Oh. Oh, it's Kyuyo! Where's the, the, the uh, chest? Right there. I'm gonna try to loot the chest. Where the fuck did he come from? Look at this. Oh my god. There's the guy I'm trying to kill. I almost had him until I got interrupted. And the Stinking Bros did a 100-bit cheer. Thank you, Stinking Bros, for the 100-bit cheer. Appreciate that. I do appreciate all of you cheering tonight, although some people, it's very obvious they're trying to distract me with, like, trollish questions. So they're trying to get me to not pay attention and fail. Or get angry, which I'm not going to do. Um, other people probably are trying to legitimately cheer and ask questions, but I'm sorry. You know, I was in the middle of that crazy shit. I couldn't answer them, so. What, what the fuck? Did you see that? Oh, my God. He literally popped up in front of me. As I was firing the fucking arrows, like, pop goes the asshole. 
What the hell? She hit this innocent dude. She hit the wrong guy. <laughs> what the fuck? What is with this game tonight? What is going on? What's up, dick? Good to see you tonight. I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. What? Aha. What the shit? Wait a minute. Oh my god. Vicious bloodthirsty pigs. What the fuck? Oh my god. Maybe this is them over here. Whoa! No! What is this? I got a lynx? There's a lynx and a pig on me. What the fuck do I do? That's a dead man's contact? What the fuck does that... I don't know what's going on anymore. I don't know what's going on anymore! Yes, baby man gaming, I have pooped my pants in my life. Absolutely full-on load of dung. Just shot right into my, my fucking underoos. Definitely did that. You're absolutely right. Um, I don't know what's happening. One of the devs, I says, if I showed up at your front door with a shirt, would you sign it? No, because number one, you couldn't get to my front door because I live in a private community. And number two, that would be creepy as fuck for you to just randomly show up unannounced. Louisiana Egg, I have no adv advice for you about Tinder. I don't know what you're fucking talking about. <laughs> Tinder. I think that's supposed to be a dating app or something. Like, you know, one of those dating apps where you talk to people and shit. I don't know. I don't know anything about them. I don't use them. I certainly don't have a need for them now. <clears throat> the only the only dating thing I used, I think I used a million years ago. I think it was that one that was like, I didn't know it was. Isn't there one that's like all Christian or something? I forget what it's called. They got into hot water because like, I guess they didn't, they wouldn't allow you to be homosexual on their dating site. But this was like a hundred years ago, like the mid 2000s when they first launched. I think I had a, I tried it out and it was ridiculous or something. <laughs> Third of the third says, will we ever get a tell about how you and Kat met? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe one day I will tell the full story. Maybe I won't. Because so, so many people are just so fucking nasty and negative and they use shit in negative ways that I don't even know if I should bother. <laughs> Quite frankly. So, the truth is it's really just, uh, it's, it's really none of anyone's business but ours anyway, so. More pigs. Stuck. Can't climb up there for some reason. Found the other war supplies. Right I never pressed the attack button. Never pressed it. I was only pressing square and, and X. Why did all of the, the icons disappear? Everything disappeared. What the fuck? All the icons disappeared telling me who was here. Why is the color all fucked up? Look at the screen. What the fuck? Why is the color fucked up? What is going on with the game right now? All the icons telling me who the people were disappeared and the colors all fucked up. Uh... What is going on? I can't jump down, I'm stuck. Can't move. I'm stuck. <laughs> I can't move. It wouldn't. She would not climb up. She got stuck again. Wow. Oh, he's not attacking. He's attacking. He's completely missing. Look at the damage he's doing. What the fuck is going on with this game? Look how stupid this is. Fuck this game. Seriously, fuck this stupid broken game. This game fucking stinks when it comes to group combat. It really does. 
It's so bad. All right, as you, as I told you guys, I'm ignoring stupid questions. Like, how do you do with being lonely and not drinking? What? Oh my god. I just want to play the game and have intelligent discussions. And instead, there's so much trolling in the stream tonight. It's fucking stupid. And now they're all alerted. Because the assassination somehow didn't kill him. All the new items I got all suck ass. They do. Yeah, let me get rid of them all. Welcome to the depths. I said, "What's in a genuine? What's an intelligent discussion? Genuinely, I want to help. Something that's like a question about me, or you know, about my streaming, or something. Not something that's related to a dumb meme. Not a random question that has nothing to do with anything. <laughs> you know." Welcome, Mistias. All right, let's uh sell a bunch of crap. What's my least favorite random question? That one. The one you just asked. <laughs> there you go. Boo this man! <laughs> yes, Dabside, I do like this game. The only thing I don't like about this game is when you're in a group fort and the, the controls fuck up. Where you can't target the right enemy or you're trying to platform and it doesn't fucking work properly at all. It glitches out. That's what I don't like. Overall, I do like the game. Well, at least I killed the captain right away, right? The cultist right I can't even see what's hitting me, but that's the cultist right there. I got him! Alright, what are the chances I'm gonna kill this bull easily? <laughs> What are the chances, guys? This is going to be like the last thing I do tonight. What are the fucking chances I'm going to kill this bull easily without any problems? Yeah, right. <clears throat> I would like to say thanks to everyone who cheered something tip tonight. And everyone who was supportive and positive and not doing stupid detractor memes and shit. But, uh... I'm 31. Every time I play, I gain two levels. Seriously, it's like every time I fucking do this, I gain two levels. I missed somehow. This is the easiest one so far. He doesn't do any running attacks or nothing. He just stands there and does melee attacks. You can dodge easily. What did you say, nigga? Overpower. He staggers? Yeah, he's fucking easy to kill, man. Overpower. Overpower. I tried to dodge, didn't work. I don't know what happened to the music. The music ended. I'm trying to dodge and I can't. Wow, now I can't do anything, dude. He's hitting me endlessly. I can't dodge anything he does. Wow, I had him, and he fucking just hit me endlessly at the end. It was an easy fight. At the end, all of a sudden, he just hits you, hits you, hits you. You can't do anything about it. Pretty much par for the course for these fucking uh, legendary bo uh, animal boss fights. Terrible. All right, so thank you, MTC dude, for a cheer. Scatman for a cheer. Dabside for a cheer. I love ASMR, did a 200 bit cheese. Shout out to my favorite viewers, Kate, and they call me Jim Bob and me, of course. Hilarious, I had him done, it was easy. And all of a sudden, again, oh, watch this. Hit, 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 hit. Can't do anything. The dodge is not effective at the end of the fight. Okay. Oh my god, they didn't know what they were doing with these legendary animal fights. They fucked them all up. They're all terrible. I'm dodging. 
Dodge, 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 dodge. Look at the damage. Yeah, see, he does his dance. He's like a dance of fucking death. It does the same damage. He's in this, like, rage mode now. At the end of the fight, he goes into this mode where he just keeps hitting, hitting, hitting. And even if you dodge, it hits you anyway. Stupid. Stupid. I guess I'll try to I'll try to use some arrows too. Since since it seems like certain things like overpower, I don't know how good it is. I'll probably just use the regular stab, and then oh, and then use some arrows. I'm doing nothing wrong. It's hilarious. Oh, I, at the end of the fight, I have a mode where I just keep attack, 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 and you can't dodge it, and it hits you for all your health. Wow. So it happens twice. Fucking garbage. Garbage. Are you kidding me? Do you see how much damage I just fucking did to him? I'm gonna do that from now on. Forget it. I don't know why I'm doing melee attacks to begin with. Okay, I went to fire my arrow. It didn't work. Now I can't move. I missed! I had it! That was the final hit! That was the final hit! I fire! The arrow goes down to the ground and misses, and then he gets a free hit afterward and insta-kills. What the fuck? Insanely badly designed fucking animal bosses. <laughs> Stupid game. One hundred percent cheating! All I needed was one more hit. It showed it aimed. It even showed the health would go down. I fire. It goes down to the ground. Doesn't hit. He gets an instant hit that takes all my health. Fuck this game. This stupid game sucks. These fights are terrible. Terrible. It went through his body. It didn't hit. Look at that. The arrow goes through his body. It doesn't connect even though it's fucking hitting him. Wow, I can't do I can't dodge now. Got him. Good shit. Still easier than the boar though. <laughs> Still easier than the boar. Oh yeah. Daggy Smurf is cool, man. Last night I was feeling depressed and Kat had gone to sleep early because she was tired because it was our day out and we'd been out all day long, so she she was wanting to pass out. So I was just sitting around, I was feeling a little depressed, I posted it on Twitter, I was like, come on, cheer me up, you know? Hopefully some people can have to do some things. And people did, they posted up some funny stuff, it was actually, it made me laugh a lot. But now people are like, oh my god, Phil, are you okay? It's like, dude, I've, I've t publicly talked about suffering from depression already earlier this year, it's true, I do, like, it, sometimes it comes back, sometimes there's good reason for it to happen, sometimes there's not, sometimes it just hits. And, you know, last night was actually a combination, I would say, where some stuff was really annoying and was was uh, you know making me feel bad and other stuff was just kind of compiling and making me feel shitty when I sh really shouldn't um so no worries guys no you don't need to if you're like oh, you need to talk Phil you need someone to talk to like you know if I was actually like seriously deep down depressed I would talk to Kat you know but she was asleep so I was just saying something to see if maybe someone would post up to something funny and cheer me up and they did are you sure this is a good idea um the bottom line is at this point People will do anything for attention. It's that simple. Only immature, really fucked up people would do that. So if you're not interested, you probably just want to go take a dump or something. I don't know. Um. All right, here we go. This is so weird. I just played Red Dead Redemption 2 for two straight weeks, and I, I used the horse the whole time. Yet I never used the horse playing Assassin's Creed. Now I'm actually using a horse in Assassin's Creed. This is weird to me. 
She's hitting every possible person in the road. Nice AI. She's literally flattening every person. <laughs> Mom, what the hell? Where'd you learn to ride? I need to harass his ass. Harass that ass. Malaka. What? He wasn't even swinging for me. He was just swinging wildly and hit me. This group ability is too good. Oh! It's so good. Oh, what? I was dodging. It still hit. The dodges in this game fucking suck. Us, us, is, us, us, is, us, us, is, us, us. Noisy idiot. That's all he's a noisy idiot. What the fuck? Shut the what fuck a up. Mess. Why am I not using? Why am I? Okay, I'll prove a point. People are saying, why aren't you using your horse? Here, I'll show you why. You ready? You ready? If you're not noticing, it's only slightly faster than walking. And in particular, right now it's working because I'm on a flat surface of beach. But if I were trying to go over the countryside or whatever where I was, this horse would have been terrible. It would have constantly been getting caught on shit and everything. So this is actually perfect for right now to just run across the beach. But outside of that, the horse isn't very useful in this game. Plus, I just played Red Dead Redemption 2 for two and a half weeks and I don't feel like riding horses anymore. I need Kill to the captain. Up. Kill the Polomar. Wow, it sounds familiar somehow. Like maybe I've done this before. This is the problem. Every fucking mission is go to a base and do something repetitive. There's too much of this. Why do I have to go to a fucking base a million fucking times in the game? Base of Ultracia should not be 75 to 80% of the, of the fucking gameplay of your game. Wow, what a great shot. She was aiming at the ground, then lost aim and shot up for no fucking reason. I didn't tell her to do that. I'm dodging, but okay. I can't target anybody now. Wow, she's dodging backward instead of forward. Oh my god. Terrible fucking control of this game. Bitch! You can't fight forever. Oh yeah? You can't keep this up. Oh, that was fair. Out of nowhere, he sucker punches me and then insta instantly kills me. Fucking garbage. Garbage! Terrible gameplay. Absolutely terrible. Higgins says, I think the Ezio Trilogy was the best. I don't think any Assassin's Creed have topped that game. Yeah. Uh, I, I did like Black Flag. I did like Black Flag, but I do agree that the, 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 the Ezio games were the best. They're probably gonna make me do it over. Even though I completed it now, they'll probably make me do the whole fucking mission over. Watch. Yeah, oh yeah, I was right. Fuck this piece of shit game. Negative, 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 negative.
Okay. And now I don't care. Now I'm just gonna kill the one guy and I'm gonna leave. Fuck this. This game sucks. Seriously, it's fucking stupid as shit. What the fuck? Oh, a checkpoint? What's that? I never heard of a checkpoint in 2018. Do the whole fucking mission over. Fuck your mother. Lazy ass game development. Lazy as fuck. I love when you trash talk. It's just talk. And the trash comes with you. Yeah, Voltage Back says they tried to make it so that you'd explore the whole map. See, I, I'm okay with that, but why is the map so fucking big then? And why is most of the stuff in the map have nothing to do with the story? You see what I mean? Like, I understand that what, really what they were going for, they were going for, here's a game you're going to buy. You're going to buy in early October, and you're going to spend so much time wanting to explore this open world because we made such a vibrant open world with so much content in it that you're going to want to explore the whole thing. It's going to take you months to beat the game. There's two problems with that. Number one, half the stuff in the world is boring. Like, I don't want to, to invade... 400 generic bases. That's not fun to me. You know what I mean? That's like actually the opposite of fun. To just keep invading generic base after generic base after fucking generic base. So that's number one. Number two, they decided to release this game the same time as other games that are incredibly long, like fucking Red Dead Redemption 2, which you knew was going to suck up all the hype this 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 gaming season. So it was a really bad choice in my opinion. If they were gonna release this game, they should have done it next year. And they should have fucking put a new shit in it and polished it. You know what I mean? Or this should have come out last year. I hate to say it, but Origins didn't even need to exist. This game goes so far past what Origins was attempting to do that it's actually a much better game, in my opinion. But it basically suffered because Origins just came out last year. People say, oh, it's more of the same, and it ends up being not as entertaining. If I never played Origins and I played this, I probably would like this game a lot more. But the fact that I just played Origins last year and it was a similar game actually takes away from this game. And that's their own fucking fault. That's their own greed that did that to this game, basically. What is going on? I'm on? Now look at this. I can't move. Another mercenary spawned on top of me. Isn't this great about this game? A second mercenary spawned on top of me, even though he wasn't there a, a second ago, and immediately took 95% of my fucking health. No, I'm sorry. The combat formula of this game fucking sucks. It really does. Complete stupidity. So, I'm not sure what they want me to do here. Here, look. First thing I'm gonna do is get rid of these fucking bounties. But I'm not sure what they want me to do. It says there's weapon racks? Yeah, destroy weapon racks. How? And what the, What are they? Because there were weapon racks down there that I looted or whatever, but they're not marking them as waypoints. So I don't know what fucking weapon racks they want me to destroy. <clears throat> it's pretty dumb. Do they want me to destroy every single weapon rack? Because the eagle can't mark weapon racks. Yeah. I see one right there. But is that what they want me to do? I have no idea. This is like a weird mission that they won't give me a clear-cut objective. It seems like it's broke. Look, it's broken. It doesn't work. You gotta be kidding me. His dead teammate is standing right next to him. His dead teammate was standing right next to him, and he fucking didn't bother. Oh, whatever. Is that what? Four to go. That's what I was supposed to do. Destroy the weapon racks. Wow. How original. <laughs> yes, Wagons, I am aware you could use a Pokeball controller in the, in the newest Pokeball, Pokemon game. In fact, most people are criticizing the game saying it sucks. There pretty much are no Pokemon battles. It's more about the capturing of the Pokemon than actually like training them up and having them fight anybody. Everyone says the Poke battles have been nerfed and or and are non-existent and people fucking hate it. In this area. So, I'm glad I'm not playing it. Let's go Pikachu. Let's go piss off people who play Pokemon and have no Poke Battles in the game. <laughs> Lies of Souls, people still play Pokemon Go? Not really. It's like a very, very small count compared to what it used to be. I mean, obviously that was a viral thing two and a half years ago, right? It was a long fucking time ago when that thing was popular. But basically that's what, that's what Pokemon... Uh, Let's go Pikachu, let's go Eevee. That's what it is. It basically is, it combines Pokemon Go mechanics with a regular Pokemon game. 
So you're wandering on a, a world in a real game, but then all of a sudden, oh, you have to capture a Pokemon. It becomes Pokemon Go. And now you can use this motion control ball and throw it around in your house and shit. It's really stupid. It's just fucking stupid as hell. There's no reason to play that game. But be careful. He's well Another defended. fort fucking infiltration Don't mission. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> clear the barracks. Clear the fort. Clear the military. Clear, clear the military camp. Clear the barracks. Clear the fort. Clear the military camp. Do the generic shit. That's boring as fuck. If you can't, I said you keep doing it and waste your time. Just do the same shit and bust a rhyme. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da. This is fucking boring as shit. <laughs> All right. I can't believe for the next, like, hour I'm gonna have to do the same generic shit. Take over another base. Take over another base. Take over another base. Ugh. King calls himself asked, will I do a second run of Hitman 2? Well, I'm definitely gonna be doing some alternate assassinations tomorrow on stream, because I'm only gonna probably take about two hours to finish the final quest, I'm thinking. Um... Will I be doing a full second run? I don't know. Because the elusive target comes out this week, and then after that, I'm going to be busy with other stuff. So I don't know if I'm going to bother with a whole full second fucking run. Alright. What the shit? Jayco just tipped me another $5. Says, Do you know which, how stream labels work? You can use them to update tips. Chase the SoCal automatically so you don't have to. Oh, Jayco, the reason I do it manually is, is actually on purpose. Because sadly, I get a lot of trolling. And if I didn't do it manually, what would end up happening is very simple. People would find ways to, to get around the system. So they would do things like, for example, say something in a, in a weird spelling, okay, that looks racist. If you combine two words, you know what I mean? Or like a lot of people say, why doesn't Phil just do uh, text, to, text to speech or whatever? Because people would troll and get me in trouble. Or for example, what if someone had a racist name, right? And then they, they cheer, and now it's the top cheer, and I don't notice it right away. Now you got a racist thing up there. That's why I can't do it. I have to do it manually. That way I can screen everything myself during streams and make sure that everything is kosher and I'm not violating Twitch rules. Trust me, people would fuck with me if I didn't have it that way. So I understand a lot of people have it automated. Sadly, I can't automate it. Your make crate, it doesn't matter. He says, oh, but you can have certain blocked words. No, they're not going to use those blocked words. They'll use variations. Instead of an E, they'll use a 3. Like Instead of an I, they'll use an L. They'll use every misspelling and think to say something to get me in trouble. It's not worth it, dude. There's no way. I have to sit here for fucking a week thinking up of variations of words to block. It ain't going to happen. Another one with fucking bombs. Why is they all have fucking bombs? A third mercenary? What the fuck, dude? The fuck this shit, dude. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, fuck you. No, fuck you, you fucking cheesy ass cheating game. Stupid shit. Yes, just keep spawning fucking mercenaries. Oh, now I can't get over. I'm gonna die because I can't get out of here. They won't let me fucking leave the fort. Wow. Oh my god. Fucking dumbass game. Why can't I leave? Finally, get me the fuck out of here. Oh my god, what a pain in my ass. Alright. Last one over here. <sighs> DJ Runo says, says Anthem's gonna be like a game like Destiny. How hyped are you for it? I'm really not. And it sucks that I love Bioware, but it looks like everyone, it looks like four people in Iron Man suits. Each Iron Man suit's different. One's melee, one has missiles, one support. It's gonna be the same as Fallout 76, it's gonna be the same as Destiny. Boring co op garbage. It's gonna suck. And Ice in Doob cheered and said, Who's your favorite ra uh, rapper? Mine's Eminem. I don't have a favorite rapper, but when I did listen to rap, it used to be Snoop Dogg, Dr. J, and Eminem. So, uh, the Megalonium cheered and said, Phil's salt is the only salt that I live for. So, there you go. DJ Runo said, EA Games, get fucked, son. Oh, I mean, challenge everything. EA Games. Fuck EA Games. He's right. Do you know that? Huh? What's that? 
They wouldn't let me assassinate him. This fucking sucks. They wouldn't let me assassinate him, even though it was right there. I can't climb! She won't climb. It's glitched out and I can't climb. Great game. She just sits there and doesn't move. What the fuck is wrong with this game? He took no damage! I kicked him down, he did no damage! Look! He has full health! As if I did nothing. Yeah, I can't kill them. This sucks. I dodged, nothing happened. I can't win this mission because the game's fucking garbage and has it level three levels above me for no fucking reason. Yeah, I can't win this. Guess what? A mercenary just fucking showed up. A fucking mercenary showed up out of nowhere. What a bunch of stupid fucking assholes. You gotta be kidding me, another one showed up! What the fuck? Another one showed up! And she attacked the wrong one. I wanted to attack this guy with no health. Uh, I got one. That was the Polymar. Another one showed up. Oh my god. Oh! Who the fuck is this? Another mercenary showed up. Another mercenary. I need to kill one more captain. The, the guy with a ton of hell, where is he? I can't see what's going on. I have no idea what's going on. I couldn't tell what was happening at all. What? I die out of nowhere. Fuck this game. Complete garbage. I need one more guy to kill. All of a sudden, I just lost health. And by the way, I had the ability that I can't die. When you have that ability activated, you can't die. Yet I died anyway. What the fuck? Well, thanks everyone for your cheers. I'm not going to respond to any of that, though. This is ridiculous. I can't, I can't beat this mission now. I can't. There's no way to beat it. Because they've spawned a mission. The third leg of a mission where the first two parts were level 33. The final part's level 35. I can't beat it. The game fuck. Target is the fort, which is also in Smuggler's Forest. This game fucking sucks. I'm sorry, it just does. Why would you have a, a quest where half the quest is level 33 and the end of the quest is level 35? You have to be a fucking, a complete fucking idiot to make a quest like this. What a bunch of dumb fuck game developers. And I mean that. You are stupid as fuck. Oh my god, you are dumb. What a dumb game. Now I gotta turn around and go all the way fucking back. I've been doing side quests for eight hours. I live so well, you're supposed to be doing side quests. I've been doing side quests for eight fucking hours, genius. Why am I toxic? Yep, I'm toxic. <laughs> Fuck this stupid shit. That is the dumbest shit. It really is. And I had the whole fort beat. I needed to kill one more guy, but it just kept spawning fucking mercenaries on top of my fucking head. Endless, en endless amount of mercenaries while I'm trying to kill the captains. Go fuck yourself. Fuck your mother. Fuck your mother. Absolutely terrible. Terrible, g terrible fucking game design. Terrible gameplay. Moronic. Absolutely terrible.
Why would you even have a quest with three parts if the third part isn't scaled with the other two parts? It doesn't make any logical fucking sense at all. <clears throat> yeah, Voltage Match is bullshit. He says he would, he, I would have raised my rank in the Merc Tier 2 if I could finish that. I know, it's not my fault. It's not my fault at all. It's stupid game design. Just really poorly made game. Yeah, how dumb can you be? Not only... Okay, the quest starts level 33. The enemies then go up to 35 for no fucking reason. Oh, you keep yeah. killing the guys you need to kill, but they keep endlessly spawning more. What the fuck? Like, that's game design from, like, the, the 80s. This is what old school gaming is about, brother. I think, sadly, here's, here's the, the, the reality of the situation is... When these game designers make these games... Instead of testing it for functionality, which they do, they don't test it for fun. Like, did anyone actually t do that and say, Oh, is this fun or not? No. This is the opposite of fun. It's an endless, boring, repetitive fucking grind. Endless enemies. It's stupid as shit, but no one tests it for that. Instead, they test it for, does it work? Well, yeah, it works, but it's not fun. Nutted monkey, you cannot pay the bounty in this part of the game. Watch. Because he said, well, why don't you pay your bounty then? Take a look. You can't. You can't pay the bounty in this part of the game. By default, you have three mercenaries on you. It's incredibly bad game design. That was a whole fucking mission, what I just did there. That was a whole mission. How can you tell me these missions are scaled properly? Are you out of your mind? <laughs> What's up, Vladimir Putin? Good to see you here tonight. Vietnamese Vladimir Putin, that is. Higgini says, this is why I dropped this game after playing it for 10 hours. It's not very... It, it, it's so bad, man. And it's sad because there's parts of the game that are really good. When you're doing story segments that aren't repetitive grinding combat, it's fun, it's different, and they do have variety of missions, good writing, but you can't have a whole segment of the game where it's just the same shit over and over and over. It's boring as fuck. Especially when they're raising the levels artificially. It's dumb as shit. DJ Runo says, man, I just bought the game yesterday. That's money down the drain. No, dude, if you can put up with a lot of grinding, this game's all right. But you have to have a lot of time to invest to fucking beat this game. Seriously. This game is a major time sink with the way they designed it. <clears throat> there is no way in Assassin's Creed Odyssey to just do the story. They've made it. You have to do repetitive grinding side content in order to beat the game. And I think that's where it fails. Like, if you want to do the side content, great. But don't make it fucking massively mandatory. It's massively mandatory in this game to do it. <laughs> Illuminati said, Chiyuda said, A boat full of dudes sails away from the girl who's trying to swim towards them in the Navy, I swear. <laughs> in the Navy. Oh my god, it's the woman away. Run away. Oh, oh my! No, okay. This one's level 34. The others are too high level. I can't I seriously can't do anything in this fucking game right now. I can't do this because the gear is level 35 for no fucking reason. All these guys are level 36. I can only do this one. What is with this fucking game? This game's fucking ridiculously bad right now. Here's a level 34 mission. Alright, let's fast travel. Kill this guy. And then I'm gonna do the level 34 mission sitting right next to him. What the fuck? This is so stupid. Kill four guys. What the fuck? It's a story. Why can't you just advance the fucking story? No, kill four generic guys. Okay. Kill three generic camps. Kill four generic guys. That's the that's the, the gameplay they put into the fucking game for story. Okay. Good job. Your main crate is loving the, the JRPG stuff with Dragon Quest. He wants me to play more. We'll see. Kogowitz, he says, this is like Shadow of War all over again. I mean, kind of. We're at a point in the game where every piece of content is grinding garbage. Like, every fucking piece of content is grind grinding nonsense. Where the fuck is it? Oh, immediately, someone else showed up. Look, immediately, someone else fucking shows up. I can't even do it. I can't even do anything. What? Okay, fuck this game. It's supposed to be a one-on-one -on -one fight against the champion. Oh, but people just show up out of nowhere. They spawn and ride up on fucking horses. 
What the fuck is with this game sucks now? Dude, seriously, nothing I've done tonight has been fun. This has been complete garbage gameplay and garbage game. What the fuck were they thinking with this stupid endgame nonsense? How is this fucking fun? You stupid dumb fuck assholes. We're game devs, we know what we're doing. You fucking hacks. God damn it. What a bunch of hacks. Absolutely terrible. I can't see because of the fucking bush. What? A fourth, a fourth and fifth guy just showed up. Look. Trying to kill the weak one first. Another one showed up. Now a mercenary's here. I'm like, there's no way to win this. This is insanity. Look at this. This is utter insanity, is what this is. Look. Are you kidding me? Two mercenaries, plus my target, plus a bunch of... Look. Two more troops just rode in. Two more. What fucking moron who developed this game thought that this was valid gameplay? You have to be really fucking stupid. You have to be really stupid to think that this is fun. Wow. What in the holy fucking hell? Utter stupidity and terrible gameplay. What the fuck? The whole point of a video game is that you're supposed to be able to find different ways and unique ways to get past challenges. Oh my god. Well, I guess I'm not doing that mission. I can't do it. Even though it's supposed to be in, in two of my level, can't do the mission. Because the game fucking sucks. I guess I'll try this mission instead. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. <clears throat> but I suck. I'm a terrible gamer. I'm horrible. How can you even, like, defend or justify that? Oh, you need to fight one guy, and as you're fighting them, 400 other guys roll up. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, great game. But what it is, you just grind until you're their level or equal so you can kill them more quickly. So that way those little guys that show up aren't a threat anymore. <clears throat> really bad. Whoa. And some idiot actually just said, this is how you don't play. Even though I've been doing incredibly good today. Or not. What the fuck? How the fuck? Why is there another exit on the other side of the cave and I didn't find where I needed to go? Look. Oh my god. Let me guess. There's a hole in the wall somewhere that I can't fucking see that I'm supposed to climb through, right? Uh, nothing that I did tonight was fun. I played for three hours and I feel like nothing I did tonight was fun. It was all just tedium and annoyance. And I only gained one fucking level doing it all. Three hours, one level. <clears throat> There's nothing here. Dude, I want to fucking 
I want to just delete this fucking game at this point. I'm serious. Like, overly sensitive. Three hours, and I can't even complete this fucking quest. There's nothing to do in here. Has anyone played this into what the fuck I'm supposed to do besides waste my fucking time here? It would be nice to finish one quest before I finish playing tonight, but I can't. Well, stop fucking whining. How about that? Grow up. Change your diaper. This is just the way out. Yeah, look, it's a dead end. It's the way out. This fucking sucks. Voltage Max says, When I went sliding into the cave, if I looked to the left, it would have been a locked door. Oh, great. There's no door anywhere. Oh my fucking god. No dude monkey says the game is perfectly calibrated XP wise as long as you have no life and you do every single side quest and bounty in the game. Oh my goodness. Is that what I should do guys? To try to raise funds for taxes next year I should have a 10,000 uh, bit sheer minimum? What do you think? Of course not because as we all know Cheers are not legal currency, and they cannot be traded as such or tra or uh dealt with as such. The watch will be vigilant here. Because that would be a no-no, and therefore I don't do that or reference them as such. That's right, because I am perfectly in line with Twitch's terms of service. <laughs> that's right. You can't fool me. All right. Oh yeah, that's right, Fluff and Stone. Remember when I got ten billion dollars in a single tip? Of course. Of course I remember that. That's why I'm now live streaming from my island in the South Pacific. <laughs> yes, servants, bring me my Mai Tais immediately. <laughs> yes. No, the truth of the matter is, and I actually said this before, I love where I live. I love my life. I don't ever want to make, like, more money or change what I do. I just want to be here for... I'd, I'd be happy living here with Cat for the rest of my life. I'm not even kidding. I love it in Washington. I love this house. I just want to stay here. I want to keep what I got. I have no aspirations to ever make anything else or do anything else. That's all I want. So... Swaggin says, pretend that Unity worked. Don't you think that's the way that Assassin's Creed should have been uh, past, you know, past that? I don't know why they gave it an overhaul. Yeah, basically, uh, in my opinion, um, Unity wasn't, at its core, Unity wasn't a bad game. The plot wasn't bad, and if the game mechanics actually worked, they wouldn't have been bad. The problem was the game was glitchy as shit. It ran, like, terribly on the PlayStation 4, even though it was a PS4 exclusive, and people just didn't like that about it, you know? I, I, I even said when I played it, I said, it's not a horrible game. There were a few segments that sucked ass. Where there were like glitches where people were detecting me through walls and shit, I remember. But outside, of, like, in the frame rate was terrible. But the plot and the actual core mechanics of the, of the gameplay and story were actually pretty good. So. What the hell is going on? I guess that's the artifact. Is that the apple? Dude, is that the fucking apple right there? I guess the apple of Eden. It looks like it. Prize of the Sphinx. Riddle me this. Got a trophy. Sphinx figurehead. I got one of the Ubisoft challenges completed. Okay, that was a mission in itself. There's no other missions based off of that one, it doesn't look like. Uh, Charlie, aka Chuck, asks if Ubisoft came up with another Assassin's Creed game next year in another European similar area of time, would you still buy it or would you pass it? Honestly, I might pass it. I'm serious. Unless next year they come up with another one and there's some kind of innovation, I think I'm done with this formula at this point. Salty Salty Dude said, are there changes that are going to be made to your stream to get the extra help you need? Uh, seems like you need something big. Hope it goes well. Maybe, like, at the end, like, around Christmas time or the end of the year, maybe another time, you know, in the spring, I'll try to do some big events to, to do maybe some, you know, efforts to raise some funds for taxes. But what can I do? I stream so much. Just think about this. I've been streaming since 10 this morning. It's now 7.30 at night. I'll probably finish at 10 at night. And I still got work to do. You know what I mean? Like, there's no way I could significantly change anything or do any more work. I've already increased the hours I stream, changed the hours I stream to be more in line with my audience. Like, I've done all the essential things that I can do. 
So, I don't know. I don't I mean, if people have to create suggestions or whatever, you know, uh, something I could do different, I have no idea. I think what I'm going to do is hit this viewpoint and see if I can do this thing. Brewing love. See what the hell that is. Maybe I could do a mission. It says level 35. I'm level 33. And Chipe just tweeted, you're my favorite streamer. I hope you never stop streaming. Thank you very much, Chipe. I appreciate that. Yeah, Fred Flintstone, I said tonight I'll probably stream a little bit later. Maybe 9.30, maybe 10. It depends on how I feel and how, how people are liking the stream. So, Oh, definitely uh, definitely uh, realistic right there. <laughs> Absolutely realistic. What the fuck? Why am I going this way? This is the wrong way. That is completely the opposite way where I wanted to go. This is where I'm going. Here we go. I knew you'd change your mind after turning me down. Unfortunately, love must wait a Oh no. I didn't know this is who I was doing a mission for. I hate to cut our conversation short, Socrates, but Look, that was even more. What the fuck? Dude, I can't finish the mission. I can't finish the mission because it keeps spawning more fucking guys. Look at this nonsense. Another fucking mercenary, see? I can't finish it. I can't finish this fucking mission. Cause too many guys keep fucking spawning. The game sucks. They fucked this up bad, man. This is so fucked. Look how stupid I can't finish the mission. Got you. I'm throwing it. All right, I did it. Get me out of here. What the fuck? The good news is I leveled up. And yeah, you're right. It's an infinite loop. It is. It's stupid. It just keeps spawning. Guys, spawning, spawning, spawning. More enemies on top of you. It's a really bad gameplay mechanic. They fucked it up in this game badly. It did not need to fucking be like that at all. They fucked it up terribly, man. Alright, I'm getting out of here, finally. Okay. Now I stumbled upon a military camp that I didn't want to be in. Of course I did. I'm just trying to escape. Goodbye. Tizen asks what I recommend this game. The game has a tremendous amount of content. The combat engine, when it works, is really good. It's the best parkour of the series. But it's also an incredible grind. If you're okay with an incredible grind style game, yeah, get it. It's worth playing. If you don't like grind, this is not your game at all. You will hate this fucking game if you don't want to grind. <clears throat> I like how this fucking Merc knows I'm here. Look, he knows I'm here. He knows I'm here. He's completely psychic. 100% fucking knew I was right there. Complete bullshit. How the fuck is the mercenary here? How the fuck would the mercenary know that I'm here? Just think about this. Think about the insanity of this. How the fuck would he know? It's complete bullshit. You see what I mean about the game being a shitty grind? A fucking mercenary knows I'm psych there psychically. Get the fuck out of here, dude. I went underground through a tunnel. Oh, I know. I know where they should be. Fuck you. Alright, one more troop to take out and then I've cleared the fort. The Olympics. Alright, a thousand meters away. Let's see if we can fast travel. Indeed we can. Look, I can actually fast travel to here and then just head south, so that's good. 
It is a good thing that, you know, I, I actually explored a lot over the course of this game and ran around because I over unlocked so many fast travel points, it makes it a lot easier. Pretty good. Alright, it's pretty obvious, everyone, that Poopy Finger is now a fucking troll. <laughs> you can always tell when someone, all of a sudden they start talking about Wings of Redemption. It's the same memes and the same bullshit every time. Let's ask Phil about Wings of Redemption. Let's ask Phil about the cat and something that's personal. Let's ask Phil all the stuff. The same shit every time. And people think that, like, I'm, I'm stupid as shit. And I'm not going to notice now. So he, this guy Poopy Finger did one cheer tonight where he asked about Wings of Redemption and me doing co-op with him. Which obviously I'm never going to do. And it's pretty obvious that the guy is just going along with the same fucking memes as before. So I ignored the one cheer so as not to derail the stream. Now the guy's screaming in the stream chat that I'm ignoring him and I don't deserve anything. And he was going to give me $18,000 and now he's not going to do it. Get the fuck out of here. Enough is enough with this stupid shit. <laughs> and there you go. There it is. There's, he's just proving he's a troll. He just did it in the stream chat. So stupid. Anyway, Fred Flintstone just cheered and said, I forgot to say Solid Metal Gear Rex and Testicles. Ah, Testicles. It's pretty obvious that we've had all these people recently poopy, poopy this, poopy that. It's the same fucking person. Making new accounts and doing, you know, stupid shit to get me to read their stuff. Give me attention. Give me attention. Wah. Assholes. <laughs> We're really gonna miss that guy. I mean, I'm gonna cry tonight. I'm gonna cry myself to sleep knowing that that guy can't be in my chat anymore. Don't worry, because he'll be back in five minutes with another poopy named account. <laughs> Moron. Thanks for all for all the fucking free contributions tonight, stupid. <laughs> Moron. <clears throat> All right, let's continue. Let's continue. We gotta go rub down this guy with oils. It's gonna be so exciting. Sorry, closed. I need oil. Oh, sorry, closed. I'll be on my way. There's a special. Five, the five-year-old uh, comedy. Come on, testicles. Uh, rub my testicles. <laughs> you like my observations? They're just so mature. Ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to say something. It's no one's, uh, absolutely no one's place to question the mods or moderator actions. If something takes place in the stream chat, uh, stop being nosy. It's that simple, you know? If someone is found to be a troll, if someone is found to be asking something they shouldn't, if someone is misbehaving, if someone just gets banned for, and you have no idea reason why, it's not your business, you know? It's not. When you go, when you're walking down the street and you see a guy get arrested, do you get up in the fucking cop's face asking what happened? Of course not. <laughs> and by the way, there's idiots in the stream chat telling me that I, they don't know, they're idiots. I'm just going to ignore all of them because they're just there to cause trouble, as usual. Now we got Hardy Buck calling me a liar, saying that the 4K TV was donated to me, don't lie. It absolutely was. Someone actually sent me the money for it. I, I, show, I showed them the TV I wanted. Uh, and I was like, this is, would be a good what one for the man? size of my office or whatever, and they sent me the money for it. It was 100% donated. But Hardy Buck is a negative dick, and he questions everything I do. So, no, I'm not lying. I'm telling the truth. It was donated. Thanks, Trolltronics, for the cheer. Yes, Testicles. Great name. La, la, la. Wow, we got our first actual troll who created a new account to do a 50-bit cheer so we got only one today so you see the difference in the improvement already previously we were getting them like a few an hour we only got one troll cheer today w data asks what's my favorite christmas movie there's my the first one alone uh scrooged scrooged is my favorite christmas movie the one with bill murray bill murray excuse me Nika, i'm gonna win <laughs> They're all rooting for him. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't even notice there was dialogue I've options. Come all this way <laughs> to stand on the dock. I was supposed to be playing the game. I thought it was over. It started playing the credits. I thought the game was over. Are you kidding me? Super bad cat. Am I just doing base game at this point? I'm doing what I can. To beat the base game, which you could beat around level 40. Um, 
as much as I did enjoy the game and maybe I would like to do the legendary creatures, the game is taking fucking forever. So if, if, if I ever d decide to maybe do it later, maybe I would. But at this point, I need to finish the story of the game so I can move on to other stuff. I got Darksiders 3 coming out next week. If we got to that, I got Smash. Then I got, I'm still going to start working on the year-end stuff. I have to finish this game at this point. So... <clears throat> So yeah, you know, changing the cheer limit today was incredibly effective because I thought, oh, maybe it'll cut down on half of the trolling, right? No, we only had one troll. A single troll, that was it. So it definitely helped. Your mate crate, this is still pretty cheer chill, man. I just received an anonymous $100 tip. Holy crap, thank you very much, whoever that was. They just said, I had a very successful Black Friday this year, so I quite a few things I was eyeing at a great price. Wanted to come and grab another great deal. 10 years of content for a small donation. Hope things go well with your fundraising. Thank you very much, whoever did that anonymous $100 tip. Whoever you are is very much appreciated. I am going to put you up on the leaderboard in just a moment. But thank you. That is super cool of you. And, uh, you know, it's... I'm What I'm hoping is, within the next couple months, you know, especially with the holiday season, hopefully people will be feeling generous and they'll help out. And hopefully, you know... I'll just do better. I don't know what else to say, you know? I have until April, basically. And it ain't pretty with the amount of money I need to raise by April in addition to the normal money I raise every month to pay my bills. Ugh. Exactly, Silent Weapons. Doing what I did makes it twice as expensive for the trolls to cheer, so they do it less. Like I said, one troll cheer today uh, versus... Uh, well, one, I guess I'll take that back because there was also, we had stupid Poopy or whatever his name was. So we had two trolls today versus, no no lie, the past few weeks there's been like a hundred. Every day, like people coming in, coming in, trolling, trolling, trolling with these new accounts and shit. Do I wish the trolling will ever end, Hardy Buck? Dude, I would just want to be chill and hang out with people and have fun on the stream, dude. I don't think it would ever completely end, but these horrendous things people do to hurt me... Especially financially, need to fucking end, man. I can't. How can I keep doing this when every year everything's going good and all of a sudden someone fucks me over? I lose my partnership with fucking Curse because of the trolls. I can't get sponsorships that everyone else can get because of the trolls. Like, come on, man. You remind me of a girl that I want ah. to Okay, now. No Usher. My, well, that popped right into my head a fucking Usher song. I don't like Usher at all, but Usher's music was so, like, ridiculously popular in the late 90s and early 2000s that I know, like, five of his fucking songs. Because it was on the radio so goddamn much. At this point, I think I may just do the level 3 armor. Yeah, look, 90% reduction uh, of, re of melee damage, 10% uh, reduction in range, and a 10% chance that attacking enemy staggers. Great. Friggin' great. So for those who don't know, all right, those who've been following along with the game, um, but don't know how long it is, um, FYI, I'm nearing the end of the story of the game. In fact, my my girlfriend Kat b beat this game several weeks ago and said she beat it at level 41, no problem, like it was easy to finish. So I'm level 35, I'm right there, I'm really close to beating the game. Apparently there's very little story left, there's this and then maybe like two more major quest lines in the game, and then I'm done with the main story. However, there is optional content uh, that is available in the, as a post-game. Will I be doing that? I don't know. I mean, I've been playing this game for 36-plus hours right now, and I don't know if I want to continue to play it or not, but I'm definitely going to at least wrap up the story here. Okay, I'm rebanning I Floss in Victory for insulting uh, Super Blind Man, and he can now go to hell and never come back. Get that ass banned! I'll see you in hell, boy! We had just unbanned him, hoping that he would behave. And he didn't learn his lesson. Instead, he's going to be insulting, so now he can go fuck himself. All right. Burn in hell, Burnell. And now I'm going to burn in hell for the rest of eternity because of it. Basically, the people who are kissing Fortnite's ass this year are two people. Number one, people who, who didn't fucking even talk about the game last year, but now it got virally popular, so now they realize if they want to be pertinent with the kitties, they have to kiss the game's ass, regardless of the fact that it's not a great game. Uh, you know, they still have to. Uh, because if they don't, then they won't have that mainstream popularity that they want to get. And let's face it, gaming media outlets are fucking a dying breed. No one really cares about them anymore. If you want to know about a game and if you like it, 
you watch someone play it or you, you watch a review on YouTube. You don't go to fucking IGN. You know what I mean? You don't go to fucking Game Informer. You go watch someone who's an, a real person fucking play the game and review it. Not one of these people who's paid to rush through it early. Um, so they know that they have to basically try to jump on every fucking trend. So let's just kiss Fortnite's ass despite the fact that game's over a year old. Let's make it game of the year for this year. Go fuck yourself. Get the hell out of here, man. Basically, anyone who, who says Fortnite is game of the year 2018 should literally never be paid attention to again by anyone. Because it just shows that they're 100% shills. And they don't care about putting out quality journalism. And again, just, just to clarify, alright? I'm certainly not saying that Fortnite is a horrendous game that no one should ever play. It certainly has an audience, and it certainly is a game that has some fun to it. I've played it before and enjoyed some of the gameplay of it. But it's not for everyone, especially those who don't like crafting in a shooter game. You're gonna hate it. Uh, and it does have wonky uh, shooting mechanics as well that are inconsistent and have RNG factored in. Um, but definitely it's a game that's addicting and has appeal and has replayability factor. And has some fun factor to it. I openly admit that. And I'm not gonna hold it against anyone who likes it. I'm an open-minded guy. If you can like things that I don't like, and that's totally cool, okay? But I'm not ignorant enough to say that it's game of the fucking year a year after the game already came out. I'm not a complete shill moron. Ah, uh, damn, I'm on the wrong building. <clears throat> Crazy Dream did 100-bit cherries that I enjoyed the story mode of Fortnite. That was great. See, I don't know if he's joking or not. Because Fortnite has a single-player mode, but I don't know if there's a story to it or not. It's the tower defense with zombies that literally no one plays. And that's what the game originally was supposed to be. You doing tower defense against zombies. Then they realized, oh shit, the Battle Royal fad is popular. Let's make our game free on every console and cater towards kids. Make it look like cartoony for kids. And it becomes the, the most successful game in years. Complete luck. Does he have crafting materials to buy? Not many. I'll buy what he has. Ridiculous. You better take a sip. You fucking sleazy asshole. Okay. Let us continue, my friends. Let us go back to Thespis and see what he wants us to do. Then I think we might be doing the Olympics plotline. You know what I was thinking, too? There might be some legendary animals I can fight, and I might be able to go back to the arena and do some grinding there, because I probably could kill two, three more guys uh, and get more rewards and stuff. I guess we'll see what I feel like doing. But we've got many options of things to do, which is good. You know, I probably could have fast traveled, but I'm not that smart. I totally forgot, so I'll just walk. I guess there's a, another meme about me that I only drink gin. It's not true. Like, gin, I do like gin drinks, but I enjoy many different liquors, including vodka, rum, tequila. I don't just drink gin all the time. And I don't drink all the time regardless. It's another thing. Oh, Phil's drunk. He drinks every day. Oh, okay. <laughs> Whatever you say. <clears throat> You're right. Every night I get completely fucking hammered. How did you know? I just drink so much. I'm sloppy drunk. I'm vomiting everywhere. Every night. <laughs> Congrats. Congrats on uh, figuring me out. Did I have any alcoholic beverages on Thanksgiving? No, I don't think I did. Nope. I did have eggnog the other night when I set up my tree. That was Saturday night. I found your wine. Can you imagine? I'm serious. Can you imagine playing this game without the waypoints? Because I'm 36 hours in. 37 now. Can you imagine playing this game and you don't know where anyone is because it doesn't give you the waypoints? And they're like, oh, that's how the game's intended to be played. Like, so whoever said that is an idiot. The game's intended to be played so you wander around. It already takes it already takes 45 hours to beat the game. Sure you should play for 400. Safe. I mean, what a stupid game mechanic. No waypoints in an open world game of where to go. Okay. <clears throat> so I have no health because everything went on fire. Yeah. I got fucked by fire. the tablet. Okay, there's the other treasure. Good. Clear the whole camp now. 
I almost got killed by just that stupid random explosion. A stupid fire thing exploded out of nowhere. It's not like I fucking got hit or nothing. It just explodes. It almost takes all my health. Pretty dumb. Where the fuck is the third treasure? Not again with this shit. It's doing it again. It won't show the third and final treasure. It makes no fucking sense. This isn't the first time this has fucking happened either. Yeah, it's glitched. It won't show me the treasure. Unless that's it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If I can, DJ Runo says, I'm so bad at history, I can't even remember what happened yesterday. Dude, I can't even remember how old I am. I'm serious. The other day, I thought I was 37 years old. People were like, nah, dude, we did the math for 36. I was like, really? <laughs> really? I swear I was 37. I don't think you saw your death coming. I wanted to do assassination, it didn't work. Holy Jesus! What is that? What the fuck is that? See, that was quick and easy. I knew that wasn't going to be much of a pain, so that was good. Now we'll go do the story mission. Cool. I'm actually finally, I'm at a level where both my melee and my ranged combat are ridiculously good. Like, you saw the guy with the shield didn't stand a chance. I just went, zoop, took his leg out. Dead. Previously, the problem was I would have to hit him with arrows, but now I'm good enough that I can do anything I want. What? Uh, the wolf ran through my area attack like I wasn't doing it. Can't see what's going on. Camera's terrible. I can't dodge. I'm pressing square. Nothing happens. Now I'm dying. Fuck this. Alright, fuck this. Oh my god, what a combo. Oh, I couldn't parry that. I guess when they glow, it's unparryable. Really, nigga? You gotta be kidding me! They didn't- Dude, my stealth is out, off the charts! They didn't even see me when I did that, are you kidding me? Dude, this is crazy, I'm so fucking good right now! Are you kidding me? This is fucking amazing! This is too good! She can't be far, let's go! That's it, I'm done. I'm out of here. Holy shit, I'm so good now. You gotta be kidding me. Beard Tendi has resubbed for the seventh month in a row and says, What Italian dish do you like besides penne? Have you had chicken sorrentino? I don't know if I've ever had chicken sorrentino. What pasta do you prefer? I prefer a penne. Easy to eat. Can't see shit. I can't, I can't see, see shit. shit. I can't see. Baby Man Gaming, I have no idea. He asks, is there sex in this game? I don't know, because I did none of the stupid romantic options in the game. They made no sense. Oh, all of a sudden, I'm randomly attracted to someone with no build-up and no plot development. Uh, no, I'm not, I don't roll that way. Hello. His clothes. All right, Baby, uh, Baby Man Gaming, there's no way I'm reading what you said, but thank you for the cheer. All right, so Liquid Hindo came back. The first thing he says is a fucking negative meme, and now he's banned permanently again because he was the person who I unbanned earlier, and he's a fucking idiot, and he's not coming back now. What a complete asshole. The first fucking thing he says is, is a dumb meme. The truth of the matter is I'm actually pretty hard to offend. It's just that people are such assholes to me that, you know, they get to me over time, but... <laughs> Which is the reason why he was banned to begin with, and he just wrote me two heartfelt emails apologizing. The first thing he does back is says it again, and now he's permanently banned. What a great guy. <laughs> what a great guy. Oh my god, what a fucking buffoon. Look with him though, you want to come back? Make a new account, because I'm not unbanning you again this time. Stupid. Stupid. If you don't understand the meme, that's a good thing. Let's put it that way, that's a good thing. 
It has nothing to do with me. It was a, it was a meme from a detracting against someone else, another streamer. Oh, really? Oh, really? Exactly. It was some stupid negative Wings of Redemption meme or something. And it has nothing to do with me. And he was coming in here, spamming it, spamming stuff like that previously. He got banned for it. And he fucking... writes two nice, heartfelt-style emails apologizing for his behavior. Saying he learned he won't do the stupid thing again. First thing he says when he comes back is something stupid. So, good riddance. I told you, it's the holiday season. I'm, I'm softening up a little bit. I'm being a little bit nicer. And I pay for it every time. I, it never fails. <laughs> it never fucking fails. I pay for it. He's done. Watch this. Good night. Oh! Fucking executed, bro. Done and done. I told you I'm too good now. All my damage is insane. I did a stealth attack that did almost his entire energy bar. I'm too overpowered. Now that I got all the best abilities. They, these guys can't even fuck with me. That was supposed to be an elite level target. You get completely demolished. <laughs> Circumspices, Savage DSP was cringy looking back. The, the new DSP is much better. I think I, I agree. Like, I agree. Like I used to be... Over the top for the sake of being over the top. Shock value for the sake of shock value. Saying sexual stuff and dumb, stupid, immature jokes and stuff. I don't like that stuff anymore. Like, I've, I, in the past 10 years, I have definitely grown as a person. And I realized that I could just kind of be myself and relax and have fun. Rather than having to be some fucking over the top dickhead. So. I'm good at lying. <laughs> What the fuck? They started me facing the fucking- Are you kidding me? They started me facing the acid. Fuck your mother. Fuck your mother. They attack and it- What the fuck? I'm glitched! I couldn't move. I was glitched. <laughs> terrible gameplay. Absolutely terrible. Oh, yeah. Dumb fucking idiots who made this game. Drag races don't have turns like that, stupid. Duh. I work for EA. Ghost games. Ghost games. I know how to make driving games. Duh. Idiots. There's nowhere else to go. You have to jump in that direction. And I hit a tree every time. It's not my fault. The game is a piece of fucking shit. They are morons. Oh, God. Beats me. Fuck you. Fuck you, Ghost Games, you dumb fucking ass cuck fucking pieces of fucking shit. You guys couldn't make a fucking video game if someone handed you a completed one. Oh my god, idiots in stream chat. They're actually blaming it on me. Yes, the bad frame rate is my fault because other people are streaming the game and not having a bad frame rate. It's obviously me. I doctored this footage, right? I'm creating artificial frame drops on my stream to make the game look bad. That's right. You people are fucking idiots. Seriously, if I could kick you and your fucking nuts through the internet, I would. Any moron who would say something like that deserves a swift kick in the fucking family jewels. Good, now I'm away from that annoying fucking bitch of a kid who I would have slapped in real fucking life if they talked to me like that. <laughs> I would have fucking pimp slapped that shit out of that. <laughs> now I'm in six. Fuck this, dude. This sucks. This fucking sucks. This absolutely fucking sucks. Are they out of their fucking minds? Ben Boxer says, ever going to buzz, going back to buzz cut well shorn DSP? Probably not. As I've said many times, I don't, oh shit, this is the wrong way. Oh, right here. I don't like that. Like, the buzz cut, the reason I did it was for convenience when it came to not having to brush my hair in the morning. But I knew I looked like shit. Like, I knew that. I knew that I looked terrible when I dressed and looked like that. I just didn't give a fuck. You know, now I actually want to look good for cat. So, I do things to make myself look good. I, you know. Young, dumb, and full of calm. <laughs> Three things I love about a woman. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wait a minute. Where the fuck is he? Did it not select the quest? I did select it, yet I don't see it on my map. Right? Hold on. Okay, there it is. I had to zoom out or to what zoom in to fucking let it show the icon. Oh my shit! This should blind. seriously make your active quest blink like brightly so you could see it. Where the fuck did it go? Oh my god, it's covered by the cave. Of course I can't fucking see it. I can't see. That's different, Baby Man Gaming. He says, I, under I agree with you. 
if you're gonna ban people for saying negative memes with malicious intentions, but what if someone doesn't know the meme and they repeat it, and then they get in trouble for it? That's different. Then if they come to me and say that, right, then obviously I'll, I'll say, okay, I understand the situation, just don't do it again and forgive them. Complete opposite situation of what just happened with this Liquid Hindo guy, who literally got in trouble for saying negative memes, apologized, said he wouldn't do it again, and then immediately did it upon his return. So, there you go. But yeah, I'm, listen, I'm not an asshole. Just because you didn't, maybe you didn't understand what was going on. If you write me an email or whatever and tell me what's happened, I always look into it and I'll, I'll, you know, be nice or whatever. Give you the benefit of the doubt at least once. What the shit? Okay then. Okay, I gotta stay away from the guy at the gate so he doesn't see me. Remember, I have the best stealth ability in the game right now. So as long as I stay a certain proximity away from people, they will never see me. What could possibly go wrong? I tried to stealth attack. It didn't work. I tried twice. Oh, I killed the guy. And no one fucking saw me. Oh my god, seriously? Maybe I can get this guy. Take them down. I like the braces. What? I was in the middle of the ability that you cannot die during, and I died anyway. Uh. I was in the middle of a fucking ability where you cannot die, and you died anyway. What the fuck? That's the purpose of that ability. So you can't die during it, and you can try to get a kill quickly. And they fucking killed me. Okay. The screen was even the right color. It was the orange color, which means you can't die, and I died. Well, that's the game's fault, not me. I was fucking doing it with what I needed to do. Complete bullshit. That's the whole point of the ability, so you can do melee combat against a bunch of people and not die. Yeah, it didn't work. Ugh, <sighs> stupid fucking game. Alright, we'll try again. I don't want to be spotted here. I got a steely piece. Okay. I hit level 38. Wow, nice. And by the way, I leveled up. I don't even know what to put the ability point in. I have no idea at this point. Because I've maxed out the things I wanted to max, you know? I Because I've maxed out the things I wanted to max, you know? I Holy Jesus. What is that? What the fuck is that? I guess I'll make overpower attack better, even though I don't need to. Yeah, everything else I wanted to do is, is already insanely good. <laughs> I don't need anything else to win the game. No, you won't. I heard the guy saying, I'll still catch you. I can't see. Oh, look at this. Oh, yeah, she immediately ninja kicks me. Oh, my God. That's a guy I need to kill, isn't it? Yep. I didn't climb at all. I, I pressed dodge. She started climbing the wall. <laughs> Amazing get controls in this game. Well, a bunch of people were contributing, but I can't really pay attention right now. Why are they growing yellow? I don't know what that means when they gl glow yellow. Holy Jesus! What is that? What the fuck is that?
Now I'm on fire for no fucking reason. Nothing was on fire, but yet I'm on fire here. Absolutely nothing was on fire. My body lit on fire. <laughs> okay. Now he dodged magically. This is so fucking stupid. This is so dumb. What the fuck? Look at this. He saw me here. How the fuck did he see me? I can't even move. I'm glitched. Look, I'm stuck. What the fuck? I'm glitched. I couldn't even move. I'm stuck on the rock. My god, this is dumb. I can't move again. I'm stuck again. Anyway, Haseo just cheered, said, If you didn't kill the Wolf of Sparta toward the beginning of the game, he would have killed the fighter for you and saved the trouble of the fort. Really? He would have, huh? He's right. Do you know that? I did hit him twice, but he's still not fucking dead. Why are they glowing yellow? I don't understand what that means when they're glowing yellow like that. I was dodging, but okay. He's almost dead. I only need a couple more hits. I. Goodbye. Watch this. Goodbye. Oh. <laughs> well, that was brutal. Oh well. So much for him. I wanted to do see if I could sneak him with stealth to kill him from behind, but he already knew where I was psychically. Oh well. You've proven your point. Now finish this. I welcome death. I like how he's not it means dead. I don't have to see you again. Go with the fatty what man. the? He went. <laughs> he pose it. <laughs> oh, he was T posing. He was T posing. He was glitched and T posing. Now jump off this cliff. Oh! Wow! What the fucking glitch was that? What was that? I landed in midair, stopped, got up, jumped again. What the fuck? This, I told you guys this game is fucked up when you ride the horse. I told you I didn't want to ride the horse. See the shit that's happening now? The game is falling apart. We had a glitch in the fucking Animus right there, man. If you ever seen a glitch in the Animus, that was one right fucking there. What the shit was that? That shit ain't right, man. That shit ain't right. <laughs> people are all freaking out. Some people are like, that was cool. Swaggins is all angry. He's like, this game pisses me off. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow! Swagger says I'm so angry I'm leaving. He can't watch anymore. That was so bad. He's leaving. The physics have completely pissed him off. Wow. Fear of the Worm also agrees with Swagger and says, Assassin's Creed is now a joke. Janky, boring, padded, and ocean with the depth of a, a, a Petri dish. <laughs> okay, so we gotta go to the throne room now. By the way, holy crap, guess what? Creepy Spaghetti... Just did a 1300 bit cheer and said the retard who worked on this game's physics should be crucified. That's a little harsh. I probably wouldn't go that far. I'd probably say, oh my god, stupid physics. The physics are pretty glitchy and perhaps they should have done better. I'm not exactly sure I would call them mentally challenged or say that they need to be crucified, but I guess to each their own. The person who made this part of the game okay. is a worthless okay. human and should be actually disposed of, put into an fucking incinerator, and burnt to a crisp. I hate worthless humans. If you worked on this part of the game, you are a worthless human. Go kill yourself. Go fucking kill yourself. Jump off a fucking bridge or something. And do it in the dead of night so no one tries to save you because you don't deserve it. Worthless humans. Worthless humans. Worthless humans. I want to know. Send me the name of the person who worked on this portion of the game. Game, so that I can tell them how worthless they fucking are, and if they have kids, nope, it's really five, that's six. actually pointless. Well, how can you support this game when it costs? They don't deserve the fuckery. Because they're, because they're worthless. The only right people who are productive members of society. Shame on me. 
Me? What did I do? I didn't make the game. Shame on me. He's blaming me. Do you think I wanted to jump off the cliff, land on an invisible ground, get up, and then land fine? Do you think I wanted that? No, what I would have liked if I jumped off the cliff and the horse just started flying off into the sky, and I could pilot it down to the next mission. That would have been perfect. But, you know, I didn't do that. Choose to navigate the labyrinth. Let's see what's at the end. The string he used to navigate the labyrinth, you see this? So I guess I need to follow that string and see what I find. It's a string. They had nothing to make a string with, so they used all their pubic hairs. They, they fashioned this ring of... <laughs> I'm so desensitized at this point to this shit. The pubic rope of life. In order to find a way, uh... In and out of the la oh, it stopped. You like my observation? It stops here. so mature. Oh, wait, no, it continues. Ugh, it's blood. Oh, God, bodies and blood. He had beautiful golden pubes that he used to make this string. Now I'm back to where I was. Oh, my God. Ugh. Oh. Can't go this way, dead end. Okay, this sucks. This officially sucks. Well, I'm whittling it down, but it's taking forever. I need to craft more arrows. I am whittling it down, though. I can't move, I'm stuck! I was fucking stuck, I'm gonna die now because the game fucked up. Now I can't die. There we go, now I heal. I dodged, it didn't work, I can't even see. Wow, what terrible game mechanics right now. I can't fucking see anything. Really bad. I guess I can't see anything. I can't see! Oh my god, look! I'm gonna die, I can't see. I'm done. I dodged and died. Yeah, it sucks, you can't dodge. The game sucks, man. I can't ever dodge that dash attack he does. Every time he does it, it hits me. I dash and he just hits me right through it. And then the camera fucks up and you can't see what's going on. <sighs> no, there's no proper lock on Ultimate Shadow. There's not. Especially with range, you can't lock on in this game. Nope. It's so dumb. Again, it's a Dark Souls boss fight in a game that doesn't have controls that work like Dark Souls. That's the problem. They made Dark Souls boss fights just like the animal fights. In a game that doesn't play like Dark Souls. Press dodge, didn't work. Uh. 
fun! So I tried range, doesn't work. I tried melee, I finished the first form easily, second form doesn't work. <laughs> oh my god. There you go, very nice. Oh, I can't said who made the axe for it and who actually walked up and handed it an axe. <laughs> very nice. Not too hard, just gotta bully it and blow up, build up your super, and then I was doing the overpower level 3 attacks, they were doing giant chunks off of him. And I, I was, uh, definitely I was abusing, um, definitely abusing the dodge, to dodge towards him and, and then just mash, basically. And you utilizing the ability where you can't die, the melee attack where you get basically voided up and can't die, that's why, what made it easy. <clears throat> Alright. Got his ass. Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my endgame conclusion stream of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Uh, we have just arrived at Katharia, or Kytheria, which I believe is an island with tons of kind of late game content. What I want to do is go hit up this viewpoint before I do anything and then decide what we're going to do next. I think the first thing we may do is either check out what some of these side missions are, or I believe oh, that God, a bunch good. of the legendary enemies are here. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna miss this game. You know, I played this game for about two months, and even though I played it on and off and I balanced it with lots and lots of other stuff, I did enjoy this game a lot. By the way, thank you to the mods for helping out today. Some trolls coming in, but they've taken care of the trolls. Thank you for that. So, please forgive me for one second while I uh, take out the trash in the stream chat. But, basically, it's Pumbaa. The boar is Pumbaa from Lion King, and it farts toxic farts. Remember, that's why Pumbaa had to be exiled and live with, with Timon, because all his other warhogs hated him because he smelled. <laughs> Fighting fucking Pumbaa. I should upgrade this blade from the Cyclops, too. When I was a young warthog! His personal aroma lacked a certain appeal. He would clear the savannah after every meal. I'm a sensitive soul, but I seem thick-skinned. And it hurt that my friends never stood downwind. <laughs> where am I going? <laughs> I started singing Lion King songs, and I forgot where the fuck I'm going. Leonie, I'll see you later. So ridiculously over the top, man. So... TM52 Twitch is asking, how is the stream so far? Great stream. Tons of progress. I already leveled up. I'm about to level up again, it looks like. I killed the freaking um, uh, Cyclops. And I'm doing a lot of quests here that are giving me tons of experience. So good progress. Lose a friend made a great point. He says, it's like the people who wrote this never heard of innuendo or being subtle or anything. <sighs> that guy, like I said, everything about that guy is freaking stupid innuendo. Written for like a five-year-old. <laughs> All right, maybe like a 13-year-old. <clears throat> you know what I mean? Like, they're just so crazy over the fucking top um, with their writing when it comes to stupid, you know, sexual stuff. And I agree, it's dumb. Like, it's so ham-handed. That's the best way to describe it, ham-handed. Like, there's just no reason for any of it. It's done so stupidly and clumsily that it's just embarrassing to play the game and see these stupid references. Like, why is this in here so that... Some 15-year-old kid who's playing could get horny or something and like the game. It doesn't make any sense. A normal person would not like this kind of reference in the game. You know what I mean? <sighs> like my observations, they're just so mature. I was actually talking to Kat about this the other day. And I was like, you know, you play a game like Mass Effect. And in Mass Effect, it's an ongoing dialogue between characters. You know, relationship building. By the end of the game, right, you could actually have, like, a main squeeze of romantic interest in that game. At least in that game, it makes sense. In the realm of this game, this makes no sense at all. These references are so crazy out of place. It's just so fucking insane. I don't know why they did it like that. <clears throat> to... The Temple of Aphrodite. Here we are. All over. Come here to worship Aphrodite. Oh, excuse me. Aphrodite, not Aphrodite. So you can kill me? Who sent you? Oh. I couldn't, I couldn't see the, the dialogue. It was blending in with the color of the bush. He only sent me. <laughs> I'm a friend. Kanji Monster says it's hard to focus when the graphics are trash. I'm, I've never been a graphics... A graphics... Uh, aficionado, I guess. I just never will have. 
It's nice if a game has pretty graphics, but I don't need it, you know? All of a sudden, two to three arrows hit my body at once. Fuck this game. Complete bullshit. Complete and utter bullshit. Yes, I have more than 50% health. I love this. Wow! And I'm wrecking everyone. All of a sudden, three arrows come from different directions, hit me at once, and insta kill me. Seal clap. <laughs> Great game. Terrible gameplay. Now I gotta fucking do the whole stupid thing over? Fuck that. What dumb shit. It's so dumb. Ugh. Where am I? Found him. There he is. <sighs> I do the whole fucking thing over because the fucking game is so dumb. Like I said, that's the problem with this combat engine. That is the major problem with the combat engine. Everyone is psychic, everyone has perfect aim. Unlimited spawning mercenaries. There's so so many flaws. It's a great game, completely hampered by a, a bad combat engine. Swagger says I should get a, me wearing a Santa cat emote. Well, that's not up to me. Like I said, I have no graphic design capability whatsoever. Probably up to someone who has it to do it. I'd be okay with that. I guess we drop one of the other emotes. Maybe probably the Spider-Man. Jam so far, he flew. What is this fucking dude? He's flying around. Every attack he does is fucking invincible. Yeah. Every attack he does is invincible, so fuck this guy. Fuck you. Uh, th what's up, Dark Spadilio? Good to see ya. Sorry to hear that people are harassing you. It happens all the time. What I strongly recommend you do is if you're on Twitch, and especially if you're going to be on my streams and be supportive, you got to turn off private messages unless it's only for friends. People will harass you because they're basically nutty. And they don't like that people support my efforts to continue doing what I do. They don't understand why people love it. Despite the fact that so many people do, so I strongly recommend that you turn that turn off so you don't get uh, harassed. All right, we have to hurry apparently. <clears throat> Diona was a cultist all along. <laughs> be watching. The bottom line is, do you honestly think a single person ever stopped supporting me because a bunch of people PM'd them on Twitch? Of course not. In fact, a lot of people even say it's the complete opposite because they get harassed by people, you know, for being supportive. They they come back and they're supportive again. Because they realize how messed up the situation is with these nutcases, so... People, they're just not very smart. But I am sorry to hear that you did get harassed, man. Like, my... My... Pri private messages have been off ever since I returned to Twitch. I knew I had to turn them off. There was no way I could leave them on because people were constantly spamming me and doing stupid shit, so... Ben Boxer did 100 bit said, nope, right. You know, no one, no one is going to suddenly is stop supporting me because of a, pr a private message, you know? Idiots. 
Bambino says, do you think the current iteration of combat in Assassin's Creed would have less complaints if it ran at a full 60 frames? Yeah. I don't know, like, even 60, the problem with the combat in this game is that not, it's not really the reaction of the combat, it's that number one, far too many enemies come after you and psychically know where you are at all times. And number two, the infinitely spawning fucking mercenaries. So if every archer wasn't in, had, didn't have homing arrows that curved and hit you, and if a hundred mercenaries didn't constantly fucking spawn on you, and if they didn't always know where you were no matter what, the combat would be a lot better. It's not realistic in that regard. So I think they just I don't really care about 60 frames. I just think they need to fix those things. Oh wait, it's not a bear, it's a boar. This is the one everyone says is tough as shit. I thought this was a bear, it's not. Well, I fucked up. I can't, I can't see, see shit. shit. PS4 new, please stop spamming or I'm gonna have to moderate you. You're spamming the chat now. You need to stop, dude. Get that ass banned. Alright, Swaggin's timed him out for uh, like 10 minutes. Yeah, I understand you're being silly, but you can't just fucking keep spamming, dude. You gotta relax. You gotta relax a little bit. She's supposed to be here. Where is she? Uh... What the hell? Did the game fucking glitch out on me? She's not here. This is definitely where she was before to give her the pelts. She's not here anymore. What the fuck? Uh... Anyone play this and know what the hell's going on? It looks like the whole thing glitched. She's not here. Oh, come on. Are you serious? Uh, this sucks. I can't trade him in. I have it selected as my mission. She's not here, and I can't. Re I can't finish now because of it. They fucked it up. It's glitched. You've got to be kidding. The game glitched! Oh, come on. It is. It's glitched. She's nowhere on the map at all. I did all this for nothing because the game glitched out and erased her from my fucking game. Are you kidding me? You've got to be joking me. She's nowhere to be found. Look. Loser French says she's on Chios. She knows she's not. There's no waypoint. Look. Yeah, it looks to me like the game's completely mm. fucked up. Yeah, look. Oh my god, that's it. Okay, didn't glitch out. I do need to go there. I need to get on my boat now. Yeah. I need to get on my boat and sail to a new island to trade these in, as stupid as that sounds. Alright, well, that is incredibly dumb, but I guess I have to do it. Because it's just nuts that it's always something. There's always something. That is really stupid. Why the hell did she move to an island that's level 46, so it's way higher than my level? That doesn't even make sense, considering the highest level, uh, the highest level animal is 39. Why would they make you sail to a level 46 island to redeem a quest that's level 39? Then again, this game does it stupid shit all the time, so... That's really dumb. Alright, I guess we're going over there. By the way, the game unselected it. Even though I had it selected on the map is where I wanted to go, they unselected it for no fucking reason. MTC dude, everything financially was fine for me until he asked, when did my financial trouble start? Basically 2015. 
even though, yeah, YouTube was plateauing and it was slightly declining, I was fine. I had calculated everything that I owed everyone financially and everything, and everything was fine until 2015 when the trolling ha happened. Basically when the ridiculous amount of false copyright strikes against DSP Gaming forced me to delete a bunch of fucking pre-stream videos, which dropped it millions of views, and then ended up getting me screwed over. Um... In search rankings. That day, my channel went from up here on YouTube to, like, down, down here. And that screwed me over. Why are they talking? They're just, like, blabbing about nothing. <laughs> but yeah, but then after that, it was just thing after thing after thing, you know? So first, my YouTube channel declined. I lost about a third of my income overnight. That's not even an exaggeration. About a third of my income went away overnight. Um... And then just things just got worse and worse with trolling and nasty shit against me. And I started losing opportunities. You know, it was terrible. And then, of course, there was the YouTube adpocalypse, which affected everyone negatively. So it was like, I was way up here, then I was here, then the YouTube adpocalypse happened, then I was down here. You know? Like, no lie, right now on YouTube, I make about a fifth of what I used to make. As crazy as that sounds. That that was an option. It thinks I'm in conflict. I'm not. Look. I'm not in conflict. They won't let me off my fucking boat. Dock the ship. Stupid. I definitely want to do another run through Mass Effect 2. I definitely want to do Grand Theft Auto 3 eventually. And I would like to do another run in Dark Souls 1 Remastered, which I never played, as maybe a sorcerer. Completely different, you know, build than what I've ever done before. No! 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 <laughs> no! I didn't think you would be. The path I set you on is fraught with danger. You could have been killed. Or given up. Here we go again with this stupid shit. There's nothing I face <laughs> that I haven't overcome. In the wild, it must have been stunning. It's fucking huge. Oh god. Here I was go. too busy trying to survive to wonder at the majesty of nature. <laughs> that should be all the belts. Yes, but your trial is not yet over. No. What do you mean? You have proven yourself a mighty hunter in the eyes of Artemis. What? But there is one creature you have yet to defeat. There's another one. This animal is no simple prey. What the hell? My sisters on the cliff overlooking our village for your final test. So it's not over. When? When you are ready. It's not over. <clears throat> TM52 Twitch says, is this as bad as the yeah. horse in uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 when you're using cinematic mode? I mean, not really, but this horse has hilarious physics glitches. This horse constantly just looks stupid, it floats. It fucking glitches and, and clips into shit. The horse is really messed up in this game. Gosh. He's done. Goodbye. Arrow's overpowered. Completely fucked. <laughs> Completely fucked. Wow. If we continue, one of us will die. Isn't that the point? I found Mati. Finally reunited. Only to lose each other again! Duh, you have a tree. Wow. He got completely dominated. And now he's dead. What happened? Huh? What just happened? Legend in the making. I don't even know what just happened. I have no idea. Uh. 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 Huh? What happened?
What's going on? No one knows. No one has any idea what's going on. I have no idea what's going on either. What just happened? <laughs> what the fuck? Um. Hmm. I don't even know what to say. I don't know what's going on. It's loading something. What the hell? Cookie, do you have any idea what the fuck's going on? I'm so lost. <laughs> uh. Talk about loss of immersion. Completely confusing, and then it cuts to loading for like three minutes. What the hell? Okay, what happened? Ugh, okay. Very slow stream chat right now. I don't know if people are falling asleep or whatever. We're in the big finale of the game. And people are, like, falling asleep. No one's talking to me. No one's really talking at all. I don't know what's going on. That would be a great time to talk, but, you know, everyone's quiet. Everyone piped up. Everyone went to use the bathroom at once, collectively, of course. All the hundreds of people watching, they all went to use the bathroom. All at the same exact time. That's what happened. <clears throat> so, if you're not interested, you probably just want to go take a dump or something. I don't know. Um, Almost there. Alright, I had enough. We got an obvious troll in the stream chat. I'm getting rid of him. <sighs> Being stupid. No, like, everyone's, like, quiet. Having a relaxed, you know, time with the end of the game. One guy has to come and be stupid. Please forgive me for one second while I uh, take out the trash in the stream chat. Get that ass banned. With Thespis. All right. That's done. Now I can do the other mission. Thank you, fast travel too. Yep. There's another mission right there. It might be the other one, so I might do that, too. <clears throat> Seriously, this is rid absolutely ridiculous. The friggin' the leader of, of Kythera, or whatever that that island was, that ends up being a cultist. The friggin' uh, the, the weird-ass dude who wanted to sleep with you the whole game. And now, this random woman. Everyone is, sleep, sleep with me, sleep, sleep with me, have sex with me, sleep with me. What the fuck kind of game is this, man? Like, I'm serious. Like, I'm actually angry. I'm 37 years... I'm 36 years old, I guess. I thought I was 37. 36 years old, I don't need to be constantly bombarded with this stupid shit. <laughs> That's not what I play the game for. Oh my god. Yeah, Swaggin says the devs are all virgins. Which is good, because we don't need their kids to grow up and make shit games. <laughs> oh my god. Seriously, what the fuck did they do the game like this for? It's ridiculously out of control. It actually pisses me off. Like my one, one of the major complaints I have. Oh right, yeah, I can find proof of Cleon's corruption right here. It's right next to me, so I might as well do it. What the fuck? Why are they even attacking me? Everyone in this building is attacking me, including the regular women. What the shit? I'm just gonna hang out here until they go away. That was stupid as hell. They all just started attacking for no reason. I didn't even fucking do anything. Ugh. This sucks. I can't do the fucking mission. Fuck this. I'll go do. I'll go trade in the other mission because this mission's all fucked up now. Because the stupid idiots got alerted for absolutely no reason. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Play cool. I don't know if I'm gonna finish it because the ending is ridiculously stupid and drawn out. But it, it's taking so fucking long to do these final missions because they're multi-part stupid missions, and now we got people getting alerted for no reason. 
I just want to finish this game at this point. <clears throat> like, how long could it be fucking drawn out? What a great play! Yes! Yeah! Seal clap! Come on, it's so tedious and stupid. Instead of just letting me end the plot, I gotta do tedious, busy work to finish the game. Ugh. It's a shame. Like, why couldn't it, there have been a big epic end when you fought your brother? That would have been the perfect way to end it. No. We must continue with boring tedium. It must continue. I don't want to climb the building! Oh my god! <laughs> Stupid. This is like unbearable. It won't end. And I can't fucking get to where I need to do to finish it. I'm afraid to stand up because one of the guards might detect me through five walls. Knowing this game. I didn't want to do this. I wanted to climb the building, but she runs down instead. Now I'm stuck here in a wrong area that I didn't want to go in. Oh my fucking god. Well, stop fucking whining. How about that? Grow up. Change your diaper. There we go. What's going on? What the fuck? Look at this. <laughs> that's the first time that's ever happened. Frozen in place. Gl another glitch in the fucking animus. What the hell was that? Holy Jesus. Uh, what is that? What the fuck is that? What's going on? What the fuck? Look at this. Anyone know how much is actually left in the game? It's looking to me like I have to do another sash in, which is okay, I guess, but a little disappointing when I really thought this was it for it to, and it's not an ending now. Um. Here's a guy. Hello. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Come on now. You know you want some. Take that fucking axe. Yeah. My, eye, my right eye started burning yet again. God damn it. I'm gonna do this with one eye. Alright, here he is. Again? I have to fight him again? I already feel, beat this guy once. I gotta beat him again? Is it the same exact fight a second time? Where is she? Why is Cassandra not helping? <clears throat> Someone took me a dollar, but it's bringing up some kind of phantom beef between me and, and, and some other content creators. I don't even know what the hell he's talking about. I'm just going to ignore it. I really am. I don't know what the people are talking about. They make shit up all the time now. <laughs> I don't know why people are asking about Alabama. I have no idea. You tell me. Probably something stupid, I'm sure. <laughs> I'm sure it's something dumb. Someone's... Uh, someone says some issues in stream chat. I don't know what else to say. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> let's continue. What you guys sadly have to realize is that since there are so many people who basically steal my content and... Illegally rebroadcast. Re they have like really dumb, immature inside jokes and stuff that they say on their own streams. Then they, they have people come over and bring it to my stream. I, I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What does Alabama have to do with anything I'm doing in the game right now? I don't know. But they get a kick out of getting me to say it or something. I don't know. You tell me. Like, if you were on a random streamer and you just automatically had them start talking about like peanut butter and toe jam sandwiches, would you laugh hysterically because you think it's funny? Like, I don't know. Like, I guess I'm, I'm too old for that shit. But to me, that just sounds so fucking stupid. Wow, I made a streamer talk about something completely unrelated to what they're doing on their stream. Har, har, har. Wow. Okay, then. You really accomplished something in life. <clears throat> okay. The spear. Yep. Oh, happy ending. Yes. I've done terrible things. He's magically overcome we'll with, with reason. Yes. yes. 
You can't yeah, right. protect anyone. Can you? Oh, shit. I called it. Maybe we both should have died here that day. But <gasps> oh, my God. The gods are cruel. <sighs> Well, as I was saying. I tried to save you. Stop living in the past, sister. You're dead. Oh, there's an invisible wall. This family for the last I want to time. kick him off the ledge. They won't let me. But that's where you're wrong. You there's an invisible wall, I think. Yeah, there is. We knew she was. I, I had the feeling she was gonna die at the end of the game. I really did. I didn't think there was gonna be any happily ever after ending. I just thought that at least we'd have some kind of a choice that mattered, but apparently it didn't. And now our whole family's dead. Wow. Great. And what's her name? The little girl, too. Basically, not only her real family, but, you know, the girl who's kind of like her, her friend or daughter or sister. Everyone's dead at the end of the game. They're all fucking dead. What a great... What a great ending. Jeesh. Your whole family's dead. They're all fucking dead. You're fucked. Ah, dinner in Sparta. Enter your childhood home. Yeah, now that everyone's dead, enter your childhood home. What? Okay. Yeah, they're all dead. Failed. Solid Metal Gear Rex says you gotta kill all the cult members to get the helmet. What's the point of that? If they're all dead, there's nothing else to do in the game. <laughs> Unless I guess you, you save the Medusa for the very end. Poor Cassandra, all by herself. No Phoebe, no mother, no brother. Everyone's fucking dead. Only the bird. She lives a life of solitude for the rest of her life. That's a shitty ending. I'm not gonna lie. For novels, I... I'd never doubt them. Thank you for giving her the burial she deserved. There are countless others here in Elysium. The blessed have earned that eternal happiness. One of them is our great Pericles. Athens owes him a debt for all he's done. They didn't call him the first citizen of Athens for nothing. A man of many contributions, but also a private. Don't. Well, let me be fair, he was dying of the plague anyway. Hmm. He died, or he was the one who got <clears throat> sick and died. The sickness hit. If only he had shared his burden. We all. No! Sure, we're gonna have a drink. We got a dollar tip for so many poorly paid. <laughs> Get it? A takeoff on when I say poorly made. A long time fan, never tipped before. Feeling the holiday spirit, enjoying the stream, so here you go. Well, thank you very much. Feel his cup. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ho, ho, he wants to have sex with him against his, his consent. It's hilarious. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Oh. It's that Athenian humor. Everybody fuck now. That ball to cock, smacking him in the face with it. If they say stop it, just ignore them and keep on slapping them. <laughs> Remember, yes means no, and no means yes. That's right, see guys, grab a girl and don't wait. Take their virginity without permission, rip off their pants, and get to your mission. <laughs> yes. Oh, he wants to have sex with him. It's hilarious. Oh, I'm seven years old. Oh, yes. Goodbye. What's my favorite type of pasta? Ask Who TV. My honest answer? Probably like rotini. I think I like rotini pasta better than anything. Oh, you're probably just looking for the meme answer. What pasta do you prefer? I prefer a penne. Easy to eat. That's the guy. That's the guy who gives me the missions. <laughs> 
Do you know there's like a guy in uh, our group right now who's like streaming this whole thing? He's sort of like semi-famous. Oh, I do. I think that's Darkside Phil. He was the guy that got caught for masturbating in front of children. Yeah, oh, that's so what, he, he was caught masturbating. I think he's like 35 <laughs> years old. Oh my god. Yeah, he was masturbating in front of children. That's on right. YouTube. Yeah. Live stream. Hilarious. He's like he's a, he's a pervert or something. I think he's a That's pervert right. I'm a huge something. pervert, guys. That's all I do. I just masturbate constantly in front of children. You're absolutely right. <laughs> that's you what I'm known caught. for. You got exposed for doing that. That's I got pro that's completely like, exposed. Absolutely. Yeah, you did. I, you didn't I even know, know the camera demon. was on. You know every you inch of you know every guy? inch of my dick and balls. Are you the guy? Right? You know every you the inch guy? of my dick and balls. It's the guy <laughs> watching his Twitch. Is that really him? Is he the yes. one that got caught, Matt? Yes. Really? yes. Apostle Master, you think that this, would I agree? This game lost the Sasuke energy and is closer to that of God of War or Shadow of War. I mean, yet there's very little to this game that has to do with Assassin's Creed anymore. In fact, the whole plot has nothing to do with it. Quite honestly, it really doesn't. The plot does not feel like a Assassin's Creed at all, right? It didn't work at all. I wanted to stealth kill, didn't let me. I was holding triangle, didn't do anything. Swang says the game is an amalgamation of Witcher 3 and a literal pile of shit. Wow. What a nice thing to say, Swag. Thanks. Thanks for being el how elaborate you are in your uh, opinions. Wait. <laughs> there, there's more. <laughs> you should have been more little. You should have said, what kind of shit? Dog shit? Donkey shit? What kind of shit? Wait. There's more. <laughs> Squirrel shit? Giraffe shit? Wait. There's more. There you go. Swagging says it's a mix of The Witcher 3, mixed with orangutan shit, put in a blender, mixed with the shit of a large bison. And then co combined with The Witcher 3, you end up with a beautiful abomination. There you go. What is your major <laughs> malfunction, num nuts? Elliot Roger123 says, I just changed my name to prank someone. Now I'm stuck with this for two months. That's why you don't do that. It's stupid. That's why you don't do stupid things, because then you have to live with the consequences of those stupid decisions. <laughs> Voltage Max says, do the Trouble in Paradise quest log. It's one of the best, and it's in my it's in my log right now. Okay. Let me do let me finish this up. Like I said, if I can do like one more world takedown thing here, I can do the big fight. I'll do that, and then Trouble in Paradise, uh, I'll, I'll do that next, I guess. If it's a lot of experience, especially. <clears throat> Polini. Welcome to Polini. Are there any more quests with Steelies? Oh wow, this guy's got a magnificent bronze ass. And a little a little dingy a little dingy. Uh, Look, he's got a little a little dingy. Yeah, Can I climb I can't yeah, climb the statue? What the hell? Yeah, oh, there we go. What it is is they don't want you to grab his dingy. They want you to grab his ass, not his dingy. Yeah, That's what it is. That's right, dinghy. I couldn't say what it really was. I just called it a dinghy to be more PC. I realize many of you are like four or five year olds who watch me on stream. We all know this. So we have to make sure that it's nice and, and PC for you guys. The dinghy. <laughs> And look what happened because of fucking Tevin and his shithead fan base. The hate hit me a dollar and said, GSP is an Italian. How do you feel the game represents your culture? I don't know. I didn't live in this time period. I couldn't tell you. <laughs> couldn't tell you how accurate it is. But I kissed a guy for a million dollars for two seconds? That's fucking... St what a stupid question. I'm not... Let me put it this way. I am not... Um, like, like, unsure of my sexuality. I am 100% heterosexual. And I know that if I were to kiss a guy, it wouldn't mean anything. It would just be stupid. But then again, would I pull a stupid stunt for like that? For $2 million? I mean, I don't know if I would degrade myself that much. Oh, good. I'm out of here. Fuck this game. 
Why do I have to kill the polo mark if I kill the nation leader? It's fucking dumb as fuck. I don't get credit for the base. <clears throat> fuck this. I'm out. Death proof, you gotta blame the game. He says, why aren't we gonna see the Medusa boss for days? Blame the game. The game has this ridiculous re required grind to do shit. It shouldn't be like that. <clears throat> Quite frankly, I don't understand why the Medusa boss is a secret boss to begin with. It is part of the plot you found with the, with the Atlantis quest line. But why do you have to be so fucking high level? Why could you beat the main story around level 40, but then the next thing in the game is level 50? It doesn't even make any sense. It's just bad game design. No. Curse 2000 Gaming says they wanted you to buy the experience boost. It's obvious they did. Considering that there were three separate times during the game where I had to grind to even progress with the main story, it's obvious they wanted you to waste money on the experience boost. <laughs> Isn't that cute? But it's wrong! Because they wanted your money. I'm tired of talking about the fucking money. Dressed in a dirty disguise? Yeah, it's very dirty disguise, you're right. Do I really look like a spy to you? Podarkis and his men have been hunting and killing us without mercy. Okay, fade to white. What happened? What happened? Right in the middle of her sentence. Right in the middle of her fucking sentence. What happened? What happened? What happened? It glitched. Spies are everywhere. I'm at Fuse's. Uh, here's another person. If you trigger the right dialogues, you can you can trigger like a lesbian love scene. Jesus, this game this and is its fucking stupid love scenes for no reason. Uh, here, Revelation, which I'll never use. Revelation. We'll upgrade that. <laughs> okay then. <clears throat> All right. This game was good, but it was really stale if they released another without vast improvements. I agree, Poops. They're like, this is the second one, and as I said when I was playing the, the main campaign of this game, this game wasn't bad. In fact, it was good. The problem is it feels like you just played it, because technically you just played it. If you played uh, Assassin's Creed uh, Origins last year, this is pretty much the same game. So I totally understand why some people would be like, man, this game isn't very good because it's the same game you just played. You know what I mean? That's Podarkis they want me to kill. I wonder if, you know what, while I'm here, I might just do this stuff too. What is this? Grin and Barrett and the Socratic Method. Why not? Let's go see what these missions are. Right? Where are they? I just marked it on my map, and it's not anywhere. I, I hate that about this fucking game. Look, I just marked it on my goddamn map. I just... Look, it's marked. Where is it? Look. There it is. Why does it not show up on the compass? It should. It should be on the compass and also on your screen. Not one or the other. It should be on both. Because I like using the compass. I don't like staring at the screen and looking for an icon hidden in the fucking background. At least that's just me. <clears throat> Am I toxic? Yeah, congrats, stupid. Some idiot just mentioned uh, a detractor in the stream chat. <laughs> what a moron. Yep, I'm toxic. Sorry about that. Okay. Now I feel stupid. And I should. Marlon Tan, you are a really bad troll. Like, you're trying to, like get attention for yourself and say stupid things and no one pays attention to you it's pretty funny that's pretty pathetic that you're you're so like adamant on getting like a rise a rise out of me or other people and no one gives a shit about you <laughs> i'm just saying he said something else completely like dumb and stupid i'm not even gonna fucking say what he said it's so dumb why do i get the feeling this is a some kind of bait <laughs> no isd captain there's no special event happening via off of these subs these subs were not planned and our, we already hit the sub goal for the month, and that's all that's happening, so. Boo this man! Get him out of here! Oh, it's a ridiculous love option. That makes no fucking sense, yeah. Your dad. I could kiss you. Also, he's your dad. Here we go again. Oh my god, stop it. The job is done. Payment. Give orders. 
Oh my god, not again. Oh. Your men are brave, but they won't be enough. We need those re Snake Laugh X Goat Laugh, the same guy who got banned earlier tonight from mentioning the tractors, and now he's asking me, will I ever play old games again? No, from now on, I'm only going to play games that were released in the last seven minutes. <laughs> there you go. Okay, took care of a couple of idiots in the stream chat who are basically being really annoying and distra disturbing everyone and talking about stupid shit, so they're gone now. No worries. <clears throat> no worries. Back to the chill vibe of the chill stream. <laughs> I want full scan, even though I'll never use it. There you go. I'm a retard. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate with the Ewoks in the trees of Endor. It's like the end of Return of the Jedi. Soldier Front to me five dollars. The only reason why you have haters is because they make money off. If you take that away, they'll go away. I completely disagree. Most of the people who hate on me aren't making money off of it at all. There's a few people who are, but most of them are not, okay? So that's just a misconception. Uh, in fact, a lot of the people who used to have entire groups and societies hating on me uh, didn't make a dime on it. So that's not true at all. Um, it's more, for me, my opinion, it's more about the attention and the feeling of camaraderie, having some kind of a common thing to make fun of or degrade or degenerate rather than fucking actually having something positive to work towards, but they still feel like they have a common place where there's someone like them because in real life, they don't have a good life. That's really what it must be. Lonely Girl says, let me say the fact, if you're being toxic online, it means you aren't happy because happy people don't care about being toxic. You're right. I love my streams. I would much rather sit here and positively play games and have fun and interact with all of you in a positive way than sit here and make fun of someone who's doing that. That's just me. Like, I love doing it. So that's why I, I do it. If you can't be successful doing the positive thing, then you go and do the negative thing. And also, let's also be very honest here. What's, what's the easier thing to do to creatively make your own positive content? Or to try to tear down someone who does. Someone who's already doing all the hard work and all you do is sit there and make fun of them. What's harder? The answer is to make the positive content for sure. So let's not make any two bones about it. People with no fucking talent do negative shit while people who have talent do positive stuff. It's that simple. King of Hypocrisy says, How do I manage to remain positive after all the, the stuff I've been through over the years? Two things. Number one, because I honestly love what I do. I love video games. I love... Playing video games and sharing those experiences with you and seeing your live reactions and us having fun together. I love that. As in, I'm having that as my occupation, I'm the luckiest dude on the fucking planet. Seriously, I love it so much. So I don't want to give that up because I absolutely love what I do. And also the fact that every single time that I've come up against the hardship, we find a way through it. There hasn't been a single thing that's come up yet that we haven't solved. And, you know, this, this one that I'm up against right now is the toughest one I've ever faced. Right? But... We've already made some good headway. We'll see how things go over the next, you know, few weeks and, of course, the next few months into April. If we can get past this, what's the next one? You know what I mean? Like, we keep going. We keep, no matter how much shit happens to me, we still win in the end. So, that's why I just, I gotta keep myself going, man. You don't give up, like, at that point. For me, it's more of a it mental game. If I could just put up with the mental game of the stress of all the shit, then, you know, I'm good to go. And it, sometimes it's tough, but... I gotta do it. <clears throat> Bambino says, would it, would it be fair to say that my hardships that I've been through have contributed to my rage on some games in recent years, or do I genuinely find them bad? You know, it's a combination, because absolutely, there are games that just piss me off, you know? And some people are like, oh, he overreacts. You know, it is. It's compounding. It's absolutely compounding, because <clears throat> the bottom line is, this is the funny thing. When I was a big YouTuber... And I was getting hundreds of thousands of views on my videos. And I was making ridiculous money. I never talked about Patreon. I never had to talk about contribute this way, contribute that way. I never had to run an advertisement. I never had to get a sponsorship. I never had to do anything like that. So, of course, I seemed like a guy who was totally into the content and never had to do that shit. Then all of a sudden, you know, things things went wrong, basically. And didn't weren't going as well. And I wasn't super popular anymore. And then, oh, you're not like the old Phil anymore. And it's like... I'm not like the old Phil because of the things that happened that forced me to change. I didn't change first. Actually, I was staying the same way that I was. Then all that stuff happened to me. And then the Phil had to change in order to, to basically adapt and, and be sure that I could make enough money to keep make a living. You know what I mean? So 
these things that happened to me caused this rage to build up inside of me. And yeah, I'll admit, you know, I'm sure there's been games where I get overly angry or it, it causes an overreaction maybe. If, if everything were hunky-dory, and I, again, I was back to the old Phil, and things were, I was making tons of money or whatever, what would I really have to be angry about? You know what I mean? I'd probably just laugh it off, play a bad game and laugh it off. Oh, well, the game sucks, right? Versus now, it's like that rage is built up about all this other shit, and it explodes when I get angry about games. So it's true. It's absolutely true to some extent. <clears throat> I'm infected with rage. <laughs> no, I'm not infected with rage. Thank God I'm not like that where I'm just constantly angry and raging. That's not the case. At least anymore for sure, I'm not like that. Maybe at one time years ago, but not anymore. Fuck your mother. The game Fuck is your a mother. piece of fucking now shit. Six, Fuck dumb this. fucking Dude, this idiots sucks. who made this game. This fucking Drag sucks. races don't have this terms like that, fucking stupid. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> what the yeah. fuck? They started Ghost me facing the fucking... Ghost are you games. kidding I don't me? Know how to they started games. me facing <laughs> the acid. So when Idiot. I reached... How big of a YouTuber will, were, was I? Well, every part of my playthroughs, at a minimum, would get like 10,000 views. You're talking new playthroughs would get anywhere from 50 to 100,000 views on each part. So I would do a new playthrough and get millions and millions of views and make tons of money on every playthrough I did. You know, I was always in the top rankings, like the top 10 gaming YouTubers on YouTube. You would search for a game and I'd be in the top 10 every fucking time, you know? Any stress relieving tips I can give? The only tip I can tell you is when you're when you're done with whatever causes you stress, you have to disconnect from it. That's why when I'm not streaming on Twitch, right, and playing games, I'm doing something completely different. I'll go watch some pro wrestling. I'll play a mobile game on my phone. I'll watch a movie or a TV series. I have to unplug from that. I couldn't play video games all day, then relax with video games, then watch other streamers, then watch other YouTubers. I, it would drive me fucking nuts. And because of that, because I can disconnect and keep my mind not thinking about that shit during the day, it helps me to relax. Two things. Number one, because I honestly love what I do. I love video games. I love playing video games and sharing those experiences with you and seeing your live reactions and us having fun together. I love that. As I'm having that as my occupation, I'm the luckiest dude on the fucking planet. Seriously, I love it so much. Most prolific YouTuber, you just said a racial slur, so you better stop or you're gonna get banned. It's that simple. Uh, no one in the streets even talking to me anymore, so I'm gonna call it a night soon, guys. Sorry, but if people aren't gonna pay attention, I'm not gonna fucking keep playing. The shakes were almost to level 47. I was gonna keep going until we hit 47, but now we got people talking about the most random shit that has nothing to do with anything. Stuff that I'm not gonna talk about. <laughs> The sale says, wouldn't it be beneficial to upgrade the ship? There's no point. We're at the end of the game. There's nothing else to, to really upgrade, and it's not going to make a difference anymore. Well, the bottom line is, if Article 13 passes, pretty much no one's going to be able to do this for a living ever again anyway. So I certainly hope that the people who live in Europe actually are taking it seriously. Because I can't do anything about it. I live in the U.S. If you let Article 13 pass the way it is, we're all fucked. The pwn cake did... Uh-oh. It's not often a beautiful. Oh no. 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 We shouldn't talk like this with Nileas in this condition. No. No. Thank you, Miss. Alright, the pole cake cheered. Feel free to check back anytime. No. And now for something completely different. Why kill the coldest if I'm not gonna finish the coldest plotline says dude frozen? I didn't say I wasn't going to. I never said that. I said my main focus is Medusa, but I would maybe like to do that too, because there's only two plot lines left as the cultists and Medusa. So the two history. Well then. That's one way to do it, I guess, right? I tried to parry, didn't work. All right. There we go. Welcome. 
Honeycomb Punch! What? I had 100% health. Apparently, I got hit twice and lost all my health. That made zero sense. It better have saved. After I leveled up, it better have saved. That's fucking stupid. I was just trying to switch my melee attacks to kill him instantly, which I would have been able to do. Somehow, I lose 100% health in two hits. Right. <clears throat> right. Whatever you fucking say, you stupid game. <laughs> They'll be watching for me. It, you gotta be kidding me. It, it reset. It actually reset. What a piece of fucking shit. It reset. Fuck this. This is terrible. I already finished. I already did the fucking mission, you stupid garbage. This is the times that this game fails hideously. I already fucking did this, you stupid game. Well, stop fucking whining. How about that? Grow up. Change your diaper. Why'd I do zero damage? Oh my god, here we go. Why is she not attacking the guy? You gotta be kidding me, she attacks everyone but the target. Everyone but the guy you're supposed to kill. Dude, I can't, I can't target him. The game will not allow me to target this guy. Look, I can't. It won't let me target him. I can't hit him. Even though he's right in front of me, the game won't let me hit him. It's fucking glitched out. I can't hit him. Oh my god. You cannot target this man. It will not let you target this person. I can't hit him. Oh my god. Is this some kind of a cruel fucking joke? What the fuck? The game will not let me hit him. Look at this. Finally! Oh my god! That's taken care of. Now, the doctor mentioned strange things happening in the city. What a dumb fucking game. <laughs> that was so fucking stupid. <laughs> yes, the point I'm making, Ryuhabuza, but you can't hit unless you're locked on. Uh, I can't lock on. The game doesn't allow you to lock on to that guy. It was a glitch. The game glitched! So he's your target, but the game refuses to let you lock on to him. You know, let alone the fact that I already killed him. <laughs> really stupid. Stupid. Get these stupid bounties. Okay. So now, Dude Frozen says when doing a predator shot, hold R2 when firing and control the arrow. Oh really? I played the entirety of the game and I didn't know that. <laughs> Seriously? I played the entire game. I had no idea you could hold R2. To control the shot. <clears throat> the bottom line is, again, I can be good at games if I want to. Party now! There we go. <clears throat> oh, these are cultists? I didn't even know that. Damn, tossed. Uh, 
Every enemy now has super armor. Complete nonsense. Every super armor, super armor, super armor, super armor, super armor, super armor. How about some normal combat? Instead of every enemy has full super armor on every attack. How about that? Every time I press a button, super armor, super armor, super armor, super armor. What the fuck? Everyone's Superman now. <clears throat> yes, everyone is Superman. <clears throat> what great combat. Stupid shit. Uh, wrong, Cresta Angel. It's super armor. That's why they glow orange. Because it's uninterruptible attacks. It's stupid shit. Snort, 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 snort. <clears throat> every enemy now has super armor on every attack and can kill you with two hits. Even though they're, they're your equal level. It makes no sense. <clears throat> Basically, the, the combat engine does not scale well at all in this game. It should scale much better than it does. Here we go again. Well, that was easy. Just need to use my arrows. <clears throat> no surprise, it's cultists. Every major plotline in the game, even the side quests, lead to another. This looks like the place. <clears throat> cultists, cultists, and more cultists. Which is fine, because that's what I'm trying to do kill the cultists. So at least this plotline led to something good. How could you pair, uh, compare other gamers to fucking Ninja? You can't. There's no other gamer that's ever going to be as good as Ninja. He's the best at everything in life skill, looks. Talent, I mean, you know, comedy, everything. You can't fuck with that. At least that's what all the media says, so I gotta believe it. <laughs> Here's the Poseidon statue. Which is funny, because this is Poseidon her dad, right? Uh, Poseidon's her dad. WRONG! Incredible. Phidias was right. The artist has captured Poseidon in all his magnificence. Oh, yeah, all his magnificence right there, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I guess I can upgrade my armor, too. I'm gonna end up running- Yeah, I'm gonna run out of resources, though. Let's see. Very expensive to upgrade. Damn, it's a messed up ending. Mysterious! Mysterious! Kumite! Kumite! Kumite. <laughs> wow. Did I watch the cartoon Tailspin back in the day? Yes, I did. All the trouble we've been in with another tailspin. Hey, spin it now. Oh, we are. 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 Humble, bumble, but up, but up. Spin it, let's begin it. If you're in it and you win it, and you bit a bit of it when you spin it, spin it, spin it. Oh, yeah. When you spin it, bop, 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 tail spin. Here you go. <clears throat> Quinn asks, after the Medusa is, is Assassin's Creed complete? Well, no. The last thing would be to kill all the cultists, but I would have to have someone guide me to. Oh, shit. Here you go. I'd have to have someone guide me to figure out. Um. I'd have to have someone guide me to figure out where they are, wh where to go, and do the quest lines to unlock them. Because a lot of the cultists you can't fight until you complete a quest line first. <clears throat> I think I got like 10 left or something like that. So if I wanted to, I could basically do one more session where I try to kill every cultist. And that would be what that would be like 100% completion. Because that's all the major content of the game. 
Yes, yeah, Sam says his character's level 51. He's still struggling to kill certain enemies. Respect. Respect your character. In fact, I'll show you right now what I did. I respect my character to have all the best abilities in the entire game. And here it is. This is the best build you can have, okay? So, maxed out Predator Shot. Maxed out Archery Master. Maxed out Overpower Bow Strikes. I don't even use Ghost Arrows, but apparently it's good, but I've never used it. Um... I don't even use Heavy Attack or Sparta Kick, but I have them. But Maxed Out Healing, Maxed Out Weapons and Armor Master and Gear Master as well. Maxed Out Overpower Attacks, Maxed Out Shield Breaker, and Maxed Out Battle Cry. Then over here, uh, Assassination. So best assassination possible. Hero Strike is the, probably the best melee attack in the game. Critical Assassination is Stealth Master, the best stealth uh, things in the game. Then I basically upgraded this, even though you don't really need it. Better sight around you. And basically, I can't I can't be stopped now. Just if it's a cheesy-ass enemy hits me once or twice and insta-kills me, I die. But outside of that, I'm pretty much, you know, beating everything, so. <clears throat> oh, they're lesbians on Lesbos, get it? Totally gay! So, Smunga says that I know that there's DLCs out for this game. I'm not going to play them. I told you guys, I'm not putting any more money into these games for DLCs anymore, even if they're good. I don't see the point. Nah, I don't think I'm new. I, I don't think I'm very new. I'm just another year older, another year wiser, another year stinkier, gassier. <laughs> That's how it works. When you're a dude, you just get older, hairier, stinkier, and gassier. Hopefully wiser. But all those other things come with it, too. Right. This a steely keep this a fucking steely all right i guess i should probably regenerate my arrows or remake arrows here here we go finally after all this time i get to fight the goddamn medusa <clears throat> i can't do anything I couldn't see a thing. The camera fucked up and glitched. So I couldn't do anything to that. Yeah, that was really stupid. The camera glitched. Now I can't dodge. I'm pressing square. Nothing's happening. Yeah, it's the game. It's fucking up. I don't know what's going on. I didn't do that. Yeah, I didn't do that. I never melee attacked. I was trying to use the arrows. Okay, great. can't hit her. Look at this. It's like a glitched fight. The hitboxes aren't accurate at all. Yeah, it's messed up. I can't move. When she does that ability, it doesn't work properly. Look at the camera's glitching. What the fuck? Stupid game. Oh, here we go again. Okay. Let me grab more arrows now. Yeah, the camera keeps glitching. <laughs> I love it. 
I keep clipping and glitching through stuff, and I can't, the camera won't stay, like, straight ahead. It's fucking stupid. <clears throat> okay. Fuck, it doesn't count. Look at that, it's glitched again. It doesn't it doesn't hit it right. Went through her body and didn't hit her. He's almost dead. I right, one more crafting of arrows. It's almost over. Almost over. Yeah, I couldn't move. Again, it glitches. Glitch goes through her body. Oh my god, it's so glitchy. Oh my god, really? Alright, it should be it. Bye. <clears throat> All that build up and it was that quick says monkey heal monkey. Yeah, you have to do that much leveling to do it. And then you do it and it's like, it's a stupid crappy, like, knockoff fucking Dark Souls boss fight. With bad, with bad fucking mechanics. There's the rose. Oh boy. The Someone rose of love. I tell you. That it's always something. There's always something. <clears throat> I'm honestly not surprised that Medusa was a letdown. I'm not. Where's daddy? Where's daddy Poseidon? There he is. Oh, daddy. Daddy, I brought you the artifacts, daddy. Do you love me now, daddy? Atlantis That's right, he was Pythagoras. Not Py not Poseidon, he was Pythagoras. Yes, I feel stupid. Yes, I feel stupid. God damn it. I can't believe how dumb I am. <laughs> what the fuck? That didn't even make sense. Okay. Sure. That shouldn't have worked, but okay, she's got it. <laughs> that was silly. I just like how they got a little a little segment here to pretend like she's important. And to pretend like, oh, you need to do something with her. You need to solve a small puzzle. Very critical to the story. Yeah, okay. <laughs> TSP t Boss counter says, Quick, someone get a Steely! Steely solve everything in this game. There's so much of the story I haven't seen. I should go back to the Animus and visit Cassandra again. What? That doesn't even make sense. That seriously makes no sense. 
You got the artifact you needed? This is the whole point of the game was that she was trying to find these artifacts and find out the truth. She goes back to the fucking Animus? Why? But of course, you know why, so you could go back and do all the content you didn't do yet. I didn't kill all the, the, uh, cultists yet, so now I could go and kill all the cultists and all that. But that's kind of silly. I'm gonna go back in. What? You did everything. <laughs> so now, ladies and gentlemen, I have a secret I need to reveal to all of you. I, too, am immortal. I'm actually a demigod like Cassandra, and I've lived many, many lifetimes. And this lifetime in particular, I've chosen to be a content creator on the internet, but I've done many, many things in the past. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, right. <clears throat> I've chosen this life. I want to keep continuing this life. It's such a unique and entertaining and fun life. I want to keep doing it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, anyway, so that's it for that. There's much to do. And mm. many unknowns on our horizon. So. <clears throat> that's that for that, right? It's completely done now. Um... All that's left is to fully upgrade the spear once I kill the final 11 cultists, right? Which means I need to find the final 11 cultists. Um, I don't know where they are. I don't know if any of these lead to them, you know? What I would have to do, if I do want to actually finish up the game and do the final thing with the cultists, I'd have to look it up. I couldn't be able to, I wouldn't be able to do it myself. <clears throat> Only because, um... Only because it seems to me that they're very elusive. You know what I mean? The 11 left, and I don't see really a single way to figure out where the hell they would be. Um... <clears throat> So, open the cultist menu. All right, I will. Let me go over here, and then we'll open the cultist menu, and we'll see. Obviously, this is the end of today's session. I'm not doing it today. I would consider doing maybe, like, one more major session where it's just the cultist hunt, where all I do is hunt down the remaining 11 cultists and try to finish that up. Um, if, if, you know, people would actually help me to do it, obviously. So... All right, so next stream, which I will do, I think I will. I've put enough time into it. I think I'll do probably one more session. Try to seek out where these these characters are, take them out, and try to finish up with the the uh, cultists. Okay. So pretty sweet. What I want to do is I want to see how long the hell has this been. Overwrite. <clears throat> fifty-five hours and still going. Actually, fifty-six hours. And all right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to what appears to probably be the final session of Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now, if we have a lot of difficulty finding them, uh, a viewer sent me a list of all the cultists, basically sh saying, okay, I guess what you do is you look for the name of the cultist, and then it'll give you the map location. So if we need to do that, I have it on my phone. <clears throat> but obviously, I'd like to give it an honest shot trying to do it the right way first, okay? They really did copy the mercenaries out of, off of the... Uh, the this the the uh, Shadow of War, or Shadow of Mordor, Shadow of War gameplay, because that's exactly what it is. It's the Nemesis system. No shit. Wow, that's it. <clears throat> that's the quest. <clears throat> well, that was exciting. Well, that, well, that was, was exciting. exciting. Wow. A stealth stab and then a fucking headshot. Done. <clears throat> wow. So you have to me a dollar. He says, are the photos annoying or do they add something? What, you mean the photos on the world map? No, it's just screenshots people made and they are annoying because you're trying to fast travel and they fucking take up a spot. It's annoying as hell. <clears throat> So much for the silver griffin. What? Okay, apparently I missed, even though I was dead on. 
Uh, a cove on Scavenger's Coast in Achaya. So I need to go to Scavenger's Coast in Achaya. <clears throat> Where the hell is Scavenger's Coast? Okay. Now let's get a good look at you. Hold it. Run that back. Wait a minute. Go right. There, freeze that. Full screen. Okay, freeze that. Tighten up on that wheel. Vector in on that guy by the back wheel. Zoom in right here on this spot. With the right equipment, the image could be enlarged and sharpened. What's that? It's an enhancement program. Can you clear that up any? I don't know. Let's enhance it. Enhance section A6. I enhance the detail and... I think there's enough to enhance. Release it to my screen. Enhance the reflection in her eye. Let's run this through video enhancement. Edgar, can you enhance this? Hang on. Chaya, it's Arcadia. Malice, Macedonia. Lesbos. Samos. Kronos, Delos. Kos. I don't see a Chaya. Uh, Achaya, Scavengers Coast. Well, Dude Froze is trying to help, and Darth B the Corn's being a dick. How about you don't be a dick, Darth B the Corn? If the guy wants to help me find the clue so we can kill the cultists, let him help me so we can kill the cultists. All right, just fucking cut it out. <clears throat> I hate people like that. How dare you on an interactive stream help the streamer find something so the stream can be interesting? Oh. Shut up. Yep, I'm toxic. If people could just be nice to me for a change. If people could just fucking give me a break. Uh, uh, oh, excuse me. Why don't you ask me what kind of gin do I recommend? The only gin that I've had that was really good is Tangeray. That's what I used to drink years ago. But it's way too expensive for me to drink anymore, seriously. You know, back when I used to make tons of money on YouTube, I could buy Tangeray like, and, like nothing. Now I can't anymore. <clears throat> but Tangeray was always my favorite. But an alternative was Beef Eater Gin. Beef Eater is also pretty good. No, no, no. I never said not to talk about Emerald 7. You can talk about Emerald 7 if you want. So just don't make the entirety of the stream about him. Whoever, whoever it was, was a very nice person. Did it the right way, you know. Dropped a ton of subs for all of us to benefit from. And didn't make the streams about them. And now, come February, it'll help me out a ton. <clears throat> and, uh... You know, it was just a very nice person, a good Samaritan. Very nice. How do I take it? Uh, I always do like a gin and tonic or... There's a, a bunch of drinks you can make with gin, mixed drinks, but I don't usually... I just do gin and tonic. Speaking of which, I think coming up, uh, some of the subs are going to start expiring. I think it was about the middle of December... When Emerald 7 came into the stream and started gifting subs. <clears throat> if I remember correctly. So probably another week or two and that's it. The subs are going to all expire. What? I pressed dodge and the wolf bit me anyway. I'm trying to attack the wolf, but it won't let me. It's being very stupid. They won't let me. Dude, they won't let me hit anything. He was actually pretty tough. Compared to the others, he was actually quite tough. <clears throat> Alright. Alright, I just got a dollar from a troll who earlier was being nice, and now they're basically saying that I hope that I die. What a nice person. Negative, 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 negative. Okay. 
What a nice person to say that. Well, thanks for the dollar, stupid. Gee, thanks for the tip. Why can't we be friends, says? I'm trying to think of who your first main detractor was. Was it Steve Jones? Was there someone before him? I say Steve Jones was the first main one, but then that guy, Naughty Nightwear, who apparently originally started out as a fan, became a troll because he was basically being an asshole, starting up problems with the community, so everyone shunned him. And basically, he got excommunicated from my fan base. And then he started, he was the one who started up DSP Cult Leader on YouTube, a channel that basically tried to say that I was a cultist. And I was, in, I was uh, bringing, indoctrinating children into my cult so that they would follow me and, and watch my, my content and give me money and stuff. Which is hilarious is back then, I didn't even have any money. Like, I didn't accept donations. There was no way that it could even have been said <clears throat> that I was trying to get money from people because I, back then I didn't accept anything. So it was just a complete idiot. This is a complete fucking asshole. And, and then who knows? Maybe later on that guy became Fred Fox. See, here's the thing. I will agree that people with an online following could almost be seen as a leader or even, like, in a lot of cases, a cult, right? They, they call their viewer base by a name that seems to be a unifying name that, that makes those people feel like they have an identity, right? Because they're a part of this thing. They're part of this greater entity rather than just a viewer or a fan. Now you're part of the the army. You're part of the what are they called? What is Jake, Jake Paul, Jake Jakester, Jake or Paulites or something? Whatever they call them, like they all have names. What's the name of the PewDiePie, the Bro Army, or some stupid shit? So they do that, and it basically makes you feel like this cult mentality, like you're part of this group of of people who have something in common because they like this personality on the internet. I've never done that. You know what I mean? Like, I've purposely never done that. Because I feel that that degrades my viewer base. Um, and even though a lot of people have complained over the years and said I should have done it, that I lost, missed out on a lot of opportunity, while everyone else was naming their viewer bases and treating them kind of like that, I never did that. Um, <clears throat> you know what I mean? I never... I never I, that's just silly. Not to say there haven't been good ideas, like, there's a really, I mean, there's a really good idea for kind of, like, a slogan or something I may use moving forward this year. I have to think about it and try to work on it, but it would never be like, you gotta be a part of the army, you gotta be a part of the group, the cult mentality of people who like my stuff. No, I would never be like that, it's so fucking stupid. It basically preys on the weak, I really do, I feel it preys on the weak, the weak-minded. Oh, I want to be a part of something bigger than just myself. <clears throat> so I need to watch the most popular people and be a part of their group or whatever. And I think that's really stupid. <clears throat> yes, remember remember Swaggins, the philanthropists? When we were joking in the previous years about making a group of us, we'd be the philanthropists. <laughs> okay, I guess that's as much as I can do. The resources I have, that's as best I can do. Okay. Alright, let's see how this goes. Let's go get this fucker. <clears throat> Yoshi no Lover says he hates the naval battles in this game. It's hard and annoying. Surprisingly enough, the naval battles in Assassin's Creed 4 were much better than in this game, in my opinion. Like, I appreciate them being in here for a variety of gameplay, but I think they could have done a lot better. Like, they already did better in 4. <clears throat> Yeah, here we go. Can't do it at the moment. What the fuck? Why? I can't see! Dude, I can't see anything! What the fuck was that? Wow, great fucking camera, you stupid game.
Dodge that. Nice. Now where's the cultist body? Uh, it's not here. Maybe you don't confirm the kill? Maybe you don't confirm the kill when you do it on a ship, because his body, I can't do it. Look. That's him right there. They won't let me confirm the kill. Let's see. Yeah, that was him. Okay, good. <clears throat> Who do I think the Ghost of Cosmos is? It's gonna end up being like fucking Socrates or something. It's gonna be a character we know. I guarantee it. It's gonna be a character we know. It's not gonna be a big surprise. It's gonna be, or not, yeah. It's not gonna be like, oh, I don't know who this guy is. It's gonna be someone who we never would suspect will end up being the Ghost. I'm telling you. Idiots. I wasn't trying to do this, by the way. She just started doing it by herself, so I was like, alright, whatever. I didn't want to climb there. didn't take the shield. Instead, she just fucking completely whiffed. <clears throat> I've got the beast in my sights. Gotcha. I had 100% health, then to zero. Instant replay, please. Very fucking realistic. I should have been able to kill the cultist because I should take the shield away and then fire the fodder. But instead, I go to do it and she goes eh, and attacks thin air and doesn't take the shield away because the combat engine sucks in this game. Stupid shit. Very stupid. <clears throat> and of course, before someone says, oh, well, you should have targeted the cultist, you can't. There's no way to properly target anybody in this game. That's one of the major problems with it. What? Done. That's how it's done, right there. Okay. Yes, 44k Panda, we really do have this many subs, but they're all gifted. I mean, probably about, no lie, 1,200 or more of these are gifted. And they're going to expire. What's going on here? What the hell? Uh... You got knocked the fuck out. These men look like they need the I can't hit it. <laughs> Every time I go to do it, the camera fucks up. Every single time I go to do it, the camera screws up badly. was the alpha. Finally. Christ. <clears throat> oh, 
See how he likes this. Interrupt that shit. Oh, oh. Kick him into the lava. Oh shit, I wonder if you can kick him into the lava. That would be badass if you can. What? He wasn't even facing me. What the fuck was that? <clears throat> Can anyone actually explain that? I shot him with a headshot predator shot and my body spontaneously combusted. My body spontaneously combusted. No explanation. <clears throat> what the fuck? Uh... Anyway, thanks Shenanigan for a 15 month resub. I appreciate that. Uh, uh, huh? <clears throat> okay then. I don't even know how to comment. I don't. I don't even. <laughs> Time for your final headshot. Oh! Body explodes. <clears throat> okay then. <sighs> this looks familiar. That indeed that is. Tell me. Oh my god. All right, so hopefully, if I take over this fort, this will unlock the next uh, cultist. Because the bottom line is I got an hour left to play, and I have four cultists to kill. So I don't know what's going to happen here, but it's taking fucking forever, and it's pissing me off at this point. <clears throat> I don't even know if I had to do the, the, the quest line I just did. I don't even know if it was necessary, or if it was optional or what. Because if it was optional, I wasted my time. I wanted to fucking do, you know, the, the cultist stuff. <clears throat> The stupid naval combat sucks. Like, if the whole left trigger, then it's either R1 for flame, R2 for arrows, or just uh, release left trigger and mash on R2 to throw javelins. It's like really stupid controls. <clears throat> and now for something completely different. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? <sighs> About the very end. First we get the guy, I shoot an arrow at his head, and I spontaneously combust. Now I get stuck in a tree. Come on. <laughs> We're at the very end. Come on. Fuck you, you fucking piece of shit fucking tree. Fuck you, you fucking kill me. Chop this fucker down. Alright, I guess not. Alright, let's finish this. Come on. This is ridiculous at this point. Hello to Blake Shady, who says they're a new viewer and asking what's good. What's good is I can finally finish this game. I got one naval battle to do right now, and then I can kill the final cultist. And that's it. We're done with the game. So let's do it. That's what's up. Come 
almost done. We got him. We got him. Nice. Very nice. Took an ass out quick. Good shit. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? What the fuck is going on? <laughs> Yo! Seal clap! Because <laughs> whenever I clap on stream, it's a seal clap, according to my detractors. <laughs> yes! Yes! What the fuck was that? <laughs> oh my god. What in the holy fucking hell was that shit? The ship is launched into space. We launched the fucking Hydra off to the moon. What the fuck? Oh my god. What? What is happening today? <laughs> The sh it was launched into the sky. Oh my god. <clears throat> but now I don't know if it worked. I don't know if it saved it, but I don't think it saved. I think he died, but then I died, so I don't think it saved it. I think it fucked up. <clears throat> Watch, I think I gotta do it again. I think it fucked up. Yup. I gotta do it all over. I gotta do the whole thing over, even though I did nothing wrong. I gotta do the whole fucking thing over. <clears throat> wow. This is fucking lame, dude. I gotta do the whole thing over again. <clears throat> this game is a fucking piece of shit. When this game is good, it's really good. But when it's a it's a fucking piece of donkey shit, man, is it a stinky piece of donkey shit. I mean, what the fuck? <clears throat> Thank you, Trey, for a dollar tip. I appreciate that. This sucks. I got 20 minutes. So now I gotta kill this guy in the boat, go find the final cultist, kill him, somehow upgrade the spirit to all this in 20 minutes. Because the game is a piece of shit. Come on, man. It's a piece of fucking shit. God. This is fucking trash. Now I gotta turbo it. I got to rush massively to try to beat this in 20 minutes because the game sucks. <clears throat> I don't know what the hell caused that. Was it because... I think it was because the other ship... Remember their ship rammed it from the back by accident? So I think what happened is it sandwiched the two ships together, causing the ship to launch into the fucking sky when I was trying to get the guy with a headshot. And it glitched everything out completely. <clears throat> that was a lot of cultists to kill, man. That was a lot of assholes. Oh, I am the final cultist. Now, I told you, it's going to be someone from the game for sure. It's going to be like Socrates or the fucking... I forget his name, the dude... Who's, who's like, you know, has sex all the time. That fucking sex pot character. It's gonna be one of them. They're like, surprise, it was to be all along, bitch. <clears throat> and they're gonna have four apples of Eden. They're gonna be juggling them. And all kinds of bombs and shit will be blowing up around. Lasers will be raining down. It's gonna be the craziest, most epic thing ever in the history of video games. Coming up right now. It's gonna be great. Get ready. Cassandra! <laughs> She stabbed it. Wow. Any storm. She fucking stabbed it. How did that work? <clears throat> she stabbed it and it actually worked. Uh. <laughs> okay then. That's it. Well, ladies and gentlemen. Whew, it took me three months. 
should go through the game and do all the three different quest lines and finish up the game. I certainly hope you enjoyed it, even though I'll be honest, the game does definitely have shortcomings. I really enjoyed Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I liked the fact that there were basically three different things you were doing. You had your own storyline with your family, the cultists, and then the mythical creatures and the Atlantean uh, plot line. I enjoyed it a lot. I hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough. That is finally freaking it. After over three months of me playing the game, stick a fork in it. In fact, to the day, this game came out October 5th. It's now January 5th. It's done. Three months. Done. 60 hours in the books. Assassin's Creed Odyssey has been completed. Thank you guys very much for an awesome playthrough, whether you watched a long live on stream when you could, whether you watched on demand on YouTube, on DSP Gaming, however you watched, thank you very, very much for watching. And until next time, whenever that may be, I guess there's not going to be an Assassin's Creed this year, maybe next year. <clears throat> Peace out. See you later. And of course, ladies and gentlemen, to end it, since we're done, we're done. Until next time, assassins, even though there were no assassins and no Templars in the entire game, goodbye, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. That's it. Peace out, everyone. Thank you very much.